ain't my friend and I ain't your friend And I will never tell you cause I Man bodies hurt. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Brothers two man five bucks. Lucas is a homosexual style person. I don't know what that means. Poor George Lucas. Poor George Lucas. George Lucas. Now what? What's this? What happened to the the background, guys? It's black. What whoa, happened? Whoa. Oh no, we fucked up, guys. We fumbled whoa. it. Whoa. We we fumbled. We fumbled whoa. so hard. What happened? Whoa. Oh, that's right. It's it's spooky, man. Over, baby. Hey, give me a second. I <laughs> fucking... There we go. It's spooky month. It's time to get spooky. Yay! Okay. Yeah, I forgot to swap it over last stream, but you know what? Fuck you. Mm -hmm. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Idiots. Eat my dick. Fuck you all. I hate you. Dumb, dumb fucks. None of you, none of you appreciate me. Yeah. None of you bastards <laughs> ever say nice things. All you do is call the police. All you, all you do is complain. Yeah. Oh. No. Stupid. Turn it back. It's too fucks. frightening. Uh, dead on for five bucks. Uh, so today is my birthday. Yay. Hopefully this year something funny will happen. Okay, that in Israel ended with a bang. Uh, <laughs> so see you guys. Uh, and Lolly, learn German and make your ancestors proud. I do need to. German's a garbage language. It is, but I need to. Major Void for a dollar. I've been listening to almost nothing but you guys since last Thursday. I only just finished Cyberpunk stream. Really going ham lately, huh? Yeah, yeah it's spooky month. We got spooky to. Spooky month. We got to. Yeah. Uh, Zodiac for a dollar. Lolly, same showed up for his fumbles last night. Shameful display. Shame. 
Shame. Shame for Road to Sleep. Shame. I got the I got the frame shit sorted out. I need I literally needed the hard reset the fucking the Steam Deck because fuck me. Yeah. Uh, Rotisserie, five bucks. Hey guys, thanks for picking my name. Suggestion for the stream. Also, let the Honda festivities begin. Also, happy spooky month. Yeah. Shut up. That's our uh, that's our copyright. <laughs> uh, I'm sending my fucking lawyer after you. Okay. I'll have you know. I poached him from Matt McMuscles. You piece of shit. All right. <laughs> yeah. He's a fucking professional asshole. Uh, Daddy Joe for two bucks. Show it on my back, Kurt. Can you roundhouse kick it? It won't hurt. It won't. It won't help you out. Oh, fucking. Speaking of hurting, uh, you remember when I hit the fucking thing with a brick? Yeah. Yeah, it's still fucking swollen and bruised. Oof. It's what a fucking month out now. Yeah, Jesus. I don't know what the fuck I did to it, but I think I might be getting too old. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hey, Lolly, have you included Bleach Animu references in your Watchmen video? No spoils. No spoilers for the video. Spoils. The video is almost done. I, I am. I literally have 10 minutes of video, less than 10 minutes of video left to do. I am I am looking at the fucking finish line, and I just, I cannot wait. I cannot wait to be done with it. I cannot wait. And I cannot wait for it to absolutely be raped into the ground by copyright. Right. Or age restriction, or demonetize, anything that usually happens with these big projects. No one, care more, no one cares more about copyright than people that make terrible content. That is true. Remember Chuck Wendig? That is true. Remember Chuck Wendig. Very, very true. Which Watchmen? Both. Both. Stupid. There you go. Stupid fuck. Stupid bastard. What's your favorite of the Silent Hill games? Uh, Western Silent Hill games. Western uh, Silent Hill games? Uh, Shattered Memories. Yeah, Shattered Memories had the, the coolest premise. Yeah. Coolest premise and it felt like the most like a Japanese style Silent Hill game. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Mark nine nine fifty dollars. Hi guys, how you doing? Uh, how you doing, <laughs> bros? Well, have you heard? Uh, showed a guy raped by the green uh, goblin multiple times. Man, you should have seen that fucking boss. He has he has command grabs that go into command grabs that go into command grabs that go into nipple twisters, bro. It was fucking wild. <laughs> uh, Res Parader for two bucks. Uh, the one bad thing so far about Cyberpunk update is my UI mods are broken. I need the E three UI uh, for the game to be perfect. Hope you guys are having a good day. It's, uh, <laughs> It is. It has been a uh, a strange one. Um, full disclosure, I forgot the Steam Deck. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot the Steam Deck. Uh, I guess I left it at the house. Mm -hmm. uh, on top of that, when I went to the gas station to buy drinks, I got a, a Mountain Dew Kickstart and a body armor. Mm -hmm. When I got to Shota's place, the bag ripped open and the Kickstart fell against the ground, <laughs> and split open and and started spraying Kickstart everywhere. Uh, it took like 20 minutes to get the chicken nuggets. Mm -hmm. it, it, has, it has been a night of, of major fumbles. Uh, right before we started the stream, I dropped the microphone. Yeah, the did. microphone almost fell against the ground. So it's like we, we are off to a, a, a strong start with this stream. It's a good stream, man. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, Magus R Control, five bucks. Showed us old lol. Oh god, the clock is ticking. The unyielding passage time continues on. Our time here is growing shorter and shorter. Oh no. Yeah. Uh, useful advice for fear and hunger. How to deal with regular guards. Follow these steps, and if you're lucky, you might not take any damage from the rape man himself. Attack sword arm, guard. Attack stinger, aka his magnum dong. Attack a leg, guard. Attack a leg, slice head off. Rinse and repeat for every uh, single guard you find. You are welcome. Okay. Um, Magus Arc Control for two bucks, but show us to old lol. I might be old, but you can kill yourself. <laughs> uh, show us fumbles passed on to you. <laughs> Fucking fumbloid. Fumbleoid. 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 Fear and Hunger, aka Depression Sim. I played a little bit of Fear and Hunger. A little bit. I didn't play too much of it. That's good. I liked what I played, and it is one of the few Berserk inspired games that really nailed the tone of what Berserk is supposed to be. Mm. Uh, I am willing to go that far. We're like. Wow. It, it. It's just fucked up enough while still giving you the chance to fight off uh, the monsters. Like, the fact it is willing to include stuff like rape and you can be raped by enemies is like, okay, that's fucking ballsy. Yep. It's like, yeah, it, it, is, it is one of those where it's like, you know what, these guys seem to understand that, like, Berserk is no holds barred, but it will allow you to also be that if you figure the game out. Mm-hmm. That's on Gaza getting curb stomped by Israel. Yeah, um, the Middle West is a very interesting region. It's, uh, it's a very interesting region. You know, they they got the the figs. You know, the mm -hmm. figs people like. Um, Among other things. Um, uh, you you know you know uh, you know Mia Khalifa came from from the Middle West. Yeah, yeah. Um, 
Okay, Media Ghost for 219. Uh, are we calling Spooky Month Kentucky Grindhouse now? Because that's a cool name. It is. I, we asked yeah. the Discord bros to come up with one, and Kentucky Grindhouse was, like, unironically a pretty good title. Yeah. Uh, also, good sir, when are you going to review that Linkara horror audio drama? No more Linkara. No more Linkara. No more Channel Awesome. No more Channel Awesome for a very, very long time. No more. Wait, so you can be a rapist in the game? You cannot be a rapist. You can be raped. Yeah. That's not a joke. It's uh, a common occurrence. What do you mean, not a joke? Yeah, it, it's it's the thing where, like, uh, it, it's what made a lot of people who are fans of the game laugh when, I guess there was, like, um, there was, like, fan art of the night chick. Yeah, uh, uh, Jean. Yeah, Jean, or whatever her name is. And she has, like, a fat, dumpy ass, mm-hmm. and then people were like, oh, you shouldn't sexualize her like that, and... All sorts of Fear and Hunger fans are going like, "Did you even fucking play the game?" Yeah, she should only be she should only be sexualized when she's being raped. Yeah, anal bleeding is a status effect. <laughs> it's a good status effect. It's a good status effect. Uh, reminder that Twilight's coming back as a TV series now, meaning uh, modern Gen Z women are about to get horny about vampires again. Right. That's not even like, oh, the arse. Okay. The arc. Yeah, the arc. The arc. Uh, Fear and Hunger is like Berserk, except your background character is going to get raped and murdered. Yeah. Unless you figure the game out, then you can fight your way to being a main character. Yeah, you can be Casca. <laughs> Basically. The literal move that lets you get raped in Fear and Hunger? If you lose. No, but you can be a child sacrifice, so that balances out. Mm. 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 Uh, I can only imagine the hell, uh, eventing so much for the doves. Uh, thousands upon thousands of 200 plus lines of events. Yeah. Uh, would you say Lagarde is like Griffith? Didn't they already name him as an inspiration? Maybe. Like I said, they they, they very clearly took Berserk as an influence. Yeah. Now, it dips a lot harder into like the Lovecraftian aspects where it's like explicitly old gods and shit like that. Yeah. When Berserk's mainly about the god hand, but yeah. yeah. Uh, K Canada for two fake monies. Uh, one of the Discord bros has been uh, has been drafted. Hope he's sock. Yeah. Hope he's okay. Yeah. And everyone getting drafted, bro. Everyone being drafted. Everyone being drafted. No, the funny part was watching all the, like, fucking, uh, all the people on Twitter who, you know, whenever there's a new event, they become the new expert in whatever field the event is about. Mm-hmm. And they were That's going, like, says. they're going, like, oh, well, you know, Palestine's just rising up against Israel, and then people are, like, posting videos of women yeah. getting raped. Women getting raped, them, them killing kids and shit like that, and it's like, damn, that's a hell of an uprising. Yeah. It's like, listen, guys, maybe fat Americans shouldn't be talking about this. Maybe mm-hmm. it's not our territory. We have six billion dollars over there. It's damn well our our territory. We bought that land. <laughs> there's even straight up a king in yellow reference. Yeah, there, there's some very obvious like Lovecraft inspired shit with this game. Now, full disclosure here, we didn't have to replace a planned game with Fear and Hunger because yeah. I lost the Steam Deck. I meant to bring the Steam Deck, which had Fear and Hunger on it. I just forgot the Steam Deck. Shoda Shoda came in with the clutch. Yeah. He saved the day. He saved the stream. He saved it. Uh, Fear and Hunger is basically a game of chance. You have to flip a coin each time you try looting for equipment or opening chests or even fighting enemies. Yeah, it's a mechanic. Yeah. What uh, about we talk about the border? <laughs> oh, no, chat. Oh. Also, Epic is letting people off trying to change itself as a platform. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, everywhere is fucking letting, uh, letting people go. Fucking uh-huh. Unreal just, what, lost like 100 people. And they're gonna start charging movie studios that want to use their engine for like cinematics. Oh, yeah, yeah, uh, that's that's still epic. Uh, but yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, there's a lot of movie studios that use the uh, Unreal Engine. Yeah. For special effects, like a lot. Oh yeah. So it's a thing of like, so long as they keep it solely to movie studios, but we we already know it's like, oh, uh, you gonna, saw what they did. They're they're gonna try to pull a Unity, aren't they? They're gonna try. Yeah. Fucking, uh, Civi does his intros in Unreal Engine. Yeah. The dungeon. Yeah. Or actually, all of his skits. Uh, my nigga Guts will never win, will he? He going to, he going to. He gonna make it out in ten years, chat. Countdown. Kick-ass background. Yeah. The Halloween one was done by our, our good friend, Psy. P-S-A-Y. P-S-A-Y. He, he, do, he do good work. He, he do. do good work. The, the other one was made by another art bro who... When I asked him if he wanted to be credited, he said, like, ah, oh, no, don't worry about it. I kind of prefer to remain anonymous. So ever since, I've just kind of referred to it as that. Where How will he... I ever get into any of the art colleges that are shutting down if I put my name on this? That is true. That is true. <laughs> a lot of them did shut down. I fucking, I forget what branch it was, but, like, yeah. fucking ten of them shut down. And I was like, yeah, I'd be a lot more sad if uh, these aren't people that I hated. 
Just saying. Just saying. Guts will never win in 10 years Berserk wins in tragedy. <laughs> Lies. So it's, it's also reminiscent of something like D&D Session that is super gritty. Mm, maybe, yeah. Yeah, with, with rolls, yeah. Yeah. Should I rename the, the stream Fear and Hunger <laughs> in Las Vegas, Filthiest Realities? Filthiest Realities. Uh, also, word has it, Last of Us Part 2 is getting a remaster, Fear From It, Dread From It. Mm -hmm. uh, in the end, it'll slip come for us all. Well, like, you know, I, I think that'll be kind of the make or break moment for Night Dog. Because it came mm -hmm. out, like, what, what inspired the move, and, and this made me laugh so fucking hard when it came out. Um, there was like a Microsoft convention or some kind of thing for the shareholders. Because it was a shareholders meeting? And they got leaked emails from Sony that flat out admitted that Last of Us 2 barely broke even. It wasn't a runaway success. They barely made their money back. Right. Uh, which I I believed at the time. Well, like I I, I I suspected at the time because you notice they never made any DLC for Last of Us 2. They never released the multiplayer for it. The multiplayer went fucking dead quiet, which yeah. if you have a runaway fan base, you why would you not want to put out the multiplayer? Uh, and they rushed to do a remake of the first game in 2 Engine. And also the HBO show. Yeah. There was a lot about it where I'm like, they're trying to get people to to remember Last of Us 1. Like, guys, don't you remember how great 1 was? And it's like, that's weird. Uh, and then it came out. Yeah, it turns out it barely fucking made its money back and they're freaking out. Mm -hmm. So I, I, them trying to do a remaster of 2 is so funny because everyone's saying the same thing. Why? The game's barely even three years old. Right. The most they can do is make it run at 60 on, on PS5. Yeah. So it's like... That's going to be kind of the moment where you you realize, hey, maybe people that talk about how much they love the game aren't actually playing it. Right. Uh, thanks for recommending Gintama. Uh, Hijikata offering mayonnaise to the cats kind of hardly, and the multiplying chaos of the Shogun haircut sequence, I'd be dying laughing. Oh, it's <laughs> awesome. I love Gintama so much. That's funny. Oh, they ran at 60. Huh. Yeah. So what point? What is the point? Uh, they changed the character models and make them look prettier. Yeah, you, there is a there is a do very they, very do they. there is a very very not insignificant portion of, of gaming culture that are still only only caring about visuals, only caring about visuals. Yeah, and they are fucking morons. PC release? Oh, is it also coming out on PC? Because that would be very funny. That it already came out on PC, but maybe not. Because if people figure out a way to mod the game, oh, that'd be that'd be entertaining as fuck. We're gonna we're gonna have uh we're gonna have fucking Yakuza Kiwami. They're just gonna replace uh they're gonna replace main characters with people from GTA Five. Yeah. You see that fucking you see that video? Yeah. <laughs> it was funny as fuck. He was fucking great. Kiryu is uh, Kiryu is Michael. Yeah. yeah. Good shit. Good shit. Just look behind you. It's the Kentucky Goblins. Oh. <laughs> oh. His beautiful visuals, man. The story's still shit. Goddamn right. Uh, they gave Abby more muscle definition. No, <laughs> make it go away. What happened to Megaman? Did she go emo? Yes. Uh, I noticed the visual oriented players trying to communicate strictly through emotion and charisma figures. <laughs> <laughs> Hold up, what does that mean? I, what does that mean? Like, are they, are they picking, are they speaking, like, with people's names? Like... Oh, I like that carpet. It reminds me of Keanu Reeves. Like, what the fuck does that mean, Kobe? Uh, what? <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> I, I did see. I did see a post rather recently that was like, "Oh, look, they had to. Uh, they had to. Uh, no, they had to uh, fuck up the uh, the release on Xbox of um, what's it called, the uh, Pinocchio Bloodborne. Yeah, Liza P. Uh, yeah, Liza P. They had to fuck up the release on Xbox because it can't handle it. And those two side by side yeah, yeah. pictures and the PS5 looked ever ever so slightly better and i was like oh god we're gonna lose this war <laughs> yeah uh spaz the space wizard for a dollar i uh, did a funny i did infiltrate a nigger ps uh, p5 fans discord two years ago when he was streaming on twitch uh he was reading some sad story about a rape victim i uh, used tts say l rape victim they all freaked out and banned me i'm gonna infiltrate him again and infiltrate him again that sounds like gay ops that sounds extremely faggot. homosexual uh, by the end of it, Hemi's going to be built like dirt from, from Star Wars. If you don't know, he's essentially the muscle coven of Tetsuo from Akira. Uh, Goosium for five fake money. Do you guys follow the Castlevania no uh, Nocturne Cluster? Fuck. It's much more interesting than the show itself. Well, like, I know everyone's going like, oh, ha ha, man, baby, screw you, I got a season two. And the first thing I thought was like, yeah, probably I already had a I was going to say, it was probably greenlit before it came out. Yeah. Usually, usually it is. 
Because it was literally within three days of release, so it's like, yeah, it was already greenlit for multiple seasons. Mm -hmm. You want to know how I know? Because anytime it's not that, uh, they go months before they confirm anything. Yeah. And Netflix is notorious for approving two seasons of something so they can milk it and then cancel it because they don't want to pay anybody anything. Right. Rook is Belmont. He's coming, chat. Yeah. He's coming. That's on Stinky Pippa Feet. Stinky Pippa Feet. You know what's the real Stinky Pippa Feet? I forgot the goddamn Steam Deck. The friends we made along the way. The friends we made along the way who forget their fucking Steam Decks. I dream of a new master, uh, new Vegas remaster. Bethesda's just not doing it out of pure spite, chat. Yeah. They yeah. hate those fuckers so much. Uh, can we stream snipe Pippa? I don't want to. No. No. No VTubers allowed. Other streamers stink. Other streamers don't exist. They're not real. Only this stream is real. We're the only internet personalities. That's why you need to that's why you need to copy everything we say and tell it to everyone around you. Yeah. Oh, we know. The survivor is an objective improvement over Fallen Order gameplay-wise. Uh, has an okay story, so it really sucks they bit off too much with the graphics. Having another of Dirge's race was cool. They, uh... We got a fucking normie buddy, and he said the game was fucking dog shit, and I was like, woof. He's like, I really like the first one, but the second one is fucking garbage, and they ruined the control scheme, and I was like... If how, he's how do you fuck up? I was like, how do you fuck up a control scheme? Yeah, it's like, if he's saying that, it's mm -hmm. like... Uh, last time Pippa streamed, her guest actually nutted on stream so bad yesterday. Ew. What? Uh, thoughts on people complaining on gender and roles. I think you have no gender in your role list in life. I think your gender is that you have no role to get bitches. Why don't you roll this dice and get some bitches? <laughs> hey, cut, hey, cut! Cancel the stream, it's done. <laughs> Cancel the stream. We got it. What do you think is a good punishment for the guys who make Berserk talk uh, videos and talk about guts of the toxic masculine or something like that? To the nut chamber. To the nut chamber. Kentucky Grindhouse is a good series name for this. The best, even. It is a good one. It right? is a good name. Yeah, that, that Discord bro who came up with it did very well. Oh, he won't be coming back. I've dealt with him. And so, is the, so have the lawyers. Yeah. Keep him complaining about that one. No, no responsive. No responsivities. Uh, Camelot and Mercada caused nothing but trouble for Pippa while they leached off her fame. Many yeah, such yeah. cases, chat. Uh, Walter Black for a dollar. Step all in, showed a happy spooky monster. Saw Helmet live this week. Amazing show. I need to listen to more Helmet. Mm -hmm. I keep hearing they're really good, and it's like, oh, I'll make time. Yeah. They're getting the word witches now as if druids, were, as if druids was bad. <laughs> My gender is branded for sacrifice. Oh, he said the thing. Oh. He, he said the thing. Oh. Yeah. My been, gender is blue. Been playing Fallout New Vegas, just finished White Glove Quest, uh, pick at the lame ending. Uh, to give me something to look forward to for the next time, uh, you got this, wash hands. You got this, wash hands. Uh, not on her stream, that's what I call stream sniping. Now that's what, I'll, now that's what I call stream sniping 2023. Okay. Such hits like... Okay, some guy actually had a context to the last of us thing. During the Microsoft vs. FTC lawsuit, it was revealed The Last of Us 2 had a budget of $220 million. The game sold 10 million units, not enough to break even. Okay, so let me do some math here. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, let me get out the calculator. Now, obviously, this is variable because you have Deluxe Editions, Collector's Editions. So, let us break even with a solid 70 bucks. 70 bucks times 10 million... That is 700,000, but of course that's very, you know, well, 700 million. That's very, you know, not taken into account costs from distribution, costs from marketing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very, very well possible that they did not make the money back. Yeah. Uh, Caldera Fabio Cruz, if, if Morgan Blackhands in Cyberpunk 2, who would you want to do the voice? It'd be cool if it was Clancy Brown, Ron Polar, or maybe Keith David. Uh, George Clooney's still alive, right? Yeah, yeah, he's alive. Right. Bring George Clooney in. That's who, uh, that's who, uh, Mike Pondsmith envisions him has. Yeah. Uh, what about returns? That's another thing. Yeah, you got to factor in uh, refunds. Yeah. Uh, first few months, it was like one of the most refunded games. Everyone talks about how Cyberpunk was refunded so much. Like, Last of Us 2 was exactly as. Mm -hmm. I mean, they, they were saying uh, within three months of its release, it was already getting uh, knockdown sales for like 45 bucks. So, 
That was on the recent Exorcist film. If you thought it had the same vibe as those shitty Halloween reboot films, uh, the Evil Dies Tonight ones, then you'd be right. Same director. Yeah. yeah I, I, I do remember seeing it was the same director. I've only seen the singular scene from the movie where uh, the the moms blames the pa- uh, blames the well, blames the patriarchy, and it's like those two priests literally died for your daughter. What the fuck? Yeah. But it's like, oh, they wouldn't let me see the exorcism. Why? Because I wasn't part of their patriarchy. It's like, Father Karras and Father Marin fucking died for you. One of them died that night, and the other one died like ten years later. After being tortured for ten years straight by a demon. Right? For you. Uh, don't forget, 70 bucks doesn't go directly to Naughty Dog, also maybe 45 Exactly. Yeah. There, there's a lot of factors to where it's like, on paper, it'd be like, they oh, well. They're a t- Sony studio, so it could be more. Yeah, could be. The nanosecond Joel died, people started returning the game. Yeah. Maybe, maybe don't do that. <laughs> and the ten million number, it could be entire lifespan. Yeah, it know? could be lifespan, or yeah. it could be it could be just release sales. I have no fucking idea. Yeah, a lot of factors at play. It's not that simple. Uh, they actually made that point. Yeah, it's it's. I I saw the clip and I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? Yeah. Also, the fact that like, they they go to like a Sandinista priestess for the exorcism instead of the fucking Catholic priest. Weird. They even include a Catholic priest, and he's like, oh, the Vatican won't approve this? Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Right. The demon that, you know, Father Marin dealt with, had a history of dealing with, yeah. is saying it's back and possessed two little girls. What the fuck are you talking about if they wouldn't approve it? They go like, oh my fucking God. Yeah. Well, like, if they actually did something and they commented on the fact that, like, you know, the fucking church hasn't authorized an exorcism in, like, fucking 20, 30 years, like, sure. Yeah. Then you could you could have some sort of commentary on it. Uh, other than that, it's, like, just a weird thing to do. Yeah. Uh, it wasn't even about money. It was about fighting an ancient an agent of ultimate evil. Of course. Uh, remember the Korean streamer that cut the Last of Us 2 disc on stream? No. No, I don't. <laughs> I don't uh, remember like most people that talked about Last of Us too, honestly. About the Pippa thing about a ghost, uh, it was her gen mate, uh, Dizzy Dokoro. Don't worry, it was just a part of her uh, about of her character. Yeah, her V Tuper character. She's a masochist. Oh, okay. Okay. The rule for exes to only allow strong willed people in the same room as a possessed person so the demon won't take advantage of them. Well it's like yeah. the hysterical mother in the same room as, as Reagan, what the fuck do you think's gonna happen? Yeah. Uh five buckaroos from rotisserie, uh in a Joe Pesci voice. Jody, you Jew. Motherfucker, I gave you a good stream name and you legally fucked me. Yeah? Yeah? And, and you want to know something? You signed the fucking NDA. Alright? You broke the fucking NDA! <laughs> uh, Captain Mark, give two bucks. Uh, Clint Eastwood and Morgan Blackham would be epic. It'd be a nice voice. Uh, uh, Mike Pondsmith has, like I said before, Mike Pondsmith has a, a visual for what he thinks, uh, or what he envisions Morgan Blackham as in his head. And it's George Clooney from a specific movie, and I cannot remember yeah. the movie, but a, very specifically that George Clooney. Uh, Eco for dollar, hey, oh, lolly, oh, motherfucking shit tits! What are Whoa. we pissing about tonight? Motherfucking shit, cunt. Yeah, there you go. Uh, Major Void for a dollar, so how are you guys dealing with the cold snap tonight? It is chilly. It is, it is definitely chilly. Favorite classic Universal Monster movies? Uh, mm. Good stuff like Dracula. Yeah. Very classic, it's good. Uh... What about Creature from the Black Lagoon? Lolly, would you uh, be locked in a room with a thousand cockroaches, spiders, or show just... And it's like, the the shows, I assume, is like, you know, little kids, so just stay in the corner, you know, mess on my phone, just ignore them. There you go. I don't know. Oh, okay, well, your first mistake is bringing your phone out around a bunch of children. You're dead. You're oh, fucking that, dead. That is a good point. That is a good point. They'd be like, can, can I play Geometry Dash? And I'm like, fuck off. Do you have Fortnite on your phone and you say no and then the next thing you know you're you're talking to God? <laughs> they took your fucking head. You're clean from Batman and Robin? No. Honestly, the Exorcist Believer would have been better if Uncle Ruckus was the priest that did the exorcism. Mm-mm. Do you guys give a shit if I spoil the film's ending because uh, the way it's resolved is so weird? Uh, I don't give a shit. I have no plans on, on fucking watching it. I already got spoiled on the ending. They straight up watch a little girl get dragged into hell. What the fuck? Yeah. Your religion's a joke. That's what I'm getting at. Your religion's a joke, guys. <laughs> <laughs> and no one's there to watch the movie. <laughs> uh, cheaply Escape for two bucks. Miles Morales written by uh, the guy who made Boondocks. <laughs> That'd be funny. That would be interesting. That'd actually be funny. <laughs> I got a job application right here. Yeah. Any guitar players in chat? Big Sauce is asking if anyone else plays guitar. Big Sauce. Big Sauce. That's the ending. It's the American. Yeah, it's George Clooney from The American. Yeah. Here you go. 
Yeah, yeah, there you go. Now imagine that that version of George Clooney with the black hand, and that you, you got him. That's the ending? Yeah, fucking, uh... So the, the gimmick is it's two little girls who are possessed. Yeah. And they have, the demon's making them choose which one has to die. Uh, right there, already bullshit. Uh, mm-hmm. And there's a lot of aspects to it that are bullshit, but... Uh, they save the one, because it turns out she was blessed by her mother, who went to the Sandinista priest before uh, the mom died in the Haiti earthquake. Uh-huh. And the priest blessed her, so now the demon can't oh, take her soul. Here's the question I have. I already know the answer because of what you just said, but it's a white girl and a, and a little black girl. Which one survived? I know the answer, but I need to see it come from your lips. What? Oh! Really? What? <laughs> no, it's the black girl. I was going to say... I, I, I had you going there. It's like, no, the black girl survived. The white girl. <laughs> yeah. uh, El Junko I for 10 fake minds. Boys, I'm made it. Going to be studying game development for two years, and I'm going to make a stalker-looking-ass boomer shooter horror <laughs> game. I promise a free Steam key in the future. Love the content. See you. There you go. He's making it. That reminds me of... He uh, got out of the hood. He got out of the hood. That reminds me of uh, that fucking one boomer shooter that's very Slavic influence. I can't remember because it's not a real word. <laughs> yeah. Some fucking, you know... Uh, what would be cool a plot twist if it was actually the priest was possessed and a lot of the movie was just the priest illusions? Oh, it's a twist from all black. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be cool. Uh, you know, if a man performed the exorcism, that little girl wouldn't have been dragged to hell. Rot? Yeah, rot. Yeah, rot, yeah. Was it a woman that performed the exorcism? It was the Sandinista priestess. The, well, the, the priestess, yeah, okay. Yeah, the Catholic priest gets his head fucking bent backwards. But yeah, it's the thing... <laughs> I got completely spoiled on it because I, I just watched the Possum Reviews video and I'm like, I'm not watching this piece of shit. Mm. You know, there, there are more bad Exodus movies than good Exodus movies. Oh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, it's basically because the, the black girl was blessed, the demon could possess her, but it couldn't kill her. Uh, so then it makes the choice for the parents and drags the white girl into hell. And I thought, like, man, like, everyone talks about how William Freakin heard about how they were making Exodus Believer and he's like, Man, I'm going to fucking haunt the director when I die. Fuck this piece of shit. Yeah. You know, again, the guy who made fucking Pineapple Express to make this goddamn movie. <laughs> you fucking kidding me? Word for word what he said. And all I can think is like, okay, that's William Freakin. The the guy who, who was like a documentary filmmaker and was like very staunchly like not religious. I think it was outright an atheist. Uh, and then I think about like, okay, but what about William Peter Blatty, who was the devout fucking Catholic, who, right. who wrote the entire book to be about how, you know, the... The reason the demon could fuck with with Chris was because she didn't have faith in God and it it preyed on her insecurities about that. So it's like he would have fucking shot the director if he if he saw this movie. Uh, Mr. Uh, Skullface Garcia, five bucks Fortnite Berserk collab. Imagine, imagine. Wow. William freaking noted loon. Noted loon. Wait, there's disrespect to the maker of the Exodus? Woo, I'm glad I didn't watch. Well, no, it's uh, William Freakin heard about who was making Exodus Believer, and he's like, that fucking, that fucking asshole? Yeah. Fuck you. Like, he, he didn't like it from day one. Yeah, he has no, uh, he's got no fucking proper experience with horror movies, dude. Yeah. Um, and William Peter Blatty's been dead for a while, but as I said, very devout Catholic. He was donating to, to the church he went to as a kid, literally to the day he died. Yeah. So if he if he saw the movie and like saw some of the plot points in it, like the the little girl dragged into hell, he would have went like, "What the fuck is wrong with you?" Endless trash. Yeah. Like he he would have hit somebody with a fucking baseball bat. Yeah. Original writer wrote three because two sucks so much. Yes. Yeah, and it ended up being like one of the best horror movies of all time. Well, he wrote the book that was the actual sequel to The Exorcist, and then that was made into the movie. So you have Exorcist 3, which is the actual sequel to 1. It's fucking weird. Uh, Definitely by the white lad skin. Yeah, I bet you would. Yeah. Yeah. Best Exorcism movie that wasn't part of the OG series. For me, it's Exorcism of Emily Rose. Emily Rose is pretty good. Mm. It's not perfect, but I like it. Um... If it's not part of the OG series and it's just an exorcism movie, mm-hmm. there's some pretty good ones. Um, I'm trying to remember the ones that I really like. Uh, you know what? I'm going to be that guy. I'm going to be that guy right now. Wreck. Wreck? The oh, Spanish. Yeah, okay. yeah, Spanish Wreck. It's a good movie. It technically counts. Yeah. It technically counts. Better than the American one. Yeah. Blatty literally said in front of Freakin, I don't want to say the devil won about the first movie. Exactly, like... Yeah. I mean, he, he is willing to, to get pretty grim. Exorcist 3 is literally about a fucking serial killer who 
cuts off a black child's head and replaces it with a statue done up in like a minstrel face. Yeah. Uh, like he's willing to go that far, but something that mean spirited for an ending, it's like no, it would be right. one of the parents die to save both children. It'd be something like that. Yeah. Well, Captain America for two buckaroos. The demons wrote and directed an Exorcist movie. Yeah, yeah. right. Yeah, Rec two. Like Rec two is good for twenty minutes. When when the when the special <laughs> when like the the military guys are raiding the apartment and they're just wasting zombies. Yeah, yeah. that was great because that is just such a good inversion of the first movie where it's the the people running the running around. They have no idea what to do. Yeah. Then these guys come in and just fucking waste everybody. It's like yeah, it's pretty good. A true religious zombie movie franchise. Yeah. It is a, it's a spattering, chat. It's a spattering. It is good. It is good. Wreck the, uh, Wreck's not bad. I heard mixed things about three. Three is okay, and it has some funny moments, like, um... So, chat, chat has it right. Three is better than two. It is. Uh, it's fun because it keeps up the found footage thing up until the zombies show up, and then yeah. one of the main characters literally smacks the camera out of a guy's face and goes, Why the fuck are you recording this? And then it switches to, like, a, a cinematic style to where they're not doing found footage anymore. Mm -hmm. And it's like, okay, that's pretty funny. Yeah. Three's on with the wedding, right? Yeah. But she was physically dragged to hell? Yeah. Yeah. Listen, he saw that one movie, Drag Me to Hell. Yeah. He loved it. It was fantastic. That's not... It's that, it, I saw the devil. <laughs> he watched that one movie. I saw the devil. He loved it. It was great. No, you were right. Drag Me to Hell. Is it Drag Me to Hell? The yeah. Sam Raimi one? Yeah. I fucking hate that movie so much. Sam Raimi's a hack, chat. <laughs> fucking hack. Uh, Wreck one, uh, uh, one zombie was a genuine threat. Wreck two, one zombie tar is target practice. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's why the the opening of it's so much fun. Then then the movie goes on and it gets a little. Eh. I saw a Wreck three more of a parody and found enjoyment in that it definitely embraced a lot of the more goofy aspects to it. Yeah, like uh, you have the guy literally reading Bible passages over a fucking loudspeaker and pause it paralyzes the zombies. Yeah. It's like that's pretty good. Yeah. What was even the plot of Exorcist 2? No one knows. Shut up. <laughs> you see the recent design for Mary Jane for Insomniac Spider-Man 2 and a lot of people on Twitter are talking about it. Yeah, people are talking about it, but they, they came out before and said they didn't change the design. Yeah. They just updated the graphics. Yeah. So I'm inclined to believe them. Though her 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 hair does definitely look darker. Yeah. But, I mean, that could be due to lighting. We're, we're literally seeing fucking still renders and I think her, lighting. I think her cheeks are a little bit more pronounced, but, like, it's it's not anything I'm noticing too much. Hmm. Uh, no, no, for a dollar. Have you heard of JF potentially killing his wife? If so, what are your thoughts? That's been a fucking saga that came out of nowhere, so... My wife asked me to drop her off in the forest with nothing. She asked! That's been fucking weird. All right, Jay, whatever you say. All right, Jay. <laughs> I fucking, I, I wish I wish I could remember, but uh, fucking Mike Stoclaza added fucking Jay on Twitter over something. No, that's what it, it was. The Exorcist movie reviews is oh, what yeah. it was that I posted in the, in the Discord. Uh, he added them. It was just that, and it was the fucking movie review. Let me pull up. Uh, yeah. um, let me pull up my photos. Uh, it was this one. It was an audience review where uh, they gave it a four and a half stars, and it was it was a great move that did the original justice. It was the perfect amount of jump scares and terrifying faces that make a great horror film. I really quite enjoyed it, and it made me want to watch the Red Letter the Red Letter Media video on it, because I'm like, God, I hope one of them is just, it like, fucking twitching on the yeah. ground, going <laughs> just, just Jay sitting there silently the whole review. He doesn't want to talk. Jay, Jay, Jay just walks in from off screen, puts a gun on the yeah. table, and just, just lets it. Yeah, Jay Bauman is not the guy who possibly killed his <laughs> no, wife. No. It is it is JF, a yeah. guy who was part of the the IBS crowd for a while. Yeah, yeah. Uh, known Gumper. He, known he, Gumper, yeah. He he wanted to fuck retards to make himself feel smart. That's not even a pejorative. He just flat out does that. Mm -hmm. uh, and his wife went missing. Uh, did not talk about it for three months straight. Yep. And out of nowhere, it's like, oh yeah, I'm gonna talk to the police. It's like, what? Uh. That's right, Jay. That's right, Jay. I killed my wife, and you're next. Ooh. JF did it. We don't know what the fuck's going on. Yeah, we don't know, but it is very suspicious if you wait like a significant amount of time and then go, "Yo, my wife's been missing." Well, more than that, he's also made some like really weird cryptic statements. Yeah. Where it's like, "Oh, I don't have to worry about the police suspecting me." Yeah. Didn't expect to be named the suspect, JF. <laughs> Stupid fuck. JFJ? No, not JFJ. 
Uh, Eco for a dollar. Don't know if you covered this last stream, but did you see that Antifa bastard get shivved? No sympathy? Fuck him. Yeah, the, the dude who got killed in front of his girlfriend, which already is weird fucking shit with that. Yeah, well, he, uh, he got killed in front of his girlfriend. Apparently, she literally didn't do anything. Didn't didn't even call the cops. When the cops contacted her, she refused to name a name. Yeah. And she's gotten 60K in, yeah. in funding, and I was like... Worse than that, she just opened a new GoFundMe. Oh, my God. Yeah. yeah I, like, at, at first, it's like, yeah, the guy... Like, it's shitty the guy got stabbed. Like, I, like, I don't want anyone to get stabbed. Shit hurts. Uh, but, like, you get what you vote for. Uh, the guy definitely leaned that way. But just a shitty situation all around. And now it's like, well, if you're not cooperating and you're actively, like, covering for the dude that stabbed your, your boyfriend and now you're grifting off of it, did you did you plan this? <laughs> did you plan to get your boyfriend killed? So, like, my my whole thing with it is if he was just some lefty journo, I'd, I'd be like, eh, you know, fuck it. You know, that's that does suck because it's like, eh, he wasn't hurting anybody. Dude was a vowed antifa, so that's where I'm mm-hmm. a little, like, Okay, uh, I don't have to save you. Mm-hmm. And that, that's kind of where that Batman nuance comes in of like... But she's not Batman. Yeah. Well, yeah, but you know what I mean. It's like, it's like eh, I don't... Uh, maybe I'll just, you know, look the other way while this is going on. Because fuck Antifa. But, yeah, if you watch the video, there is weird shit going yeah, on with that. Yeah, like, it is. Because I was talking with my family about it, because uh, they were talking about it, and... And it's a thing where where my mom and my dad were going like, oh, well, you know, it's you know, it, these cities are going to shit and all that. And I brought up, like, if you watch the video, notice how, like, the guy stabbing him never reacts to her. Yeah. He literally turns his back to her. Yeah. That's fucking weird. Like, uh, and apparently it's a thing where, like, the guy walked up to him and was, like, you know, trying to stop him or something. I, I'm trying to remember the exact context of what kicked it off. But... When I, when I first experienced it, someone someone just said the guy was a, a fucking tweaker. Yeah, like some some tweaker or something. But it's like you watch the video, and apparently the guy does spit on the chick. But then I think about like, okay, well, situations where there's like a violent criminal attacking two people, mm-hmm. he's usually giving both of them some equal amount of attention. Yeah. Where it's like stabbing the shit out of him, turns to her, shut the fuck up, bitch. Yeah. Uh, and then goes back, you know that that kind of thing. She does not react at all. She doesn't react, and he doesn't react to her. Yeah. That's fuck. That's where I'm like, okay, something's going on here. You think she's a fed? No, I think she benefited from this chat. Yeah, and I know she benefited from this because she made sixty fucking k and opened a second GoFundMe for more money. And yeah, the fact that it's like, oh yeah, we, you know, opened a GoFundMe the day afterwards, made no mention of funeral costs. She didn't even cooperate with the police to find the dude who stabbed her fucking boyfriend. Literally, literally said, I didn't want to give a description because I don't want to play into racial profiling. It's like, okay, so obviously that's not the real reason. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to play into racial profiling, so he was black. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. Well, well it's like, you know, hey, you know, what's the actual reason? What's the actual reason? It's because I, I made a fucking deal to get that bitch dead. He's an assassin. I wouldn't go so far as to say assassin, but it is a thing of like, why were they there at that specific spot at four in the morning? I'm just saying, chat. It's real fucking, real fucking suspect, chat. There's some weird shit. We, weird, weird shit. Are we still talking about JF? No, no. No, no. This is other guy. Other guy. She hired someone uh, to shift her BF. It's possible. We I, just don't know. Yeah, I, I, I would, I would 100 percent fucking believe it. And then you, you make your, you make your money off of a fucking uh, GoFundMe. Yeah. yeah, he's just your boyfriend. You don't have to pay for any funeral cost at all. So no, fuck, you don't. like, you like, you, you don't have to do anything. Uh, you make your money, you split that with whoever, and she opened up another fucking GoFundMe. So even more money. Racial profiling. You saw him. The video saw him. What the fuck are you talking about, woman? <laughs> right. Right. Remember a week or so ago, you two said something about the Ghost Stories anime dubbing uh, was scummy and not approved by the studio. What do you mean? Okay. Yeah. So the urban legend around Ghost Stories, the anime dub, the one that was the, the goofy parody dub, basically, was that the the show was such a flop in Japan that they sold the rights off to a dubbing studio and didn't even give them a script, said, do whatever the fuck you want. That, that's that been the go-to reasoning for why the dub is not even trying, and it's flat out a parody dub. Mm-hmm. Turns out, uh, that was bullshit. Ghost Stories was very successful in Japan. Uh, it was a very big kids show. Some episodes outright beat Dragon Ball Z in the ratings. So that's not exactly uh, lining up with reality. And apparently it came out, uh, the director admitted, the director of the dub admitted, uh, he was trying to pitch it as basically like most extreme elimination challenge for Adult Swim. 
a parody dub of a dra uh, Japanese show that was like more edgy and and more of like you know Americanized humor. Mm -hmm. That that's apparently what actually happened there. So knowing that and knowing that the guy lied to Adult Swim and was trying to like shit all over this show that he basically just got the rights for for you know the sake of a parody. Yeah, that's pretty fucked. That that is pretty fucked. Yeah, and you know uh, shit wasn't widely available, so you can just lie your fucking ass off and no one's gonna fact check you. Yeah, Scambully Reviews talks about this whole thing. Yeah. yeah. Uh, from the GoFundMe, uh, from the oh, sorry, from the GoFundMe, immediate needs are to offset the cost of working class people taking time off of work to properly mourn. Uh, the GoFundMe is at seventy three k, and someone donated one thousand one hundred eleven dollars. Oh my god! This bitch killed her boyfriend. <laughs> he tried to shell over, but he still kept some of the plot points in it. Lol. I mean, like he doesn't have to write a new story there. Yeah. You know, just keep the same animation. Yeah. Uh, if you don't know, Stephen Foster, who wrote the dub, has his own YouTube channel, and he does respond to questions. Yeah. Jokalizers get the wall. They deserve it. Uh, thoughts on Director's Cut of Exodus 3? I like the theatrical ending. I like it, where mm -hmm. it's just a, a balls-to-the-wall, like, here's a pissed-off demon. Right. and And it's not just pissed-off demon in the way that we know it, where, like, stuff's flying over the place. It's like, I'm going to throw you against the, the fucking roof and rip the skin from your body. It's like, oh, my God. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, comp I compartmentalize the whole ghost story situation as in hindsight, a legit hilarious dub made by scummy people, so I enjoy the dub, I hate the dub writer. Yeah, I mean, it's like, there's nothing you can do about it. It's yeah, said and done. Do about it, other than just bring it up and, and let people know that, like, hey, the, the first thing you're going to find if you ask anyone about this is explicitly uh, a lie told by the, the dude who fucked everything over. Yeah. <laughs> How are you guys going to play Fear and Hunger? The Harvest Man is near. Yeah, we, we might, we might. We might be playing a little, a little bit. No. We, we might be playing. We might be playing a little bit of video games. Any one of you remember Woolen Warriors, Cartoon Network bastardization version of Thunderbolt Fantasy? You mean Shaolin Warriors? Actually, no. It might have been Woolen Warriors. Vaguely. Still funny dub though. Last day, like it, it, it is like, what? Fucking almost thirty years now. So, no, not thirty. Uh, nah. It was like fucking. Oh, Definitely maybe 20. maybe closer to thirty. Maybe closer to thirty. Yeah. I mean, it's been so long that it's like, eh, what what can we really do? You Fuck use, it. You guys using the censor mod like cowards? Uh, you can't censor on the Steam Deck. Yeah. <laughs> so full full dicks out for Harambe. Uh, if it looks, <laughs> if it looks. Uh, Lord purpose for all. I'm gonna fucking say it. Brian ironically deserved it. That stated, avowed anti So yeah. It'd be one thing if he was just... Keep that same energy when someone on your political spectrum gets stabbed, chat. You need to remember that. Because it's going to happen. It's going to happen, but as stated, if he was just lefty journo, yeah, it's like, it's fucked up. You know, you can you can do a little bit of schadenfreude. If, if, he, if he was, like, full-blown Antifa, and I know his girlfriend's full-blown Antifa, it's oh, like... Oh, for sure. That's where I'm like, nah, nah, dehumanize she's the grifting, fuck out of him. She's grifting off of his death, bro. Of yeah. course she's Antifa. Uh, Warrior Statue 33 Born Again for a dollar. Drag me to hell piss me off. However, I do agree. Gypsies are spiteful and take absolutely no accountability for themselves. Okay, you're 100% correct, but that ending fucking sucks dick. Uh, Hovik Arnia for 100 fake monies. I've watched the Berserk 21 hour video like 15 times now. My favorite part is the schnoz sound. <laughs> <laughs> you good, bro? You good, dog? <laughs> Fucks up, homie. Uh, I don't like the Epstein Pixar movie. That makes me feel bad. Okay, from what I could tell, the guy who got stabbed saw the black guy go up and start breaking into some car. Then the stabber took some offense to that, stabbed him, then just left the strangely unreactive girlfriend with next to no mind paid her to, uh, to her whatsoever. Uh, then there was a black chick that came by and said some things may have been affiliated with the stabber, and then, well, yeah, rest of the mystery. <laughs> I haven't seen anything with the black chick. So, drop the money off down the street. Okay, let, let me let me break this down to a timeline. Guy who got stabbed saw some dude break into a car. He goes up to confront him. Stabber gets pissed and starts killing him. Yeah. Huh. Weird. Weird. We're going to abort game and try again. Yeah, we're going to try again. Someone in chat says it has a really, really bad habit of crashing on Steam Deck. You better fucking say psych, you motherfucker. Worst Halloween movie of the franchise? Oh, God. Get a fucking dartboard. Yeah. 
Yeah, there's a lot of not good ones. There's a lot of horrible ones. Uh, we'll say Halloween 3 gets a really bad rap. And if it just wasn't attached to Halloween, it'd be a good movie. Yeah. Um, He didn't confirm. He just looked at him. He just looked at him, and the guy started stabbing him? Yeah, that, that's what I heard. That's what I heard. He literally just looked at the fucking dude, and the guy came up and... That's a fucking hit! Yeah. Uh, Swift <laughs> Creeper. Game. Swift Creeper for 10 bucks. Oh, uh, yes, the good old lefty. Either they're so morally bankrupt to use their death as political leverage, or they're actively a shitty person that orchestrated it. Personally, I think Occam's Razor. I think Occam's Razor. Yeah, Occam's Razor. I think it was a hit. <laughs> yeah. Well, it just needs to be renamed to stop the crashing. Ah, so do we have to play this in desktop mode? Might have to. All right, chat. Uh, can you can you walk me through fixing it, and we can try to fix it, or like link me a uh, thing yeah. for it? I was not aware of this before the stream started. I was also not aware of this. This is why you play this game on desktop, lolly shit. Here, let's try this. The New Exorcist, there's a scene where they get a bunch of different religious priests from a bunch of different groups, such as spiritualists, uh, uh, Pentecostal, etc., and the only one depicted as being a coward is the Catholic who promptly dies. Ugh. I wouldn't be surprised if she took out life insurance on him and, uh, and offered the dude half to stab him. Yeah, straight up. Nothing like that's come out. Uh, it might, if the investigation goes forward, but, I mean, the GoFundMe. Mm -hmm. she, she has made a substantial amount of money in a very short amount of time. Who do you like more, Alphonse or Edward Elric? Alphonse or Ed, uh, uh, Al's pretty good, but Ed, Ed like carries most of that show. I'm not gonna yeah, lie. Yeah. Uh, from the video, it looks like the kid called the guy's girlfriend a bitch or something. They were both drunk for a wedding. He picked a bad time to stand up for himself. I don't even think he stood up for himself. I don't think he did. Could be a rival in Antifa, so he pays her uh, through the GoFundMe to keep quiet. I don't know. The, They'll have to actually bring in the the suspect. Right. From what I understand, he was identified because the the killer's aunt saw him on the video and was like, right. "Holy fuck!" Yeah, I miss art and serious Catholic characters where their faith is so strong, evil can't even touch them, like Van Helsing from the '30s Dracula. Yeah. Is this that Russell Crowe one? The fuck are you talking about, Russell Crowe? Uh, so what happens is there's two families: the black dad uh, who has his daughter and hey, lost his boy. wife. And the white family whose daughter is also possessed. The demon offers to let one child live and the other die. The black dad uh, says that when his wife died, he had to choose between saving his wife or the unborn child. And he chose his wife, but she died. Uh, the parents of the white kid are never told this. They choose her kid, uh, meaning that kid is damned to hell. And the black child still possessed. No one fucking won. Why they make that deal? It's so fucking stupid. Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> he picked his wife, but the wife still died? Right. At this point, it's like, why are you playing along with the fucking demon? You didn't pick your kid, fuck you, dumbass, stupid, poo 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 poo. Okay. Uh, we need to edit a line of code. Yeah, it, it's not that bad. Yeah. Uh, but it has to be done, to my knowledge, I don't think you can do anything like that on the Steam Deck. Uh, from, like, Steam Deck mode. Uh, maybe go to install files? Uh, let me check. Because, yeah, it's Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Fear and Hunger, www.js. Uh, RPG underscore core dot JS. Uh, change this line of code. Uh, it's on line 1872. If uh, parentheses this dot underscore skip count equal 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 zero. Uh, and parentheses. Yeah, I, uh, I have to do it in desktop mode. Let me let me test this out. I was unaware this was a thing. It told me it has the green check mark that says it's tested and works on Steam Deck. Yeah. Well, it works fine on the computer. <laughs> he picked his wife to save, but not the child, because the twist is that the person who is chosen is damned to hell, not the one who is saved. Right. So once again, why are you listening to the demon? Don't, don't, you are a bitch. You are, Valve, you're a bunch of fucking cunts. Why the fuck would you use it as a second monitor? You are monsters. Holy shit. Uh, Swift Creeper, two hours long, showed, are you scared or hungry right now? I'm angry. Yeah, I'm so fucking angry. We're, we're mainly just annoyed. I think you actually have to use the goddamn... <laughs> oh, baby. It has to be in desktop. Oh my god. Yeah, it was fucking weird. The stabber black guy just casually walks past the couple uh, sitting on a bench, starts breaking into a car. The white guy gets off, off the bench with his girlfriend to go approach the stabber who 
was at the time breaking into some vehicle. He gets about halfway between the be uh, bench and the vehicle, maybe 50 feet or so. Stabber comes over, starts shouting and shit, then starts pushing, then stabbing the guy after he trips over the bench as he was trying to back away. Uh, the girlfriend, meanwhile, just stands around watching, not really saying much or reacting until after the stabber finishes up. She then stands there until a black chick comes by and says something like, Oh my god, is he alright or something? Don't quote me on this. And I swear she or someone else also called the stabber out by name. Whole thing, whole thing is just weird. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Uh... Have you seen... Have you been watching the Continental John Wick show? My dad has, and he's, he says... Oh, it's, it's out? Good. Yeah. Damn, okay. That's the thing that baffles me, too. The dad should have realized, hang on, last time I chose someone, I thought I was saving them, but I actually ended up killing them. Maybe I should tell the other family this in case they don't make any rash, rash decisions. Once again, the original Exodus wouldn't even humor this. It'd be like, shut the fuck up, demon. We know you're lying to us. Right. All they've done is prove Father Marin right. <laughs> don't talk to the fucking demon. Right, right. Uh, browse local files. Oh, my God. What a fucking... See. Uh, don't make no deals with no demon. Yeah. Don't make no deals with demon, bitch. Where's protagonist? Anything you've seen? That's hard. I mean, it's like there's so many that are boring. Like you end up forgetting so many of them you just don't like. Yeah. The original Chad Exodus versus Virgin 2023 Exodus. That's a funny thing. When I saw the fucking patriarchy line, I. I literally sat back and thought, are they trying to do old thing always bad with the fucking Exorcist? One of the most fucking, like, acclaimed horror movies ever made? Right. Uh, funny how when they get a spiritualist involved, it ends horribly. Yeah, right? <laughs> What's the protagonist that infuriates you? Estee, there's a lot of them where I just flat out don't remember because I don't want to remember them. It's like... Why would you? Why would you like set aside any time in your head for uh, something that you don't like? Yeah, like. God damn it! I, I don't want to. I don't want to say this because it's like it's way too fucking topical. But it's like, I fucking twenty nineteen Watchmen was fucking agony to sit through because I didn't like any of the characters beyond fucking Looking Glass and Don Johnson, right. and Don Johnson was in it for a episode to the point that. Part of me is legitimately wondering if he demanded to leave the show early because they drop his whole fucking plot point super yeah. fast. There we go. Holy shit. That took longer to find the... Ah. <laughs> no fucking animal game. Old thing bad and horror... Old thing bad and horror isn't always... Isn't always uh, necessarily always unfitting, but it's always uh, corny. That's the thing. You can't do that with The Exorcist. You just can't. Yeah. It's one of the most referenced horror movies ever made. Hollywood would be like, here's a famous IP, now ruin it with your personal baggage, yeah, right? Uh, fuck. How have you guys we... been setting up the game the whole time? Dude, we were under the impression it would just start, fuck. but apparently you have to go in and modify a goddamn line of code. Fuck. Yeah. Did you get it? Yes, I have it working, but I don't have it... It's not satisfactory to me. Is there not an options menu? No. <laughs> Here. No, there's not. Here, let me, let me see. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, here, here. Hang on. Uh, I get it, I get it. Alright, let me tap out of there. Do this. No, it just keeps, it keeps locking me to the window. Fuck. You want, you want a bitch? You want a, you want a bitch? Uh... You can give it a shot. Yeah, I, I shall give it a shot. Because I might be able to... This is the right monitor. I don't know what it's going to show on the El Gato. That is true. So. Uh. But yes, I do have it working. Hmm. We have it working TM. Which is sort of not really. Mm hmm Here. Try blowing on the cartridge. <laughs> I'm going to swap it over real quick so we can see. Mm-hmm. Uh, let us see. I do like that to get around is, uh, Israel's Iron Dome. I guess the Haji's just been using paragliders and shit to get over their border. No fucking clue. No clue. Okay. It's going to show the right screen. Yeah, it's showing the goddamn... Yeah. So if you can get that over here, we're good. But it's it's locked to the window, so... Yeah. 
<laughs> That's an echo? Fuck you. Yeah, that, that was me. I, I fucked with something real quick. Take the echo? No. Okay. Eh. Yeah! <laughs> you <laughs> fucker! Yeah. So you can full screen it with the little button over here. Here's the problem with the full screen. I also don't know what screen's gonna full screen, and if it full screens on the main screen, we're fucked. For the time being. God damn it. Eh. Uh, well, here. Move to screen. Oh, there's an option for that? Yeah, screen one. Screen two. Damn it, okay. Oh my god. Mm hmm. Well, this game got dicks. At this point, chat, I don't care. Yeah, it, seriously, at this point, it's like. At this point, it is a matter of pride. Okay. I have it maximized. They do. They use fucking bad piggy contraptions to invade Israel. Oh shit! Oh my god. You play it in game mode after the after the uh, the code modification. Okay. I don't. I don't know if that's one hundred percent correct. Because don't doesn't uh, doesn't the Steam Deck check the files whenever you're in game mode? I don't know. I'm not even gonna lie. Fear and Dread in Kentucky, starring Shoda. Boomers versus Tech round <laughs> fucking Sisyphus. Why would it tell I you? I have it works? fixed. It is fixed, chat. The problem is fixed. Now it is a fucking TV issue. And why? Why? Why would? Why would Valve? Why would Valve make anything it detects automatically a second fucking monitor? I don't know. I don't know. It's a fucking Steam Deck. It is a Steam Deck. Uh, Lord Purpose for a dollar. Shitty people being killed by criminals. They claim to be saints. Always be funny, and I'll be consistent on this when Tim Pool gets deleted next year. <laughs> also, the GF created GoFundMe for the stabber. Something's definitely suspect. For, for the, the stabber? stabber? Uh, Zachary's for dollars. I hope guys get a happy ending. He deserves it. Hope, hope guys. Thanks. Thank you guys for all you do. <laughs> Thank you guys. Very cool. Okay. Uh, Fight here. Gabe, then I'll fucking gut that fat motherfucker. I swear to God. If I can just get it to fucking grab by the ghoulies, bro, that's base is fun. <laughs> yeah! Sexy. Holy fuck. Oh my god, that was fucking agony! No, just don't just don't crash. Just don't crash, chat. Just don't crash. Ah, ha, ha. It's that easy, chat, just don't crash. I think you missed my super dude, we like at, at the I don't moment think we did, chat. I don't think we did. At the moment we we are fighting hell itself, man. We are fighting hell. Uh, Eco for a dollar. I'm pretty sure the bitch who uh, just stood there with Tyrone shanked him wanted to get spit roast by him and his homies. Probably. There you go. There, there you go. go. Okay. Now pray. Pray. Oh, thank God. Crash in three, two, one. If we hit new game and it crashes, I might let out a, I might let out a blood curdle and curl. My God. Oh, my God. How hard is battle in the game so far? Dude. I don't understand the fucking Steam Deck. I don't. Mm -hmm. It tells us games run fine on it, then we try them, and they fucking break. It's, it's fairly consistent. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty fucking funny. Like, I'm, I'm not even fucking lying. Like, Parasocial, it was consistently the fucking TV. Mm-hmm. Like, oh my god. It, uh -huh. I'm starting to think the Steam Deck isn't exactly the best option to stream with. Remember the, remember the hour-long technical difficulties from doing a call with Flam? Hey, we still take an hour to set up Discord calls because I don't know how to fix that shit. Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't. I don't do Discord shit, so I can't. I can't help. Don't leave the TV on; it will crash the game. Fuck you! I'm turning the TV on, bitch. The agony is immense. They haven't even started the game yet. Yeah, right. Play Runs it. fine on Steam Deck. That's just marketing. Literally, it literally is at this point. I'm starting to realize we got fucking tricked with the Steam Deck. <laughs> they lie. We got fucking tricked. The, the it runs fine on Steam Deck is we played the game and have deemed it, or, or we the developers have played the game and have deemed that it plays fine. And this little motherfucker, this finished piece of shit, lied. I patch Wolf said he had some glitches playing this on the Steam Deck. He could play it. <laughs> yeah, it's like oh, oh yeah, you can play it just fine. Just go in and change a line of code. I appreciate the I appreciate the motherfucker that explicitly went out of his way to go. It is this line. This is what you need to do. Cause finding that shit out sucks. You know I'm realizing something. 
the 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 events leading up to this to where I forgot the Steam Deck, that was telling me something. Because I, I texted you earlier today when we were deciding on what game to play. Hey, you know, pick between Darkwood and, and Fear and Hunger. Yeah. You know, flip a coin. And you're like, oh yeah, I can't flip a coin right now. So I was like, eh, fuck it, I'll do it. I kept trying to flip a coin, but every time I did, it would it would fly off in a random direction. It, it would bounce off the ceiling. It, it hit the TV one time. It was doing everything it can to not decide. And, and I finally realized... That was fate telling us, no, not 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 fear and hunger. Mm -hmm. No, it will not work on the Steam Deck. It will fight you. It will fight you so hard. So, now we know. Yeah. God was trying to intervene. If we're going to be raped, can we at least be a girl? We are absolutely doing Tomboy Night, chat. We are doing Tomboy Night. I'm going to watch that ass get pounded, chat. All right. Uh, Good night. Change her name. John. Her name is John. How do you spell John? Uh, J E A N. Don't you add Fuck an... bitch. Yeah, don't you add an E at the end? There you go. John. John. John, aka Joan of Arc. Oh, they all they all wanted to be Costco. <laughs> she's too white. Yeah, she's too white. She's and too she has white. a bowl cut, chat. Yeah. Jolter. Jolter. You're gonna die a lot. <laughs> you know, at this point, pull the treasure guy. Pull the treasure guy. <laughs> at this point. We earned it. Are you will? Are you are you killing the sulfur god? Yes, chat. All this talk of the Shank Antifa dude, but we cannot forget the hyper leftist A cab dude that was shot dead in his sleep by a burglar two days before the Antifa guy. Best if it was the prophetic Scott Adams tweet. That is true. That yeah. is true. Uh, where is that to the born again for all? I think you only get raped if he plays the Night Lady because my mark hasn't been raped yet. I've heard it's like. Why well, would they want to stick their dick in a man? Pathetic. I've heard it's pretty. <laughs> uh, you know. It's pretty liberal. It's not discriminatory at all. Yeah. Uh, alert purpose for dollar shitty people oh, being killed. Uh, oh, never mind. I already read that one. Seed of the dead? Yeah. She will have the seed of the, of the dead in her chat. Okay. Beep. Let's do this. <laughs> You're advised not to play the game. I'll play what I want. It's Joan, you uncultured fuck. No, it's John, you stupid bitch. You ever Judas Priest album and they just announced a new album? Never got super into Fucking Judas Priest. Really? Yeah. Holy shit. Never got super into them, but uh, Screaming for Vengeance is always classic. You know what, man? You're just sad that uh, you can't do what I what I can do with my fingers. Yeah. <laughs> I don't remember. It's the intro to fucking a Slayer song. This game contains scenes. The girl whose boyfriend got stabbed so that she doesn't want to erase profile, but then blames the stabbing on the fucking slave trade. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, she hired the dude that stabbed him, totally. Uh, he so... Like the Sandman. Ah, you're right. Easy mode. Normal mode. Hard mode. We'll, we'll, we'll go with Terror and Starvation. Yes. We'll do the intro. We need the intro. It's peak. Okay. Uh, and this does give you context on, like, characters and their backstories and mm -hmm. shit. And he can, like, make choices to, like, basically make builds for the characters. Mm -hmm. uh... So, yeah, like, this chick is... Everyone keeps making the joke she's Casca. She's she's like if Casca and Farnese were kind of fused. Mm -hmm. I mean, she literally has a supernatural power that, that makes people listen to her. Yeah. Among other things. Like a tight fucking ass chat. Look at that dumpy... Normal is hard. Yeah, but it's like, it's not hard mode, hard mode. Yeah. Yeah, uh, it's fungering time, baby. Yeah, you don't have to, uh, you don't have to suffer, uh, a single fucking playthrough. Like you do on, uh, very hard. Too lazy to read the prologue for chat? Gay. Hey, I'm keeping it up long enough for you assholes to read. Are you fucking retarded, chat? Can you not read? Yeah, there you go. There you go. Listen, there I see a go. lot of people throw out some hard R's, but if you have a re the reading comprehension of, uh, you know, a toddler, that's on you. You've chosen poorly. <laughs> I'm sorry. She? Yeah. She, nigga. Your devotion was shaken. Break ties and run away or listen to your family. Shame, nobles. <laughs> Behead, nobles. Roundhouse kick a noble baby in the face. I'm multitasking. I don't have time to read. <laughs> Why do you think we're here? She carnies. 
Le God. I saw his tw uh, character get drawn with a dumpy, and Twitter got mad. Yeah, for like yeah. no reason. Twitter got mad because they don't actually they don't actually know the shit that they they get into. Choose not to break ties and to not su uh, supply on a, or and to not supply on items to get dash. It's super useful. It is, but fuck you, chat. Clarification: Did you ever state that she intends to start a GoFundMe for Brian Dowling's the stabbers legal defense? She hasn't yet because her GoFund her GoFundMe is still up. <laughs> She's gonna fund the guy's defense. Right. Oh my god. I can't wait for this new episode of Better Call Saul. It's going to be great. She fucking hired him. <laughs> 100 fucking percent. Well, I didn't know you'd get caught. Bitch, if you don't get me the fuck out of here, I'm a rat on your ass. Don't tell me how to play the game, chat. <laughs> we got a long sword and an eagle crest. Yeah, eagle crest chill is awesome. You're going to die. <laughs> I fully anticipate we're going to die. So yeah, we gotta go save our mercenary leader from no the way. prison. Yeah, ain't no way you gotta be making that shit up. Nope. Uh, food, equipment, or rush. What are you guys gonna do when your character inevitably gets struggle stuggle? Ra rape's just a status element, chat, okay? I picked food. Moldy bread. <laughs> you know it's fucking bad when even the Daily Mail is saying, yeah, this shit's fucking suspicious as hell. <laughs> Alright. Rush, 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 rush. Make sure Lolly gets a <laughs> make sure Lolly gets the dash ability. Lolly will never get the dash ability. Alright, we gotta we gotta get moving. Okay. Tarataphobia chat. The run's over. We're dead, chat. I don't trust that horse, it's dead. Mm. How many screens do you think they're gonna make, chat? We're already two in, chat. We, we found mushrooms and cheese. <laughs> Eat the mushrooms. Okay. Uh. Hey, I know that symbol. I got that on my arm. Oh. Oh. So yeah, if it's not obvious, uh, this this landscape is fucking nightmarish. <laughs> Look at this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, he looks like a, he looks like that fucking dude, uh, that uh, Epo villain, that bad guy. Yeah, oh, I forget his name. <laughs> was it the guy that punched the coach, or was it a different guy? It's the guy that pulled the gun. Oh yeah. Uh, Silly Wonker Sagawa for five dollars. One tip: don't go down the toilet. That is all. The okay. toilet's fun though. Yeah, you don't go down the toilet. Okay. Well. <laughs> if I don't fuck with it, it won't fuck with me. Does the R stand for rape? Yeah. Judge, I find you guilty. Oh, killer. Okay. I'm not going down alone. That bitch hired me to kill her boyfriend, Your Honor. She promised I'd get off too. Yeah. Your Honor, I have no idea what that what that man is talking about. Bunch of dead people. That's crazy. Nightmare. She looks like Maryland. <laughs> okay. And I'm in here for a reason. Yes. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I've never run into this event before. You're dead as fuck. We got sucked into a hole. <laughs> Interesting. Why is why why is Sonic the Hedgehog black and a human now? Because his voice is cool, chat. Why are there so many winter lantern winter lanterns in there? Don't worry, chat. It's fine. Fucked with the capital F. Oh yes, he is. Chat, look, he's gonna make it out. He's making it out of the hood. That was weird. That was weird and unsettling. I want to go home. <laughs> Floor of war. Hey, fuck, look, <laughs> Uh, dead guy. Why would you join the mercenaries? Wait, you got sucked? <laughs> Dessert? The, 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 the dirt seems fresh. Oh, he served in the dungeon. Fuck that man. He's an asshole. Average night out in Stockholm, honestly. Oh, our torch is running out. Hmm? Wait, can player characters in Fear and Hunger get raped? Yes, chat. Yes. It happens quite a bit, actually. 
Oh, fuck. Like now. Uh. You wouldn't hit a guy with glasses, would you? Aim for the dick. <laughs> Aim for the dick. Aim for wait, the dick. Wait, 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 I gotta, I gotta, uh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> give me, give me a sec, give me a sec. Okay. Okay, here. I was gonna say, I'm pulling up the walkthrough. I'm, I'm pulling up what that <laughs> motherfucker told us to do. Here's how you get dash and opening, uh, an opening choice of the game. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. You can't get ripped, but you can do two things. Fuck and centrally summon into a literal meat fusion. Commit necrophilia to get a literal demon, uh, little corpse demon child. Engage in a bunny orgy to restore your mind. <laughs> uh, eradicate for five bucks. Uh, click on stream. Gets a Dr. Sask, or gets a Dr. Squatch 80 HML. Many yeah. such cases. Okay, so attack sword arm, guy, uh, guard, attack stinger, okay, magnum dong, attack leg, guard, attack leg, slice head off. That's a penis? Okay, so... No. Attack! Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> John lost her arm. Fuck! Uh... I, I'm just saying, the game put the torch out for a reason, Lolly. I, you, you, you made this decision. Strat only works for regular guards. Cut his dick up. He has cock armor. He does have cock armor. Attack! Unfortunate, Lolly. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! Oh. Do we already die? Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> You're not making out the hood, Lolly. We did, in fact, already die. Holy fuck. Continue, continue, continue. Going for twosies. <laughs> you made it six minutes. <laughs> that was fast. At least we died, nothing more. That is true. That's a penis. Yeah, we ran into the big dick guy as the first fucking enemy. <laughs> Thank you, Vera. You folded like a goddamn foreskin. Six minutes in, died to an elite enemy. I fucking know, too. Okay. Mortis. Mortis. I'm just trying to find the key so I can save the child. At least they. Oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> At least you waited till you were dead to rape you. Yeah. Terror and starvation also changes enemy placement. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. That makes sense. I fully admit, I played on I I played on the easy mode just because I'm like I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. It is explicitly a pain in the fucking ass. Just run from him, Lolly. He's an elite. Yeah, yeah. Boron, fuck good. Boron, no. Okay. Door broke. Yeah, door broke. Door broke. See, jellyfish man is chill. Yeah, don't let him touch you. Yeah, blue herb. <laughs> I think Greener. Blue Herb restores your mind. It restores your sanity. Your stamina sanity. Pain in the ass. Very poor choice of words. Yeah. Oh, God damn it! I thought I was just enough past him. Yeah. Uh... What tentacles? Did you go for him, man? You got this? I believe in you. Let's go over the head. Fuck it. Yeah, there we go. Sean was victorious. Yay. Uh, let's search it. I'm gonna beat the fuck out of this dead body. Eh. The first, first the horse stick and now tentacles. We're not making it out. Oh, we found a quill. Yeah. Don't get too close. It'll raise your frenzy bar. Yes. Among other things, right, chat? Okay, so don't go there. Don't Nobody go there. told me Yoko Taro was in the game. There we go. Uh. Dong. Heads. Yeah. Ah. Heads. If I just keep choosing heads, I'll never lose. Plate mail. Woo. I think we already have plate mail, though. Yep. We do. Okay. So we, we have, have extra. extra plate mail now. So, so very uh, useful. All right, we gotta be we gotta be very careful and strategic about this. 
You want to know what's what's fucking uh, fucking hysterical? Guess what? The chick whose boyfriend got stabbed couldn't pick the killer out from a police lineup. She chose the wrong one, despite there being perfectly good CCTV imagery of him. <laughs> well, she specifically said she didn't want to name him because uh, it would like play into racial profiling. Oh yeah, so I'll shit. just name an innocent guy. Yeah. It's like she very obviously knew the guy. Mm-hmm. That's kind of the agreed upon thing. It's like, hey, I, I think this chick might have hired him. That bitch. That bitch hired that motherfucker. I'm telling you, chat. How about thee? Give me my... Oh, no. <laughs> One attack. Two attack. Oh, thank God. How about thee? How about thee? Oh, come on. My fiance made a sweater thingy for our dog, Grace, and I know, and I want everyone to know about it. I'm sorry for your dog's loss. How about the... Oh, thank God. Man, that's crazy. Two fights and we haven't even leveled up yet? This sucks. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, if I'm right, you don't earn XP from fights. You earn it from, like, other stuff. Mm -hmm. Among other things, chat. Uh, we don't have much of a choice. We, we really don't. The only thing is, this isn't even the main entry to the dungeon. Mm -hmm. This is a side area. Yeah. Uh, That's what you think. Immersive sim, yeah. It's just like real life. You don't actually level up. You just uh, hope and pray you get something useful. Yeah. I'm going to... Stay very far away from that area where the guy was. <laughs> you shit sure about that? Oh boy. He's a big guy. For oh, you. Come oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Skills, wait. run away. Run. Shit. No, you're dead as shit. Hey, you only lost your arm. Run again. Run away. <laughs> Look, Zoink Scoop, we need to get out of here. Whoa. Stop. You even dodged a single attack. I know, right? Okay, so we are not completely dead. Oh, hey. Eh. Missing your legs now. Yeah. Ow. Ow. Yeah. Fucking douche. He's enjoying this. Brandon Porter, five buckaroos. Hello. You fucking douche canoe. Ah, ah. Da, 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 da. Running is useless if it moves faster than you. Yeah. So he just beat us to death for fun. Yeah. Listen to your legs right. and you most likely got coom in you. Chat, I don't think we could take that dick, chat. I'm gonna be real. So we, we have learned the hard way that, like, okay... Terror is a little a little too much right now. That's a little too mean. <laughs> I am perfectly okay with knocking it down a difficulty. If you have luck coins, you uh, held down shift to get two coin flips. Yes, I don't know what that is bound to on a controller, though. I also do not know. Uh, Yeah, Fear and Hunger. Play the intro. Uh, so fuck, you choose yeah. the same character? Yeah. Okay. Oh, but I think it fucks yeah. us out of... Okay. Uh, it, it just seems to assume it gave it. Okay. Check your skills. Uh, that's not it. Uh, oh. here. Run, defense, stack. Okay, so yeah, it's. Fast stack, tall. Basically the same. So you don't have a restart, and uh, we'll get you. We'll get you dash. Okay. Or oh, this is a bad bitch generator. Oh hell yeah, yeah, yeah. The TG Smurf dude. He do he do make bad bitches. No, not that guy. Oh. Not that guy. Oh. Damn it. Damn it. It won't let me. Fuck it. Guess we're doing mercenary. Fuck it. And his name is C. His name is C. You said mercenary? Yeah, fuck it. Because it, it physically would not let me click off of him. Yeah. Uh... Dun, 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 dun. Personally, burglar. <laughs> yeah, let's do burglar. 
Yeah, we learned lock picking, so there we go. Yeah. That's a bug. No, it's uh, we're using a controller. We don't yeah. know what the commands are to escape from that. You would assume it'd be circle, but it wasn't. Okay. Second one gives you money. First one gives you backstab, so that's up to you. Mm. Is money really important? If you get lucky, I guess. We learned escape plan. Yeah, the elite guards only in uh, the catacombs on certain configurations. Yeah. Okay. All right, straight for your mission. Rush straight. Yep. Okay. That's how you get dash. Okay. I was lucky for two dollars money. Money. Uh, Brent Tor, five bucks. Forgot to put text last time. Lobotomy hitting hard. <laughs> Kino game fellows. Links for the stream. Yeah. It is a good game. Okay. Okay. Yeah. He okay. fast as fuck. Yeah. Found two eggs. And yeah, just fucking uh, like it's a text adventure game and interact with literally everything. Yeah. Treat it like a text adventure game. All right. You know what? We, we already we already have lock picking. We don't need the key, so let's go save the child. He's zooming, yeah. Why well, you know have fox accent? So necrophobic. He's afraid of the dead. He's a mercenary, though. I don't write the rules. <laughs> I don't write yeah. the rules. Uh, and yeah, obviously you can tell there's a lot of Silent Hill influence just from the sound. Yeah. Just like when you interact with shit, it, it's very Silent Hill. Sees backstory. Man, fuck them rogue niggas, bro. Fuck them motherfuckers. So what is it with horror games having S tier waifus lately? Because it's called good character design. Mm hmm. It you're, used to be the standard. Yeah. Your, Look of fears. your character shouldn't be ugly unless you want them to be ugly. <laughs> Merc who's afraid of death, the irony. Most people yeah. are afraid of the dead. Uh, necrophobia, fear of death, dead, and corpses. Phasmophobia, fear of ghosts. Uh. Robdophobia, fear of magic. Better necrophobia than necrophobia. Absolutely. Yeah, rotophobia, fear of sex. Zoophobia, fear of animals. Tetra, uh, teratophobia, fear of monsters. Uh, panophobia, fear of everything. Yep. By the way, uh, our first start, we got fear of everything, by the way. Oh, boy. Uh, also, this is Fear and Hunger guy that asked. The first one. Yep. Part two is even more Silent Hill. Yeah. You literally have, you have the Majora's Mask moon chat. <laughs> Just saying, this is on you. You can get a feel for the character. Let's actually test out the, the strat the one guy said. So it's attack arm, guard. I, I'm going to make sure. I'm going to make sure. Hmm? Yeah. Women characters yeah. need to be a wooga and male characters need uh, uh, need to be giga chat. Simple as. I don't make the rules. Simple as. And okay. that trait means you're vulnerable to undead enemies. Re re reduced evasion and increased damage taken. Yep. Okay. So, attack attack sword arm. Mm -hmm. uh, guard. Ew. Oh, he's jizzing on me. Ew. Get rid of that. Ah, yeah. oh, your dick's weak. Guard. What happened to his foreskin? They put a blade in it, chat. Attack a leg. Mm -hmm. I'll attack that leg. Sure. It's the closest one. It takes a step closer. Yeah. Yeah, Lolly. Here you go, buddy. Heads never fails. It's it's successful 50%. It fails! It's successful 50% of the time. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> Yeah. Grab his dick. You got it at the wrong moment. I did. Yep. He missed that first attack, so you didn't need to uh, to guard. Okay. No, I was gonna say if you go back, you should just uh, you can just continue with the character because you made a save. We could, but I I want to I want. You want to do the knight? I want to do her. I want to do the knight lady. But she only gets raped sometimes. <laughs> no, you know what? Oh, we're too late, homie. Dong, dong. Mortis. 
What's the most you ever lost in a coin toss this entire run? Right. Okay. Should always guard uh, when the enemy gives you a hint. To be fair, the enemy gave him like three hints in a row. Yeah. Carnice, my beloved. Yeah, there you go. Carnice. Blade, arm, then torso. Do not guard, just attack torso after the arm is gone. I don't believe you. It's cranking in my fucking hog. Should have used a lucky coin. I don't know how to make that work when on a controller, though. I don't know what would be our shift. Yep. Yeah, intro. Yeah, so we need to. Just name alone says bad things are going to happen. Mm -hmm. All right. So what the guy said is don't abandon the family. No, no, abandon the family. That's what the guy said? Okay. I don't know what he said. I'm telling you, abandon the family. Okay. I'll go with quickly step aside so we have fast dance. Mm -hmm. Uh... Yeah, break ties. Dun -dun. Takes like two or three turns to do that attack. Are you talking about the one where he uh, went at us? Yeah, the, the, the rush, yeah. Okay. Uh, whenever you give him the chance, just rush after him, okay? Mm hmm. Ask Lolly, what was the uh, indie boomer shooter game with unused Deus Ex movie music? That was Heden. Yeah. Yeah, Heden Bloodright. Okay. Take the rear or spearhead? Uh, I think take the rear gives us the sword. Yeah, long sword and equal crest. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, if you do the other one, you get a, a spear and guards. Okay, shit pushed him, bro. Yeah. Uh, Swift, Creeper, uh, Swift Creeper, five bucks. Fun fact, phobia is a fear of, Ophelia is a love of. Cool mm -hmm. opposites, but also leads to weird shit like autogonophilia, uh, formicophilia, and menophilia. Yeah. Yeah. Bow, bow, it's a rush. Bitch. Learn dash, there you go. E. I like them spears, though. Spears can be good. Okay. Are good. Now I'm going to save over this one. So now we can just go back to this one whenever we want. There you go. Fast okay. as fuck now. Okay, so yeah, dash just all around speed boost. Mm -hmm. Found blueberries. Even more blueberries. Better than eggs. And she is scared of sex. Unfortunate. Uh, very unfortunate. For you. <laughs> Carnice's back Carnice's backstory raped by horses in the menu, right? <laughs> so now we actually have to look for the key, but now we're in a we are in a position to where that's not gonna be as painful. Every enemy you fight is a giant dick. Okay. We need to force open the door. Give it a right hook. You got this. Uh. Attack! Eh. But this door is too strong for you. Oh. Carnace, okay, that's pretty funny. Yeah, someone in chat made it up. I don't know who, though. Just some loser. Some God. Fucking dweeb. Fucking dumbass. We can fix her. We can make her like sex. That's not how this works, chat. Blue herb. Okay. Uh. Moldy bread. Blue herb. Mm -hmm. Ale. Nothing. Gonna save the night husband? No. She belongs to us, chat. Door battle. Door battle. Door battle. Uh, I'm just gonna hold down all these. Heads or tails. Call it. Okay, so none of that. Okay. Nope. Bone Find saw. a bone saw. Pray you don't need that. Oh god. If you learn leg sweep, it breaks doors. <laughs> Many such cases, chat. Yeah, Attack! Just hit in the head. Oh. Oh god. Unfortunate. <laughs> oh god. Yeah. Attack! Blue herbs are for killing body and, and green are for clearing infections. <laughs> Bone saw is ready. It tried to inject something into us. It did inject you. Uh, can we check what the status effect is? Uh, uh, Cause I don't know. Uh, yes. 
Injected by tentacles. Yes. Heads never fails. Yeah. <laughs> I think heads is a 25% success rate, bro. Come on. Oh, we got a small key. Okay, so we have exactly oh, what we need now. Let's get the hell out of here. Better it's literal. squid time. The purple, bu the purple bubbles mean poison. There's a way to check it. But yes. Uh, green herb, thick poison. Good. Ugh. Eh. Also, I don't... I don't think it's poison that it gave us, because it has its barbs. Okay. Oh, it's tapeworm? Okay. So hunger depletes at double speed until you drink worm juice, which will poison you. Yep. And we gotta get inside before fucking... You got worms! Yeah. Yeah. We gotta get inside before the goddamn fucking... Yeah. Come, shorty. He injected you with cum. Oh. I think if we go this way, this is where the kid's at. I'm brave of you to fight another door. I know, right? Uh. We are going to run. Hey, yo, that door. That door imposing as fuck. I thought you were going to fail the runaway for a second. I know, right? That would have been funny. Smithers, release the hounds. All right, sir. <laughs> it is just a single hound. A singular, sad little hound. So we have the Book of Fears. Yep. 2 O door. <laughs> it's a hard door, chat. It's a scary door. I don't want to fuck with that. Carney's be like, I want Guts to fuck me, but he's scary. No, it's but sex is scary. The game just hates you. It really do, chat. Yeah, we're already starting to feel hungry, okay. Yeah. Uh let us drink ale. Yep, you'll lose uh you'll lose hunger at double the speed. Which is very unfortunate. Especially so early on. Blood Meridian game would be would be insane. How much how much would actually be game? Yeah. Alright. Trying to get comfy. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Oh. Was that a bark? Yes. Uh, you don't want to stay in the starting area for too long. Yeah. You really, really don't want to stay in the starting area too long. You hear a faint whimper. Let me out. Cage is locked. I saved the child. Yeah. I'm a hero. Raped, battered, beaten, too weak to open a door. That's not a good start, bro. You don't know that. We got tinder boxes. Carnice is hungry. She got that dog in her chat. She got that stepped horse. on a rusty nail. Yeah, you got. She got that horse in her chat. There we go. Would you like to use the tinder box? Do I want to use the fucking torch I have? To shreds, you say. You're starving. <laughs> You're bleeding. You have an infection. Yeah, I think you my got foot's tech. infected. Well, you, you got you got tapeworm. <laughs> You're already dead, Lolly. I know, right? Lolly! Better patch up the, the infection. How? When you... When you unpause this game, you're going to get raped. Alright. So, attack sword. Uh, girl. Stack, stack on copium for the kid, just trust me. Okay. Um. So... so the, the girl's afraid of sex, too? I don't know. Both guard. So it's gonna attack with the dick next turn. Okay, next turn. Yeah, the little girl's even going just guard. Oh no! Chad, it's winding up. It's hentai, and it's odd. Lolly, don't Fuck trust it. the little girl. She's never been in combat before. Fuck your dick. That being said, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure you're fucking dead if it, <laughs> you better win this. Heads. 
Hit the girl, not me. Ah! Brown girl! Holy shit! Fuck it. Grab his dick and twist it. Ah! Ooh, unfortunate. <laughs> That's gonna be one for the history books, Kyle. Look, girl, you need to contribute. She's a girl. It's throbbing. Search his fucking... Nigga just got his circumcision half off. Attack the cleaver arm. Guard. Attack the stinger. Attack the, the torso. Guard. Attack the torso. Remember the second turn, the guard will do the coin flip attack every third turn. Yeah. Yeah, I got a ring of the still blood. What does that do? Make the little girl your heel slut. Chat. Prevents bleeding. You are currently bleeding. That alone. would be very, very useful to have. Take off your whore. Take off your whore armor and put on the ring. Okay. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. So leg guards. I want to read the description of the leg guards again. So here, little girl, you you get to you get to wear them. Okay. Fuck. Right, it won't so let doesn't me. work for her. Uh, here. Okay. I guess it's just like permanently on. Okay. Yeah, it said, like, prevents injury to the leg. That's fucking bullshit. The leg, not the foot, Wally. Okay. Attack cleaver arm, guard. Attack stinger, attack torso, guard. Come back. I come. I take a cold shower and I come back to a giant with its cock out in front of a child. It's David Bowie's Labyrinth all over again. Hey, it's your fault for looking at David Bowie's cock, chat. Now you can't take the ring off? Well, at least we're not bleeding. Yeah, we only have, like, what, fucking eight health and we were bleeding? Not a good time, chat. We are infected, though, so, uh... <laughs> at Raw least meat. you got that, uh... At least you got that bone saw. No, we're not! That actually prevented our infection, too. Oh, shit, nice. Okay. Okay. Alright, little girl, you have to trust me. I don't know, you seem like kind of a shitty knight. Take the lead. Little girl, take the lead. Yeah, take the lead. Take the lead, little girl. Take the lead. How, how, you think you're so fucking good? You want to go my mouth off again? Yeah, the ring ain't coming off. I'm, I'm okay with it not coming off. It seems like it's only a, a net benefit that it stays on. For the time being, absolutely. It's written, save us in blood. Hey, little girl, I know a world. I know the world seems cruel and unfair, but I just want you to know it's going to get so much worse. Okay, white vial. Uh, works as an ando for poisoning. Okay. Yep. A woman with no bleeding? Finally, a sensible woman. Blue herb, blue herb. I'll say you can pop some blue herbs. And yeah, we can. I actually I need to heal the, the child, little, too. Little oh, my girl, God. Little girl might need a little bit more. Uh, little girl, um... There's your reward for not getting the little girl raped. Walk, I walk back in the room, and all I hear is David Bowie's cock. That's right, Jay. God damn it! You don't bleed though, so you're good. <laughs> but you're going to you're going to stab your foot every time you walk on that tile. Okay, red vial. The ring isn't awful, but equipping it stops you from equipping arm guards on uh or, or later on the salmon the, the sal the salmon snake soul, which prevents all limb loss and infection. That is true. But we need to get to later on right now, chat. Yeah, we'll worry about later on later on. Got a bear trap. If you use it, it'll drop it. Uh, you'll drop it on the ground, and the monster steps on it. It'll cripple them. Yep. Carnese is weak. Eat tomatoes. Jeez. How are you still hungry? Did you already eat your? Yeah. Okay. Where's your blueberries? Here, eat the bread. Eat the moldy bread. Now yeah, we're not eating the rotten meat. Three silver coins. Oh god, I'm having a flashback. <laughs> that was literally the reference. Yeah. Okay, uh, we're not gonna go down there just yet. Courtney's will always take two times damage from from horses. <laughs> Many such cases, chat. All right, child, baby. I'm still hungry because of tentacle worms in me. Yeah, but we don't have the cure, chat. So she needs to suck it the fuck up. Yeah, we gotta we gotta drink worm juice. Thing is, we now have the antidote to poisoning, so if we can get some worm juice, we'll be fine. Yeah. 
As long as you don't get, as long as you don't meet that enemy again. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Okay, so I believe we have explored enough of this floor to go down. We now have the little little baby girl as our friend. Mm -hmm. uh, little baby girl, I am fucking begging you. I beg you. Evil, evil Mike's the clause to be like, that's wrong, Jay. There's a well here. We're not gonna, we're not gonna do that. Jump down the well. I, Jump I, down, make a save state. Jump down the well. Yeah, uh, can we? I don't think we can. I think we might die. Read the bookshelves. Click on everything. Yeah. Blueberries. Yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah, you should be clicking on the fucking bookshelves. Got the dagger that's just nearby. At least I think it's nearby. Chat doesn't even know what the fuck they're talking about anymore. Chat, that's not a dagger. That's a stick. You, you silly, you silly boys. Yeah, saving is in books or bids, which I don't think All right. we've come across any. So, little girl. Oh, I was gonna give her the stick. Can we equip the stick? We cannot. Okay. The stick is for. Holy. Maybe it was a mistake. Stop asking us for advice, we aren't real. I haven't asked y'all a fucking question! Dude, what the fuck? Uh, Winterland $5 is a mod for fear and hunger that gives you unlimited ammo and essentially turns this game to a roguelike Doom Slayer simulator. <laughs> it kind of goes against the, the fun of the game, though. Yeah. Uh, jump down the well and you can unlock the catacomb door from the other side. You should also be able to climb uh, back up the, the corpse pile to get out of the well. That sounds like a coin toss, Chad. <laughs> You think you got uh, him? You think you can take him? One guy's just screaming, "Run away!" <laughs> you think you can? You think you can cut his arms off, whack his his torso in half? Chad, is that a woman? Chad, I need to know if that's a fucking woman. Okay. Hit the torso. Okay. Little girl, guard. There you go. Okay, so yeah, just yeah. Fair enough. Uh, cloth fragment. Yeah. Super runaway gang. Oh look, there's a toilet. Save the game, then jump in. <laughs> we need to find a bed. Uh, throwing dart. Oh, cool. Red vial. Cool. Cabbage. Oh, thank God, we got cabbage. Low girl, you shouldn't be looking at this. You should, you should. I'm a hungry. <laughs> Give us the grill, you prick. Let's not talk to that thing. We're not gonna talk to that thing. Carnese begins to feel hungry. I hate it here. I wanna go home. Why am I even here? <laughs> Off of the girl, no. Nah, she can't see anything other than, other than the, the Ark's fat ass. It is a pretty fat ass. She's a pretty good ass. Look at that. She waddles when she... Oh, run! Run! She waddles, chat. That fat dump truck ass waddles. Here. Gotta set up a choke point. Here. Now... You fucking buffoon. We play the waiting game. Well, if you eat the grill, it'll solve her fear and your hunger. That is true. <laughs> ah, damn. Little, little too far out. Okay. Guard. Put a little girl to guard. She can't fight. Oh, okay. Okay, so. Have the little girl attack the dicks. <laughs> so, what was, what was the pattern again? Let me make sure. It was attack, attack arm, guard. Yeah, attack the hatch arm. Guard. Guard. Okay. Uh. Chop off his his stinky stinger. His stinky dirty stinger. I think it's got I think it's got cock cheese. <coughs> Bless you. Okay. Uh, torso guard torso. Mm -hmm. So now. Shunk. God made you Jamaican women wrong. 
Guard. Guard. Dong, dong, dong. And... So. There you go. Nope! <laughs> Did you miss? <laughs> yes! Fuck it! Fuck it! Tell the little girl to hit the torso too. Little girl, close your eyes! The worst kind of creature, the dick man. Oh, we got a small key. Meow. Now I'll go ahead and use a tinderbox on this. Just far enough away where it'd be useful. Yeah. Follow the blood trails. <laughs> Follow the blood trail, Lolly. Piece of raw meat. Yay, raw meat's my favorite. Opium! Baby. Yeah. We found opium! <laughs> Women love opium chat! Fuck yeah! Where is it? Right, yeah. We could smoke it! Yeah, it'll calm you down. This game is fun. It is very, very fun. Yes, We're it just is. in that stage of like, okay, what the fuck are we doing? Yeah. Dong. Dong. Uh... There is an Iron Maiden. Yes. We're not going to open that. There's someone inside the Iron Maiden. Maybe they deserved it. Maybe they deserved it. Uh, this is the torture room. Mm -hmm. The blood's still wet. Okay. Oh, yes, opium. The fentanyl of the ancient world. It was a very effective drug chat. I love opium! I love opium! Yeah, I think maybe you should, keep, you should keep it down, man. Okay, we got a skinning knife. Yeah. How useful is the skinning knife? It's skin. Can we give it to the child? <laughs> okay. Alright, and... Two seconds. Two seconds. What do you mean two seconds? The fucking sweet tea. Uh, eh. I need my sweet tea. Eh. That little girl looks like she's fucked up, homie. You can use her to take pelts. Oh, okay. Yep. Mm. I love opium, Charlie. I love opium! I shall return. Oh. Now yank my headphones out. There we go. Jackie Estacado might be in there. You never know. Yeah. Yeah. Flying the child isn't already on meth. Chat, should I feed that? Should I feed the child to the Hydra chat? While well, Lolly's away, the grown men on play. Here, I need to get the fucking controller unstuck. Yeah. Yeah, you keep walking, asshole. And she has been there for way longer than anyone. She is sane, apparently. She is a trooper. She is a trooper, chat. That is true. Uh, second quick, uh, I, I shouldn't read and drive, chat. Uh, find your dagger for, you can find for the girl. Find a soul stone, collect a lesser soul from the weak dead enemy, and then use it as a hex table to curse her dagger, and she'll actually be a decent attacker after, after that. Yeah. So what's going on with you, chat? You having a good time? You having a good time, chat? I think we're having a good time, chat. Oh my gosh! Opium! Many such cases, chat. Blue herb. And the green herb. Should you see Mary Jane recently? Yeah. Uh, I also know that they said that, the, that they didn't actually change the model. So... You know. Yeah, it's starting to get a little... A little chilly out there. A little, little chilly? A little chillster? A little bit. A little tiny bit. The hunger. I'm I'm pissing my fucking pants right now. <laughs> Alright. I think you can learn the web sweep. Web sweep. Yeah. Okay. Right. Get on up, buddy. Yep. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Same model people want to be bad. Yeah, I was gonna say they, they said it was the same model, so like maybe they just changed the hair and that's really it. Cause well, I mean, all around it looks like it had a graphics update, so yeah. there you go. You're seeing it in a new light, literally. Ugh. Don't let Sea Dog VA do better at fear and hunger. Chat, 
Chat, you know he pays people to play his games for him, right? <laughs> Ow. Also, I went back to get some herbs that you missed. And caught the plate jumping down the well. I thought about it. That's all you need all right. to know. We're also hungry. Again. Yeah. So greens for infections. Mm -hmm. uh, What's the command to make Carnese shake that fat fucking ass? How do you make your back it up on you? Uh, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, uh, BA. Or your equivalent. And little girl, you shall eat the eggs. Here you go, little girl. <coughs> Speaking of which, she has got to have a blue herb. She's gonna fucking die. The enemy gets angry at you, you will die. Okay. They're just coomers unable to comprehend normal looking women like Ari Formic Ashley. I don't know. I mean, people are jumping at shadows now, so. Yeah. You're just gonna see a whole lot more of that. Uh, also, I know if you go up there, there's a whole bunch of priests that get pissed off. Yeah. Uh, there's a second courtyard area that uh, I will walk you through because you can uh, you can get the little girl a weapon, like a proper weapon. So, once you get there... Ah! You're a sane one, right? Maybe. Little girl, it's time to eat egg. <laughs> She looks nothing like the first game. How long has it been since? Uh, since the first game? Uh, I don't know, 2018? 2019? Bed to the right? Yeah. What Safe. about it? <laughs> Come on! You had a terrible night's sleep. Yeah. Oh boy. It's unfortunate we lost that. that oh boy. It's unfortunate we lost that that fucking coin toss. <laughs> Little girl, help us! It's so fucking Jover. It is indeed Jover chat. Okay, whenever you get to the menu that ask heads or tails. Then mess with buttons to see. Okay. Because it, yeah, it, it'll burn a, it'll burn a coin before you you spin. Yeah, it gives you more coins. Plap plap plap. This is name of plap plap plap. Yeah, he, he only tortures. Yes, remove your shameful shameful parts. What's that thing the Muslims do to the women? Chat that just happened to us. God damn. Continue. Yeah. <laughs> It was only 20 minutes of... It was only 20 minutes. Turn into a nugget, yeah. Mortis. I hope that doesn't happen every time you want to save. Because that, that would just, like, lean past the point of, of, like... You were at the... You were you were in the torturer's chambers. Yeah. It's just unfortunate we got fucked on the coin toss. Yeah. Oh, God. Look... Carnese, Taco Bell has been here, little girl. How can you tell, Carnese? Bloody toilet hole. Okay, two dried mushrooms. Are them enhancing the graphics that made they made her even uglier? Well, she hasn't changed at all, chat, so she looks exactly the same. Okay. There is one save point. Yeah. Yeah, there is. One safe save point, sorry. Kid was a fucking snitch. Nah, man, that motherfucker just let that shit happen to us. Can't believe it. So theoretically, if if we track down the torturer and kill him, will will it make that partially more safe? I don't know. I don't backtrack much. Because I mean, like, theoretically, the only risk really mm -hmm. would be the torturer finding you, unless there's another event I just don't know of. You get a free save in the catacombs in the bed next to the crow statue. Uh, you can make the bed safe by killing every enemy on that floor. That is true. That, that is also the catacombs. And if we can avoid that motherfucker, we're good. Did you lose that fucking coin flip? Yeah. Damn. I'm trying to think. Uh... Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off, asshole. Leave me alone. Yeah. These things are easy enough. You literally just walk right past them. Yeah. They don't even really chase you. Nah. They chase you, but they're just slow. 
Okay. Uh, I held down X. That does not do anything. Small keys. Now we can save the child. Yep. Tails every single time. I feel like if I start doing that... It's a 50-50, chat. It's, yeah. like, it's literally a 50-50. I feel like if I start doing that, it'll just start doing heads, like, heads to spite me. Mm -hmm. uh, why, are you, why are you beefing with the door, homie? I don't even know why I keep trying. Kill the torture first, then you just fail to save if you miss the coin flip. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So, yeah, okay. It's not bind, binded by default. Oh, my God. Tails and fails rhymes though. True, chat. True. Okay. So. Yeah, so you can't you can't abuse your your lucky coins uh, because the button isn't fucking bound by default. Oh my God. It's bound on keyboards, but guess what we don't have. Yeah. Right. You know what? As soon as you mentioned it, bust out the fucking keyboard. It's so fucking useless though. It's like, why are we struggling with this? We have a keyboard! It's so fucking useless. <laughs> God. <laughs> it just hit me. We have a goddamn keyboard! You have 800 fucking button combinations you can put in on a fucking controller and you can't bind it by default, you fucking cunt. What an asshole. Right? What a fucking prick. And if I remember right... You fucking Polish son of a bitch. Finish whatever the fuck. I don't care what shit whole country you come from. Yeah. If I remember right, the, the default for the shift. keyboard, yeah, is shift. And I think it's Z to Hang confirm. On. You had one this whole time? I always have a fucking keyboard, chat. I actually have several disposable keyboards. That's just the one I got from fucking a bitch in a hotel room. I'm gonna fucking... Why is it sticky? Ask yourself that question again. Welcome to being a true gamer! Alright, we don't have any mouse though. Uh, you'll never guess. Huh. It is trying to get me to fucking... Oh my god! No, here, I got it. Please. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. Yeah, here we go, here we go. Okay, there you go. What ass pussy got me like, what? And if I remember right... Yeah, okay. Oh, we have red vials, though. Yep. Found them in, a, found them in a, a barrel, I think. There we go. Uh, silver coins. Tinder boxes. Blue liquid. There's a gamepad, a template that just makes all the back buttons on the Steam Deck look coin buttons. Yeah, but we plug in a controller just for ease of use. There we go. Well, I guess it would be all the all the, the triggers and the, the bumpers. See, as Lolly sometimes notices tweeter retards for the amusement. Uh, how many did you find trying to defend that video of Palestinian sharing <laughs> for spitting on mutil uh, mutilated corpses of, uh, of women? I have not been paying attention at all. I'm not even gonna lie. I've been. If if we don't give a shit about the fucking the the shit going on Where in Ukraine, why the f why the fuck would we care about what's going on in the Middle East, chat? Well, more than that, it's like I was I was literally busy with the fucking uh, Watchmen video. I haven't been on Twitter all day. Right. Maybe, like, here and there, just, like, posting small shit, but, yeah, it's, like, I haven't been able to. Okay, PC Captain Master Doors. Race. Mouse and keyboard time? I am not giving Lolly the fucking mouse. He has to use just the keyboard. Just well, the fucking keyboard. It's an RPG maker. You don't need the mouse. Yeah. Uh, Captain's Orders. Okay. Tell Lolly to throw a real coin to choose which side of the game coin you'll choose. No! Chat, that, that, that's just, that's a made-up, that's a made-up language in the background, right? right? Ain't, ain't no way that's real shit. It looks it. Looks like, you know, that bullshit Tolkien, like, not quite real language thing. Right. Cut the flag down, Lolly. We can cut the flag down. Can we? What does it do? Oh, it gives us cloth. Mm hmm You can get the next one. E. And if I remember right, cloth is for, oh, no, it won't actually let us... Oh, okay. I thought you get both. If I remember right, I think cloth gives us uh, ways to bandage. <laughs> Chose his fit shoulder. Uh. 
got dirt, opium. I don't like muscle shirts, so I'd have to go with Super Saiyan 4. Eh. Blue vial. Yeah, the cloth frag fragments stop bleeding. Uh, to you, what if this game had a secret goblin boss fight and Lolly apes from uh, and Lolly or, and Lolly had to fight the apes from Metal Gear Rising or Vengeance? That'd be fun. That would be fun. So mock up book. All right, going heads. Yep. Okay, was shift. No. Ancient book. Mm -hmm. Feels very special and has hefty weight, like a siren's call. Book's calling to you. Oh yeah, if I remember right, ancient book is like how you learn magic. Uh, we are going to eat cabbage. Oh, we have a mock-up book. Yeah. Hunger. Uh, ancient book. No, I just mentioned it because uh, it's almost fascinating. Literally, just ask the guy, "Would you like people, the people like that near you?" Please, a simple yes or no. And the guy started spreading, uh, spreading with, "No, Israel has mandatory service for both genders. She probably bombed women and children. You dumb American, I'm Romanian, by the way. He's like fucking clockwork." Like the little girl eat dirt don't ask questions. No. Uh, do we read the book or do we save it for someone else? I don't know. We built with a dump truck ass. You think mages have dump truck asses? We'll hold off for it for now until we get confirmation. Otherwise, uh, one guy said he wants us to feed dirt to the little girl. No. No dirt. No. Uh, looks like feces. No. You feed that to the to the human hydra like a good boy. It can kill you. Okay. Read the book, become a coomer. <laughs> Just one for now. Heads. Of nope. Course. Fuck. Days of Sylvian 1. Ooh, we can learn languages or something. Uh, I actually don't know what the fuck it does. It's about the ah, other it's gods. About the god. yeah, yeah, the titty god. God, goddess of love, lust, and creation. Created men and women at the dawn of time from the very first moment she hey, loved chat, children Look, greatly. it's Cleopatra from the hit video game Dante's Inferno. Yeah. Uh, Read that. I just want to look at titties. Yeah, I bet you do, chat. Love and magic. So yeah, she just straight up became like a, a demon. Need so more tits. As stated, if it's not obvious, the Berserk influence hey, look, is very heavy. <laughs> it's the Dark Party from, from Final Fantasy XIV. Yeah. You got a turnip. Yay. Should be a should be an enemy somewhere. Should be. Salami, holy shit, we're lucky. Cabbage. Well, we won't have to worry about food anytime soon, eh, Lolster? I can hear him. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let sink in that you said that. Chat, you would. Uh, this is a ritual room, right? Yeah, sacrificial circle for the gods. Yeah. Uh, Grogaroth, destroyer men, yearns for human sacrifices. Sylvian, god, god of fertility and love, which is nothing more than an act of love in her name. We're so, still yeah. afraid of sex, so never worship. Never yeah. worship. You can really have too much of a good thing. Her rack looks like a fucking grapevine. Are, I think it's probably... That's probably what it's based sure on. reminds me. So yeah, both of them are, are scared of sex. Okay. So it's still using the logic of this run. What so do you think that little girl's seen? <laughs> found oil. Holy shit. Uh, tobacco. Sucker for the shot. Oh, God. Yeah. I knew he was somewhere around here. All right. So attack Cleaver his arm. Your arm. Guard. Slash. Guard. Guard. Hurt the dirt. Uh. She's seen too much. She has. Tally who? Tally who? Tally that tally whacker. Tally gone. No. Oh. Uh. Attack torso, right? Uh, I think it was guard, then torso, and then. No, I think that's what tripped us up, because we tried guard, and then we got fucked up. So I will attack uh, torso, then guard after that, and then attack torso again. It takes two hits on his torso. I just it's it's a it's a matter of not provoking him so he doesn't do a an attack before he the the flurry rush. Yeah. Think of saves as seeds for the dungeon itself. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay. Well, that makes sense because uh, fuck you, seemed... little girl. All we need to do is hit him. Yeah, I think little girls are scared. So there we go. Dun -dun. When he's found tobacco, she's she's about to light up a motherfucking Newport. Meat cleaver and loincloth. Nice. Can we make the little girl equip the meat cleaver? I if, will never never stop asking questions of if I can give 
weapons to a child. Uh, leather helmet. Hila's just boarded a flight to Israel. She feels it's her duty to fight for her real country. Hope she comes back alive, but if she just she doesn't, I hope at least she doesn't get raped. H3H3. I had to click that fucking link to see that picture, chat. God damn, dude. <laughs> God damn. Okay. So the little girl has a leather vest. Meanwhile, I put on the helmet. Yeah, the dagger in the back courtyard is the only weapon the little girl can use. There we go. Well, why the loincloth? Okay. She can also use magic, but, I mean, just give her an enchanted weapon and she's good. All right. I guess think, uh... And I do believe I've taken everything from this room, so we are going into the next one. Yeah. Motherfucker, I would be scared. Yeah. Barney says Lord Miles GF going to look for him. That motherfucker's dead as shit, chat. Dead as fuck. Okay. We got an egg. Egg. All right. Two, two, uh... Oh, yeah, 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 left. right there. All right. Eh. Blue herb. Red herb. Green Look herb. at that chat. Significantly farther along. I'm sorry, better off than we were. So yeah, this is a trial and error game. Yeah. Pick up the stick, Lily. Yeah, I'm picking up the stick. So yeah, now, now I'm kind of understanding it. Where obviously on hard difficulties, it's it's going to be a lot more like interesting because variables are going to be changed up. Every enemy has a specific way the dev wants you to deal with them. Yeah. Every item has a specific use. Yeah. If you just know the, those two things, then you can get through the game without much issue dying yeah. at all. People have been able to get through the game with like you know a single character on like the hardest difficulty and shit. So it's yeah. like yeah. Ilk Rick, the night of our fears. Thank you, priest man. Very cool. Torso. You know what my response to that is? Have the little girl hit him in the dick. Or right, aim for the head, little girl. And you know what? I see. What was that scream? You heard that? I was wondering if it came from the headphones, because that was an actual scream. That was unsettling. Also, give me my gun. Uh, my gun's right there. Yeah, I trust mine more than I trust yours. Fair enough, it's a revolver. Oh, we got the lantern. Uh, flashlight work. Oh, cool. Fucking great. Flashlight's dead. That's very cool. That's very awesome. I'm using my phone for a light. All right. Wish him luck. Because yeah, I heard that and I was like, oh, was that like a cat or something? Okay, long uh, cloth fragment and a stick. And a pipe. Good luck, Shota. Yeah, everyone wish him luck. He's, he, 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 he is off to... Ow. So assuming it was just nothing. Uh, I didn't see nothing out there, but, uh, when I, well, ironically, when I, uh, went around the side of the trailer to, uh, point the camera slash the flashlight into the woods, something ran off. So, hmm. likely just wildlife. Yeah, probably. Uh, Pip Pip Cheerio for three bucks. But my Lally cat's alive, that's all I care about. Yeah. Lolly showed I'm playing this game called Legionnaire's Life. It's a roguelike RPG that has you play as a legionary and Roman military. You can rise up the ranks. It's, almost, it's mostly text-based, but it's addictive. Would you ever play it on stream? What was it? Uh, it's called Legionary Life. I don't think I've heard of it before. There we go. It's not sure to... Aw, oh, that's cute, chat. Yeah. You think you're going to stop what's going to happen. There we go. Safe so way to deal with the Dark Priest to destroy that lantern arm first? Yeah. Yeah. Trail and error? Pfft. No, dumbass. This is fear and hunger. Yeah. Ignore that. Usually they don't scream like that. Yeah. Uh, where, 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 oh, oh. Yeah, that was a fucking good, good damn. Yeah. 
Uh, Switch Creeper, $5. The S, S endings for each character came because mm -hmm. the devs didn't think people could beat the difficulty and had to make a new one show to use Monster Bang. Mm -hmm. Use Monster Bang. I don't want to fuck any of these monsters. We're not in an area where there should be any big cats, so we're good. And and my cat was underneath Lolly's car, so that's all I care about. But yeah, you, I, I'm just happy that you also heard that, because I was like, what the hell is that? Yeah. It sounded like uh, uh, it sounded like air being s squeezed out of a small animal is what it fucking sounded like. Yeah. Oh, that's not shorty. Get the fuck out of there. That's cute, chat. That's real fucking cute. See, where's the coast today? No. Uh, they're apparently getting rid of, of the words witch, druid, and shaman because of, of religion or some shit. <laughs> oh, boy. Hi, right, Buckman. Buck. I can't even really be mad at Buckman because, like, I mean, he, he flat out said, like, hey, I heard something behind me, and we were dumb enough to try to sleep. Yeah. It's like, that wasn't Buckman's fault. This is Buck the vocab dog. If you don't do your vocab, I'm going to kill Buck the vocab dog. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Wizard of the Coast fucking, yeah. Oh, yeah, he, he even straight up says, like, yeah, the torture in the dungeon's fucking nuts. Yeah. Tails never fails! Yeah! At least you're not down in the catacombs. That being said, down in the catacombs is pretty cool, though. It is just pretty saying, cool. Just saying. Break his fucking... Buckman gets broken. Okay, let us use a torch, because it's kind of... It oh, is we have dark. Fucking, we have a fucking explosive vial already? Damn. Yeah. We've been, raiding, we've been raiding like a motherfucker. We also have another skinning knife. Yes. Two dried mushrooms. Knock, knock, open up the door. It's real with the non-stop pop, pop of stainless steel. Okay. Thank you, chat. Some Very nice. meat. Uh... You ready for uh, for uh, Elisrelia, a.k.a. the Throat Goat, a.k.a. the Semen Demon, a.k.a. the Glizzy Globbler? Uh, only a few more days till her event is out in FGO. Ellie Zarella. Do we just get a giant mechanized Ellie again? We're gonna ambush it. Ayo hey, Chooms, what's up? Okay. How do we fuck up the torturer? I mean, he has he has a knife in one arm. Maybe focus the uh, maybe focus the arm or die. All right, little girl guard. Yeah. That actually worked. Holy shit! He still has uh, four or five other appendages to hit you with. Okay. It's Cinderella, but Elizabeth. Oh. For Halloween? Now, torso. Okay. So now just fuck up the torso. Assuming you don't fucking whiff. There we did go. not whiff. Holy shit. Talk to him? No. Fuck he him. He turned us into a nugget. He did. He turned us into a nugget and mutilated our fucking genitals, chat. Fuck him. His head feels squishy. Skin him. Oh, he's second floor key. Yeah. Uh, can we skin him? Skin him serves no purpose. Coward! He can hear breathing from the darkness ahead. Show to pull on my nine in the welfare line. Oh, she was... You goddamn right, chat. Question. They still try and call Spider-Man an incel because MJ left him for a man bun uh, directly responsible for, for the genocide? Possibly, chat. Who the hell is this guy? Does he look like a fucking friend? I don't know. I killed that guy. That... What you just asked is the equivalent of seeing the fucking the guy that follows uh, uh fucking what's her face around in Silent Hill three, and going, is that is that is that a friend? It's like take, technically. One guy's put take a fucking guess. <laughs> His arm was covered in blades. Yeah, save now. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Who the fuck is calling Spider-Man an incel? Helen Keller. Oh, shit. Wrong button. There we go. Yay. So you're gonna save. This is only... Yeah, uh, see? Uh, torture is dead. Yes. You had trouble. You had trouble sleeping. Uh, this is the only event where you can get all Elizabeths from past events and get enough servant coins from the event to drop uh, to shop. Event shop 2120 all Ellie's. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. 
I, I'll, I'll definitely be it. running it. I got all all Elizabeths because I yeah, skipped I skipped the Elizabeth events whenever they came before. I don't know if I just didn't have time or what. Uh. Yep. Uh. <laughs> Your torch went out. Ow, oh, damn. Uh. Really gonna make the little girl walk through this? And all previous event CEs. I do need one event CE. The Mecha, the S, the not STR, the fucking um, Buster one. Uh, I do need that. It's like a, a Maria with a jetpack or some shit. I need that one. Okay. I think I have a better version of it, but like, whenever I look something up, they all go, "No, use this one. Fuck you." And I'm like, "Okay, whatever." You see that right? They're making Spider-Man torturing MJ because she cupped them. They did make Spider-Man evil. Oh god. Yeah, you can get the fuck out of here, homie. Good, uh, red vial. You get you let you get a copy of all of the Elizabeths. Oh, I, oh yeah, I, I got them all. I, I fucking Ooh. slammed through them. Now I don't have what I need to awaken them apparently, or to NP increase their NPs. So I'm assuming that comes with the next event. All right, uh, little girl, eat some mushrooms and shut the fuck up. I'm hungry and it wants to kill you. Eat mushrooms. Eat mushrooms faster. It's getting closer. All right. It's fine. It's our it's our puck. They're they're our pucks. Okay. They're nice little fairies. I don't think they are. We might be cornered. We might be able to get out of here with a daring escape. Yeah, both Eka uh, Eka Ellie's Mecha Ellie's. No, I I got Mecha Ellie one or Mark yep. one because I like the color. You can only you can only pick one, and like I said, I didn't do the event whenever it came around before. All right. Uh, this is a fearful place, little girl. Hold my hand. I'm not scared, but I am. Please hold my hand. <laughs> my semen demon support list will be beautiful. I'll have to see what the fucking Halloween outfits are, or not outfits, the Halloween units are. Little girl, you don't understand. This is the most terrifying experience of my fucking life. Get the fuck away from him! He can shoot you! Chat! Come on! I see. That's not true. That would help with a certain few fights in the future. Eh. If you had both. Eh. Uh, Zodiac for a dollar god is sending a Wendigo to stop you from streaming. And I'll fucking kill it. Bone saw. Boom saws ready. Moldy bread. Should I hate before watching this stream? Uh, do I, what do I need to do to regain RP? You mean HP? Got ale, wheat flour. Yeah. Dried this isn't meat. Resident Evil Five. Yes, it is. Chat. Look, there's two of us. Idiot. Fucking idiot. Halloween servants are pretty good and hot as fuck. Okay, already stole everything I need from that. Nice. Raw meat. Jeez. Sure, stop that Wendigo. I'm going to fuck it, chat. Okay. So now we're back in the catacombs. Yeah. Yeah. You know, chat, some cultures believe that creatures like Wendigos are nothing more than muses. Did you know that, chat? And I'm just saying, Neil Gaiman has my view on muses. You lock them in a room, and you don't feed them, and you rape them non-stop. I drank with this little girl. Everybody in the club getting tipsy. <laughs> <laughs> I almost walked straight into that guard. <laughs> I almost walked Everybody straight into that Everybody in the club there. getting tipsy. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here. Uh, aerial drives a 50% uh, starting charge CE with buster up and NP damage up both at 10% and full attack stat. Um, I have one that starts at 60% uh, NP and is a buster, uh, buster and NP up. So this is the actual, okay. No, 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 God is sending a Windagoon to help you keep streaming. No, 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 chat. I'm gonna fuck the Windagoon. Everybody in the catacombs getting tipsy. Wait, you're gonna fuck the Windagoon? I think I can take him. <laughs> this is God. the actual prison. Yeah, who's waiting for that ass? He was. Yeah, lolly. Uh. So I assume arms. Salty run back, right? 
Four and O oh in favor of the door lolly, by the way. I'm waiting on somebody to just give me the answer here, man. I'm not even fucking lying. I'm paralyzed in fear until somebody in chat gives me the solution to this puzzle. What a great horror game. I don't want to fuck with that. I don't want to fuck with that. I'm scared. I want to go home. Go for the head. Imagine losing. The answer is always dick. Okay, we'll go for the arms. Sweep the legs. You yeah, always go for the arms and the heads, except for when you don't. Yep. How? <laughs> yeah. I say I don't think you can target anything else. What is wrong with you? Hey. Thirty and twenty-seven door. Thirty to twenty-seven door by unanimous decision. Fuck is that thing? It's a it's a prisoner that's gone mad. Did you check his body? Yeah, it didn't have anything. Okay. Uh, nothing left. It's pretty much the way we came. So, all right, back to the blood pit. It's the best spread with the highest percentages. Uh, though the Rio collab has a better version. Uh, for Oberon Buster looping cranking, which has a lower Buster up but a higher NP up. Maybe that's the one I have. The one I have has a what? What's her face? The protagonist, the redhead protagonist. In like right. a frilly dress or something. It appears we have no other options, so uh not even gonna try not even gonna try and save first. Oh no, go back to the toilet. Carnice yeah. is feeling hungry. We need to check the toilet. We'll check the toilet later. Lolly, there ain't gonna be a later. Well you know what if You're if dying. We, if we are going to check the toilet, then we're going to save first. <laughs> Here, I'll, I'll pull up Fate real quick. I'll pull up Fate and try and see what the fuck the, the CE is called. Dun, 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 dun. So, save and rest. Yay. Here we go. Do not check the toilet. No, no, no. We're, we're gonna... We're, there, there's a reason we're doing this. I'm making him save specifically to check the toilet. Uh, little girl, you shall eat the finest blueberries. Only the finest blueberries for my little girl. She's still hungry, so fucking eat salami then. Eat the raw fucking salami, you little shit. Alright, now I gotta remember where the toilet is. I think it's over here. Oh, this is the torture room. That's okay. not what I need. Uh, C.E. Okay. Okay, small child. Uh, ignore the cultists. They don't matter. Okay. Okay, chat. What I have is called Summer Anniversary. That's the CE that I've got. Uh. Ooh. Have we already been here, though? Uh, if you're down to fuck the Windusi, then you'll definitely go for Lovecrafty and Tan Mommy Monster that's coming coming Skull in the event. Thievery. Ooh. Tan Mommy, you say, chat. Uh, Penance Kings. Penance Kings. Blood and Flower Magic. Eat, salam eat my salami grill who is scared of sex. It's not her fault. Man, you wasted that. You got alchemy, though. Worthless. Poems of Love and Torment. Fellowship. Okay. I know what you're talking about, but it's not as good. It's not as good, really. Yeah, stick. Tinderbox. Is that just Hokusai, but again? Captain's look Diary for... and Small Key. Holy shit. Apparently look for new VA talents and their standards are basically... We're looking for we're looking for a Pippa. The future has possibilities. Terrifying talisman. God damn. Uh. Lolly put on the loincloth I want to see. I don't think it actually affects nah. anything, though. No. So let's check out the purifying talisman. What does that do? Is that tomboy getting raped yet? No, but we were turned into a nugget and had our genitals mutilated. It was pretty violent. Your account's not good. You should give it to me. You should suck my nuts. So purify the shit. Yeah. Read all the books. Well, now that we know what's in this library, when we reload the save after what's event, what's inevitably going to happen, uh, we can just come through here again. All right. Climb it. Oh. 
And semen? Yes. Climb in! Alright. Whee! Whee! Ow. Shit! Pit! Shit! Pit! Shit! Pit! Shit! Pit! Seems to be hopeless. It was a mistake. Shit! Pit! Shit! Pit! Shit! Pit! Shit! Pit! <laughs> All right, little girl. We're now's gonna the die. best time to learn what all your items do, Lolly. Yeah. All right, little girl. We're gonna die down here. Uh. I will note that they won't be the same. Yeah. And there's Zenobia, who's a tan muscle mommy. That is true. Wait, you're just trapped. Yeah, you're not supposed to jump down here. Yeah, no rope. Yeah, we don't have any rope. Yep. You get cry of fear from the Swedes, and the ending will make you shoot yourself in the head. <laughs> what a shitty way to go. <laughs> I'm cracking it open. I'm cracking open the 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 trainee monster. Zenobia love. Uh! Yeah. Mommy Zenobia looks pretty cool. You can't even commit Canadian healthcare, right? What a rotten way to die. Wally, talk to your talk to your companion. Ease her mind. How do we talk? You don't. Yeah, I've never gotten far enough into the game to talk. <laughs> I've never gotten far enough in the game to talk to anybody. I'm gonna say, uh, yeah, it's good to it's good to poke around in your inventory and figure shit yeah. out while we're down here. So we can make torches. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Eat her. Real question is, when will we get Saber Ushi? I know, right? Is it a soft lock? You literally stay down here till you starve to death. Yeah, or kill yourself. Yeah, so here. To title. Continue. Press finish. Okay. Uh, now I'm not going to waste as much food on her. Just straight up eat the salami. You make torches just like in Minecraft. Chat, this is just Minecraft. Just saying. All right, girl, now sing Fly Me to the Moon. All right. So now we're going back to that library because that actually had a bunch of useful stuff. You can check the well out there real quick so you don't waste any time. That was a good point here. How many times can we? How many times can you accidentally poison? Yes. Ah, God, that's bright. Ah. All right. All right, little girl. Let's let's fucking die. Yay! Yay! You can climb. Fuck that. Yeah, there you go. A little bit of a shortcut-ish, kind of. Fly me Is that even really a shortcut? <laughs> yeah. It's weird. Gets you to a safe area. Fly me to the moon. Let me play Maybe among, among the, the stars. stars. As you're slowly sinking into the poo. <laughs> Let me see what life is like. <laughs> She's got my brother to watch the stream. Please call him, call him a nigger because he doesn't think you will. Well, I think he knows what he is. Unworthy, chat. We're gonna call him Tigger the oh, Nigger. Lockpicking scroll. That's nice. Hey, Tigger the Nigger. What are you doing fucking watching? T I double G R. That spells Tigger. Alright. Uh. Ah, damn it. The one time I don't do it. This is a true roguelike, or does a corpse, or does the corpse pit shortcut stay? Corpse pit shortcut stays. You get uh, certain, you get certain enemy layouts. We're not topic, but I got to witness a Komodo dragon regurgitate a moray eel the other day, and it got me thinking: those fuckers can swim. The Komodo dragons, yes, absolutely. Oh yeah, they're like they're they're just spiteful bastards. Oh, hey. Synth, synth wave, fly me to the moon. Hey! A priest of destruction. Can't he join your party? I mean, we could have killed him. Yeah, but I don't want to. Could have killed him. He can hold a polite conversation, you know, it's like... But he also has a dick. So we could kill him. Alright. Tails. Hi, Inky, you fucking cunt. There we go. Oh, we got alchemy. Hey, we got alchemy again. So we nice. got more more crafting. Uh, let me see here, because we do have to read through some of these books. So recipes the of the 15th century. Let me play among stars. 
Uh, some things I think Komodo dragons were put here by God to humble us. They're a fucking wicked chat. Dude, whenever I see those videos of, like, uh, the fucking Komodo dragons eating deer whole... Yeah. I, I physically go fucking cold. I look at that, it's like... They're fast as fuck, too, dude! It's like, oh my god, people live on the same island as those things. <laughs> right? Can you believe people live in Australia? <laughs> yeah, right? True feminism kills it if it has a dick. I know. We're real feminists, chat. We believe in we believe in equality. Now chop his dick off. Komodo dragons were bigger. They, yeah, they did used to be bigger. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, that was Stripe a King and Yellow reference talking about an old in an ancient city. Yeah. Okay. Where's okay, well, there's, there's a pocket cat? Yeah. There's a lot of Oh, there's a lot of lore, yeah. They have a really fleshed out world. Uh, I was gonna say, like, there's a lot of like ancient cities in in yeah. the works that this takes reference from. Nice typesetting, asshole! I couldn't read that final word. <laughs> Remember, Komodo's ancestors were huge. Any wonder? Uh, any wonder? Some think they started uh, the Dragon Legends. I wouldn't be surprised. I, I, I don't know. I gotta, I gotta say, it's probably something more specific that started the Dragon Legends, cause like. Dragons fly. Oh no, pocket cat, you're gonna die. Protected the young Mr. Willem. It was catnip. So he's being stalked by a monster cat. He just got you to move drugs for him. Yeah. Uh alchemy. Do not give children to Pocket Cat. He will ask, say no. Yeah. Uh, orange, oh, green, fuck. super senses, blue, blue, greater healing, white powder, mercury, uh, murky, high explosive. Okay. Uh, book of fears. Oh, we have a sequel to the pocket cat. No! <laughs> that depends on the culture, chat. Not all do. It has been long enough. I want everything in the game gender bent. Well, there's three male characters you can play as and one female. She got a tight, round ass. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sorry, chat. Favorite bit of lore from this is the, uh, from this and the second game. Uh, it might mean that fake Jesus is actually fake Satan. He was actually fake ancient Satan. Exactly, chat. Moto dragons' mouths are so fucking bacteria filled. A single bite can game into you very fucking slowly. Yes. Uh, so those fuckers be Voron monkeys, and they ain't even got to uh, got the decency to kill it first. Yeah. Jesus Christ. They, they can literally just bite an animal and let nature take its course. Yeah. I mean, like, isn't their mouth full of, like, some kind of, like, super, uh, super aggressive bacteria that, like, starts digesting it almost immediately or some crazy shit like that? Mm -hmm. It's some sort of bacteria. For a while, they thought they were, uh, venomous. Yeah. Gila monsters are beasts as fuck. Gila monsters are... Most, most lizards that are the size of my leg are terrifying, chat. I'm not gonna lie. The illustration on the book looks very lifelike. The pocket cat seems to stare straight at you. You should, uh... Ah! Uh... Why well, you gotta keep reading pocket cat books, you stupid fuck? No, you know what? Fuck you! I will reveal you for what you really are! Oh, you will, bitch! If I were to get to the moon itself to you, would you give up on your quest and lay with me for tonight? No! I'm not having sex with a cat! Don't, don't fuck the cat. He has a barbed cock! I suggest not reading any more cat books. I want the third one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the Penance Knights. Okay. What about a tiger snake? Your shit isn't loading, chat. I don't know why. Now have a status effect that shows Pocket Cat will always be watching you. Oh my god! <laughs> In your time of need, when you're being held down against your will, Pocket Cat will come and save you. Oh, we don't have it. No, oh, you fucking lied to me. I was excited. I, I liked the idea of being stalked by Pocket Cat. Pocket Cat's little pimp. Uh, and we have the scroll of lockpicking. <laughs> Please destroy the fucking book, I'm begging you. <laughs> We'll let the little girl... Alright. Yeah, let's let the little girl have something. 
So it was a little less. So now, now, yeah, she's a, she's less useless. Spartan Killer for five six for two dollars. Any thoughts on the picture before the movie gets out? We still haven't watched it, chat. Yeah, we still haven't watched it. It's so hard to find time to do anything, chat. I'm back to the fucking wood cutting mines again. I chopped half a winter's worth of wood so I wouldn't have to do this, but we're chopping wood. What does this game cost? First one is seven dollars. Okay. And the second one I think is like eleven. The second uh, one has more content. Sold of our necklace. What does that do? Uh, don't put it on. Okay. All I need to hear. <laughs> Imagine if you will, you're in Cyberpunk, and someone says, "Soul Killer, what does this do?" <laughs> and someone goes, "Don't put that in your head." And we've already read the captain's diary, so we don't need it. Actually, have we? Eh, just to be safe. True. So, hella bacteria mixed with venom. Uh, they bite you and get uh, and you get away. They ain't even got to give chase. They just come and nom your corpse or, uh, uh, or paralyze the living body. They don't even have venom, if I remember correctly. It's just their bacteria. Soul devouring necklace. Take a guess. <laughs> uh, In your darkest moment, Pocket Cat will be there for you to make it so much worse. You're, you're you're getting your you're getting your you're getting turned into a, a nugget by by the torturer and pocket cat is just standing in the fucking doorway. <laughs> you're walking in the sand and you go pocket cat. Why are there only one set of footprints behind me? And pocket cat goes because God will not save you. Now. <laughs> because God has abandoned you, my child. That necklace is actually safe. Funny enough, I don't believe you. <laughs> Uh, torture once again went too far with his wicked methods. The prisoner was but a child, but he already had to go through so much torture he shit himself more than he bled. Yeah. I'm afraid of torture to a degree. Sometimes I think it would be just if I just off him with my blade. Don't worry, I did it. He used to be a famed holy knight back in the day, able to achieve great fame at a young age. Wrong. During our holy campaign against eastern territories, he changed, or he was captured. A uh, roast for two dollars. Pocket Cat seems more trustworthy than Cool Cat. Cool Cat has a gun. You know what, I'm actually gonna look up what the fucking soul killer necklace does. <laughs> I I am super like ATF cat, ATF cat. Yeah. Just to honor the memory of tr of uh, of torture to white, I let this monster live today. Although I, I see the great contradiction in my words here. Torture. <sighs> yeah. Have you seen the video where Komodo ripped a fetus out of a still living deer? I have actually. I have no problem believing the stories of a 50-foot giant snake. Story seen, uh, story seen from a helicopter over the Congo. <laughs> okay, so this is what it does. Uh, according to the game files, Soul Devourer Necklace does have a hidden damage uh, multiplier like all other defensive equipment. 70% otherworldly. Mm -hmm. It's essentially 30% resistance against otherworldly element, so it reduces damage for specific magical attacks like Black Orb or Hurting when it's used against you, though Hurting tends to pop off your limbs too. Yeah. Oh, you, you like your leg, bitch? Well, the dragons are so ne based. They're fucking tor they're terrifying, chat, like most animals. Necklace is safe. Are you sure? It's semi-safe. I'm super paranoid. Again, semi-safe. Because uh, if so, I'll give it to, to child, but I don't want to give her something that will just, you know... Necklace bad. I think so. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm okay. We'll just keep it in the inventory for now. Koto dragons possess a potent venom delivered through their razor sharp teeth. The venom can kill humans within a few hours. Uh, within a few hours, they have at bites or excruciating. Uh, basically, they make it so your body can't stop bleeding. You slowly bleed out while also having the nasty bacteria oh, infect boy. the wound and fester to the point that it starts rotting your flesh. Aim for the lanterns. Okay. Holy shit, she's on fire! Yeah. Uh, you can regen, but at a heavy cost. True. I'm sad. Do we have anything to put her out? I don't think so. I don't what know. does the blue vial do? Blue liquid, just blue liquid. Okay. Uh, it will not go. There we go. I don't know. Kill the dark, kill the dark priest and get their outfits. No. Fuck it. Oh shit. <laughs> it heals. Yeah.
What game is this? Fear and Hunger. Mm -hmm. Yep. Genuinely a lot of fun. It, it really gets in your head and makes you paranoid to do fucking anything. Kill whichever one chanted, though. I don't remember which one chanted. But that one is dead. <sighs> ah, it's fine. You got him. You can kill his bitch. Ah, damn it. It was that one that chanted. Heads. Yeah, yeah you live. The, pre the prayers of the priests remain unanswered. There we go. Do you remember how the, how the Amazing Spider-Man comics made Peter an incel? Yeah, he kills people now. And by kills people, I mean he's uh, he's he's going to hunt down Paul. He's going to fuck him, chat. A dude named Carnese? This is not a man, chat. Okay. A uh, person nailed to the statue. We're, we're going to leave you, homie. It's okay. Girl spent her whole life inside of a dungeon. She's basically ginger. There we go. He's the spider who gobbles now. Yeah, he's literally Green Goblin Spider Man, and Norman Osborn has to be the hero. Yeah, it's a really dumbass gimmick. But you guys cheered whenever we did it with Otto. Well, I'm not cheering anymore. No, we didn't either. Just run away and re-engage. I think it, I think it'll clear burning. Oh, okay. Uh, she's fine now. And so yeah, she's fine now. She's out of combat. Yeah, you just oh, sacrifice the man in the statue. No, damn. We fell into the prisons. God, I hate Paul. Oh, you 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 can't uh, you came conceive of the hatred I have. You can't conceive of the hatred I have towards this guy. There's nothing special about him. He's just some normie loser. He is. He's a normal guy. Feared in hunger in Las Vegas. Yeah, someone made the joke like way earlier. Eh. The name. The name pun. Nitroglycerin, holy shit. I guess this is just the fucking uh the pyromaniac run, huh? It really is. It really wants us to blow people up. Claw fragment? We have plenty of plenty of stuff to cure bleeding if it comes along. Okay, now we're in the prisons. Yay! Uh let's not do that for now because there are enemies. <laughs> Speaking of which. Hey, we're back with the bats. You know what? Fuck it. We'll fight it. Oh, there are two of them. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. Cave gnomes! Cave gnomes! All right. Uh, and we can only hit them. We can't do anything else. Mm -hmm. I'll hit the one. Little girl, you guard. Okay, and they are... They, they seem easy enough to, to take yeah. out. That's another one. Okay, shit. Uh, use a cloth fragment on yourself. You aren't, we aren't so different, you and I. Together we can take over this city. No. You suplexed me into the fucking ground, you tombstoned me, and then you pinched my nipples. I ain't joining you, asshole. All things Green Goblin actually did to me in that room. <laughs> it was awful. <laughs> yeah, little girl's losing her fucking arms. And leg. Ah, uh, is that not what we need? What? Cloth fragments? No, that's not bleeding. Well, then what, what is the status effect we have? Decay. FNF was great, Shota Baby. Oh, they give you infection. Oh. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, well, we have stuff to clear infection from what I understand. Why not teach the girl magic? You get the bad ending by listening to X person and agreeing to do X thing. Exactly, chat. That's what we're not doing. Uh, I can live with you choosing uh, choosing him since he was the last man on earth for years for, uh, for years to you. I can even get past you overlooking him committing genocide. But he has a man bun, MJ. You cut me with a goddamn man bun wearing faggot. Bonesaw, Bonesaw will straight up take off a limb. Yeah. I had a green herb and I managed to, to cure the little girl's infection because she had worse. Uh... Well, blue herb? My dad's a huge conspiracy theorist in there, right? Yeah, right. said, but what if Hamas is right? And they had to shut him down immediately. Yeah. Tell your dad he's lucky to live in a country that isn't in the Middle East. Yeah. Well, that's the thing with a lot of boomers right now. They, they Boomers are, are being absolutely led by the nose to the dumbest of fucking rabbit holes. Absolutely. Bone salt cures everything. Yeah, use it on your head. Bone salt is only for extreme circumstances. Yeah, it's like... Use the pipe with nitro powder. <laughs> that would be funny. Yeah, use the pipe with nitro powder. Clear your 
Yeah, you have up to 10 rooms and transitions for the infection kills you. Okay. Yeah. So we got to find something. Well, here, here. 10 screen transitions. So just keep count of them. Also, wait, do we still have it on there on us? Or not? Because it looked like it wasn't there. Maybe I just didn't see it. On our hand. Okay, it's on our hand. She's cured. Okay. Yeah. So let me look here. Bone saw is ready. So this will do something if I can bind two blue vials. Mm -hmm. One That's light, blue, light vial. blue vial. Full of a light blue liquid. You don't know what it does yet. Hmm. It's not a 10, it's on the seventh screen transition. Fucking great. <laughs> Pocket cat. The one thing they love more than a hero is to see a hero fail. Fall. Die trying. That's Mushroom. cool and all. Can you give me the bone saw? My hand hurts. Mushrooms too. His explanation for uh, uh, for it was that he was saying that the initial attacks on Israel seem to be false flags, and I just told him, "Dad, there's footage of Hamas soldiers raping Israeli women." Are you saying? Are you saying you wouldn't chat? Don't you lie. Here we go. Some more torches. Yeah. Uh, now. Uh, I don't know what cures infection. I don't yeah, remember. Yeah, I, I, I am also, uh, I'm just going to go straight towards our God and Savior, Google. The wiki. Right, as long as it's not the fandom wiki, because they started to put these faggy ass, like, where it just auto-plays Twitch videos now. Awful, Chad. Yeah, it's awful. It's awful. And fucking Adblock doesn't pick those up. Uh, popped in uh, to say, hi, how you liking Fear and Hunger when I hit tips it is very very good uh very very good uh how you liking those kazar milkers don't open up a new page you cunt for fuck's sake just read a steam guide i'm trying to avoid as many spoilers as possible i'm only looking it up for like extreme circumstances uh i would but another 10 dudes would be waiting there or would be there waiting for their turn so you know what fuck it here all right, so that's still. Uh, Jean, Jean is on raid up apparently. Okay, level three basements. I'm pretty sure I already have Jean. Oh, look at that! I'll do the free summon chat. Doors jammed. Yeah. Uh, I was gonna say sixth fight with the door. <laughs> they're, they're Israeli female soldiers look like he, uh, Hila Klein. So, listen, Hila, Hila was fuckable back in the day, but she's been, she spent, what, 10 years with with Ethan? And apparently has grown to absolutely despise him. You don't, you don't fucking, you don't live with that asshole without despising him. <laughs> Just hold it right there. Ah, Buck, the bucking vocab dog. Welcome back. How's the Steam Deck? I'm either thinking of getting one this year or, or the next, or I might get a 3D printer. Uh, I mean, depending Gentlemen. on what you... Sir Seymour. Uh... We're gonna see... Uh, we're gonna see Ellie's dead corpse eventually in many such cases. How's Steam Deck? I'm thinking of getting one this year or next, or I might get a 3D printer. If you can get an emulator set up, it's great, but man, for Steam games, it's fucking spotty. I am gonna lie. Nah, we just picked the spotty games. It's on us. That is true. We, we just specifically picked the ones where it's like, hey, you're not supposed to play it on that. I have like 5,000 games in my Steam library, and everyone, everyone that we've picked for a stream has been an issue game. Alright. Oh, we don't have any coins. Hila was always a normie. Ethan making himself a shitty public spectacle uh, would make anyone hit him. Hate him, yeah. Uh. Fuck. Yeah, the Catwoman trading things dumb. Okay. Blue vial. I meant Ethan's wife. Oh, he, uh, Hila, not Ellie. Hila. Blue herb. Red herb. Dried mushroom. Bizarre creature. I was googling Ethan, and the first search recommendation uh, was what disease he has. Wikipedia says Ethan Klein has Tourette's syndrome and is Jewish. <laughs> That's pretty good. 
<laughs> I don't know if he's being serious or not. I just need a green herb. I just need a green herb. Thing is, I haven't picked this... I don't think I've picked this place apart, so we might be able to find one. Wait, do you not have a green herb? Did no. you use them already? I, I gave it to her, because I thought I had two, but I only had one. Holy shit. Okay. Okay. Uh, I will feed myself the cabbage in the vain hope that maybe green equal help. Isn't it funny that Gaza gets attacked suddenly on 4chan? Not one BBC thread, not one Lollicon thread, not one Larpaganda thread, not one Christian hate thread, not one tranny accepted thread. Interesting. I can't believe I can't believe Gaza was was everyone running for chat. Don't fuck with that guy. I I'm being serious. I didn't know he I Oh my god, he's not he's Yeah? Yeah, Klein has Tourette syndrome and is Jewish. Okay. Um Yeah, you ran into the bad guy. Yeah. You're not making it out of this. So how do we fuck this guy up? I'm noticing chat. Green equal good drinks wiper fluid. Oh. All right. Go to the courtyard. There's green art going there. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I think I already picked that one up, but we can check it. We can check. Holy shit! He's right about he's right about the fortune thing, dude. I looked it up. He's he's right. Okay. His cock's on backwards. No, his cock is his cock has blades. You can't? Oh, we might not be able to fight him. Okay. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> hold up. Hold up. Let me, let me read the whole thing. Uh, not one BBC thread. Not one Lollicon thread. Not one furry thread. Not one LARPaganda thread. Not one Christian hate thread. Not one tranny acceptance thread. Not one chud hate thread. Not you know what? one random subject Twitter thread. It's like something's happening, guys. Israel internet outages, 99% drop in BBC, mutt, race, race mixing threads, anti-Christian, Christianity is Jewish threads, uh, UG slow, uh, UG slow as fuck, other general de uh, degeneracy. Hmm, hmm, I can't help but notice. Complete lack of shilling in BBC threads today. Uh, and also a complete disappearance of all the hate in uh, India threads. Well, I'm sorry, Chad, I, I just haven't gotten on 4chan. That's my bad. I'll do better next time. Little girl lost her fucking arm. Shouldn't have let him get hit. You shouldn't have let her get hit. <laughs> you lost your arm. You can't. Yeah. Oh, uh, fuck it. Tails. Heads. Oh. As always. We're dead. No, Luke! Yeah! The girl died really bad. And for the head, fuck it. <laughs> <He's still laughs> I was gonna say, he still gets to hit you. Ow. How are you alive? I cut your head off! You merely put it back on. It's rape time. We can get out of here, Lolly. We can make it out. We got Dash. We can make it out. We're gonna die. We're gonna rape your corpse. I don't even think I can open the inventory anymore. <laughs> so is girl dead dead? As far as I'm aware, she's super dead. Oh yeah, she died. She died in the battle. She's dead as fuck. Seg one sixty for dollars. Now talk! <gasps> he's tired. He beat the shit out of you so much. He's tired. He's laughing. Get pregnant. Get pregnant. Get pregnant. <laughs> this is the version of the game where names have their cocks out. I kind of don't want to see that. Imagine being a pussy chat. All right, little girl. Now I guess we could just go and collect those books again. Uh, I'm not gonna bother fighting those guys. That was just more trouble than it was worth. All I did was set you on fire. Yeah. Tails a pocket cat. Chirp. I don't know if we uh, should talk to pocket cat. No, you can talk to him. Just uh, be careful. If you, okay. Just be careful if you find pocket cat in volume three. Assassin's handbook, studies of Sylvania. Do, do, 
do. Got two good rolls. <laughs> uh, Assassin's Sandbook. This guy's from Animal Weather. Mm -hmm. My dad went from being a supporter of the Greens Party to being a guy who thought that a uh, shitty ancient apocalypse documentary was gospel. I uh, think that the moon landing was faked. I think your dad's been on the internet for too long. They're screaming, don't give the girl the pocket cat. Give the girl the pocket cat. Did we pick up volume three? No, we only have volume uh, one. Aww. We'll read volume one again. We can give the dark priest the pocket cat. Have you seen the uh, comparison between Mary Jane Spider-Man model and the model by uh, model they mocap? Uh, I haven't seen a comparison, but uh, I, I know that they've outright said that they didn't change the model. Yeah. Um, there we go. I don't particularly see any reason for them to lie. I mean, there's no point to it. Right. And I mean, if we're going to be honest, Ooh. people have been doing this shit since like Spider-Man 1. Remember when people freaked out about the water? I don't remember the water. I remember people freaking, about, uh, freaking out about Mary Jane, though. Okay, there's a dagger in this field somewhere. Okay. It could all be lies, but I don't know. Are you evil? No, motherfucker! <laughs> Car is in the prison cell and is recruitable, yes. Pocket Cat's great. Pocket Cat is great. <laughs> I'm not going to show Lolly, Nora. It's here to torment us. Breedable, one might say. I mean, that's cool. Oh, that might be it. They're all dead with their dicks out. Yes, Jack. The little girl now has a dagger. Yeah. The girl has a dagger. She can now attack. Yeah. Benjamin Balls will for $2. Uh, what's your thoughts on Beastars, the manga as well? It was pretty good when we watched it. Uh, definitely very melodramatic and edgy, but that's kind of the fun of it anyway. Mm -hmm. So it's like, yeah. It's very good, Chad. It is very, very good. There you go. Mix of green and red. The orgy the orgy lit to your left. Yo, it is, it is lit, Chad. She's now an armed lolly. Remember, chat, an armed lolly is a secure lolly. Tinder boxes. Mm -hmm. Hey, look, it's that blue thing we need. Oh, actually, no, we need a, a green one. Well, we don't need it anymore. Now we're healthy. Until you get diseased. That is true. Uh. MC fell in, fell in love with the slut. Come on. You can't help who you fall in love with, chat. I don't know who I prayed to. You finished, you finished praying? I think I just prayed. Uh, oh, I'll pray to Gogroth, okay. I'm not going to pray to any of the gods. They seem, uh, horrible. You already prayed. He yeah. doesn't know. He doesn't know. He's not going to answer my prayers. Wally. Orgy Forest. Uh, Benjamin Boswell of $2. Would you ever review it? If not, Fury the Game? Which one? Beastars? Yeah, B he's talking about Beastars. Yeah, I mean, uh, I liked it. I think I actually talked about Beastars before. Uh, maybe. Like the first season? I'm pretty sure I did. Also, Fury is a fun game. It is very good. Pray to the sex god. Mm. <laughs> yeah, everyone's freaking out. I was like, that's the orgy area. It's like, yeah, let's not go there. It is, in fact, the orgy area. <coughs> Bunny party, free <laughs> healing. Free healing. No, go back to the hot rabbit girl. Oh, you would say some shit like that, chat. The statue is for all Mar and raising affinity with the gods unlocks more spells you can learn in exchange for lesser souls at the Hexen. Yep. All stuff we don't have access to. Oh, God. Yeah, don't get... No dog, run. <laughs> run. We don't fuck with dogs in this house. Yeah, no. Better things to do. Better things to Better do. Better things to do. Any good horror mangas or video games you guys recommend? Ah, uh, this one's pretty good. Too many. It is very, very interesting. Mm-hmm. Get mudded, get mudded, get mudded, get mudded. Chat. Oh, yeah, that's the homunculus. That dog smelled food. It did. It wanted to eat a child. 
tasty child. Can you blame it? Okay. So now I guess we go down in the prison and save our friend. You can't try. Ew. Little girl about to get nodded. Chat. <laughs> Behave. Ah! <laughs> Look at the little girl. <laughs> I was gonna say, yeah, you, you just you ain't got legs now. Is there a way to prevent that? Not die? <laughs> Don't worry, the little girl can take all can fight all your fights for you. Nice legs. Who sold them to you? You want to jump down the second pit? <laughs> <laughs> This is gonna be fun, chat. It's gonna be fun, chat. What do you, like? What even are legs, chat? What the hell are these rocks? Rocks? Oh, a soul stone. Yay! What does a soul stone do? Uh, oh, damn it! As soon as I clicked on it, I backed out. Fuck. Is it the soul stone you confuse with the uh, with the dagger? I don't remember. I don't remember. You can. Those are not rocks. <laughs> well, what are they? Cradle Homer to raise if enemies break it. the blood portal and allow you to go between ritual circles. I'm not praying to the do? evil god. Chat. Uh, Beastars has the most traction, and Lugosi eats the de uh, the deer's foot and becomes a felon who can't do shit in society. Uh, because he's a felon, uh, can marry the bunny. Uh, you learn that Beastars is some prestigious position given to uh, uh, exceptional animals. Lugosi kind of stops a race war, but doesn't get uh, get the title, so it just ends with his relationship being kind of in the dumps because uh, he's a controlling asshole. To TLDR, imagine Naruto never becoming the Hokage. So a better a better Naruto then. <laughs> Uh, broke so all the eggs. Dead, are on dead enemies. Okay, that's right. Yeah. I guess I pissed it off. Yeah. Uh. Let's use uh, the soul stones on dead bosses to get their souls as strong accessories. Yeah. I, I remember now. Swing, swing, bitch, swing. We can only target. We can only target the wing. That's interesting. Okay. Unfortunate. Uh, I shall go after the cave mother. I'll let... Cut the tits first, can't. Yeah, it's only let me target the wing. That is interesting. It might be a bug. Now you don't have any legs. But wouldn't you let me do it with the little girl? And that's the oh, part yeah. that's weird. Oh, God. Now the little girl lost her leg. Yeah. Oh, we can just straight cut our tits off. Uh, yeah, you gotta cut the wings, then the tits. Move the mouse, then see if that helps. It's a common issue. There is no mouse, chat. Yeah, there is no mouse. Real short, and Carnese has broken legs. I mean, you can only hit when you... Oh, we lost our arm. Yeah. A little girl lost a leg. Yeah. That's why we cut the tits off. Okay. Ow. Yep, yep. That makes sense. Damn, they are, they are focusing down the little girl. They really are. Interesting. Okay. So if you cut her tits off, it immediately. Honestly, Chad, I thought we were gonna, I thought we were gonna lose that. I mean, we're missing our legs and our arm. Uh, I think we have green herb though. I have a mix of green and red. Uh. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by its toe. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna use the bone saw myself, cause frankly, uh, I ain't got no legs to, to worry about anyway. That is true. Has no legs <laughs> on the saw. <laughs> then how do I have an infection in my foot? You, I mean, it, the economy is in shambles. <laughs> it's back. <big. laughs> <laughs> cut his tits. Cut his tits. Fuck off! Go home, you stupid bitch! Ah, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I 
think you should go back to the hood. No! If the girl dies, you instantly lose. Go for the head! I believe in you! <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, you can go ahead and flail, I guess. <laughs> Say goodnight, Floppy. <laughs> <laughs> If you give the girl to the moon woman, she'll heal your party. We're not giving the girl away, chat. <laughs> what did we learn? <laughs> uh, you need to strap pillows to the bottom of your feet when you jump down wells. That is true. <laughs> we actually did learn something. Don't jump down the well. Get, boy, get rotting meat and recruit the moonless already. No! I have rotting meat. Golly, go, lolly, go fuck the go go fuck the, the the bunnies. Go fuck the snow bunnies. We have to get it prepared to where I can swap over in case it gets <laughs> a little. It goes a little too racy. There is a dude fucking a chick in the ass. I mean, like, straight, straight up, up like yeah. we like I I noticed that and I was like, yep. <laughs> Don't jump down holes, idiot. Well, you can jump down the one in the courtyard, chat. Aw, we don't get a we don't get to get the cat book. Yeah. It's the creation of life. Yeah. Spirit Hunger is one of those turn-based combat RPGs. It's kind of like a puzzle game. Every every enemy has a, a certain sequence you you want to fight them in. Yeah. RNG can still fuck you, but if you follow mm -hmm. the sequence, it's not as bad. Yeah. Snow bunnies in this era doesn't exist because we're in yeah. Europe. They would if they could, chat. Uh, creation of life. Yay! No strongness. Uh. Just mark to the stream as educational. You can get away with far worse on YouTube. You can. That is true. This is a walkthrough. I'm teaching people how to play the game. Hmm. So if you mix human blood with a black fluid, you can create a fetus. Mm -hmm. But the fetus is always in agony and always hungry. Well, that sounds like a fetus problem. Really does, and it never gets bigger. That was bullshit. The Ottomans came and fucked a lot. No, they didn't. Chat. No, they didn't. She's a good girl, so get her. Also, throw rocks and holes to see if you uh, if you can safely jump down. I don't think we have any. Uh. Jumps down hole. I'm just like James from Sunlight Hill. Ah! My legs. <laughs> Ottomans aren't black. Exactly, chat. You can feed the fetus to the big ball human amalgamation. No! Nope. Oh, well, yeah, I guess, I guess you can. And they sure say it's it's a useless being. It is. The ball being doesn't know. But it's literally called a, a human hydra. Do you really want to touch that? Oh, I got recipes. Feed moonless raw meat. I am not touching moonless. Evil dog, chat. Evil dog. Yay. Oh, we got alchemy. Okay. All right. I'm surprised how easy you can make this game with exploits. Oh, for sure, for sure. I haven't really exploits just knowing what to do and what not to do. It, it, it's it's difficult in that way that like a good Souls game is, where he's a good pupper. Fuck you, chat. Yeah. It, it it's that kind of difficulty that like a good Souls game is, where when you're going in blind, you have no idea what the fuck to do and it whoops your ass. But the minute you start figuring things out, it just kind of snowballs into not being as brutal. Mm -hmm. Like uh, obviously you can still get fucked by RNG, but I mean yeah, yeah that's fair enough. Yeah. You know, it is, it is part of the rules. But being able to, uh, like, figure out, like, okay, you fight this enemy in this specific sequence, and you can really minimize the amount of damage it does. Yeah. Uh, it's like, yeah, that's actually really helpful. It's like FTL. You know what fucks you up, yeah? Yeah. Ja, yes. Yeah. He's a Viking. Yes. Hey, do you, do you mind traveling? No doubt it would be for you. I won't be traveling with you. Why not? <laughs> Cunt. I'm scared. 
dick. This is an RPG Maker game? I believe so. Yeah. Zero out of ten haven't seen one rape yet. Yeah. Cabbage. Throwing knife. Cabbage. Turnip. Uh, blue herb. Cabbage. Is this guy actually cool or is he going to try to kill us? Mm -hmm. Oh, he's turning into a butterfly. Okay. I'm transforming! You know, Hydra's completely pointless. If you, uh, if you have the fetus, you can give it the pocket cat for items. But only if you don't have the grill. If you have the grill, pocket cat only wants her. Yeah. We're not giving in to pocket cat, chat. I feel like no matter what deal I make with pocket cat, it will only hurt me. Oh, green, green herb. herb. <laughs> you can try to feed the dog raw meat, Lolly. Where is it? Oh, it's that one we ran into? Sure. I mean, sure. It's only, thir it's only a 30 second walk. Alright. Fucking cat only wants to fuck the little girl. Yeah. So that one. <laughs> you I, fucked us. I do believe you might have fucked us. Well, be careful with those explosive files. You don't want to do anything dangerous. Thoughts on Superman, Superman's son, John Kent, hugging fascist. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Mm. Throw a stick. Throw the stick. TM chat. TM. What? I don't have any sticks. He just consent isn't a thing. Oh, yet. it's in talk oh. menu. Okay, okay. Uh, talk. Uh, and I'll have her guard just to be safe. Throw the grill. Off of rotten meats. Uh, yeah, let's, uh, uh, those aren't good dogs. These are the only dogs that aren't evil, chat. Alright, there you go, now you can run. I thought it, I fucking thought it locked you in. Yeah, right? Second. Feet don't fail me now! Yeah. Game, uh, game looks cool. Game is actually really fucking yeah, cool. Yeah, Fairy Hunger's pretty fun. Uh, in all seriousness, though, uh, down, down where you broke your legs, there's a dog that you can recruit. Okay. That being said, you got to get down without breaking your legs, so. Yeah. Uh, I could theoretically... Ah, uh, won't let me. Okay. Mm -hmm. I was going to be like, I could probably cut one of those bodies down and take the, the rope if it would let me. Good dog is the evil-looking one. I know, it's bullshit. <laughs> well, it teaches you not to be judgmental. Listen, chat, if you have more than a single pair of eyes, I'm going to kill you. White girls fuck dogs. They really fuck them. White, White girls, girls fuck, fuck dogs. dogs. They really fuck them. Uh, have you played the sequel, Fear and Hunger Termina? Yes. I have it. I don't think I've started it yet. Because I know that's the one that's more blatantly Silent Hill inspired. You got a bunch of stuff going on, for sure. Yeah. Uh, and I do want to see. Investigate. If you have to guess, Pit seemed to... Uh, I have a pair of eyes. Do you have more than a single pair of eyes? There's a lever in the prison uh, that has an elevator for the hole. Oh, okay, okay. So that's kind of why you want to make your way through the prison. Yeah. Uh, search. Fuck your bad feeling. I want to search. I disturbed my sleep. What is wrong with you? Darkness? Yeah. Yeah. This music sounds really bad. He's got eyes on the inside. Come on, he's just a he's just a single head, bro. Uh just throw a punch, bro. Just run. <laughs> uh we are going to run, little girl.
A lot more than inspired by Silent Hill. One of the playable characters is just Jotaro. <laughs> okay, so... Take the right path. Try the right path. Yeah, path. don't piss off the old man who's just trying to prepare for his ritual. Understandable. It's Jover. I really didn't like that music. That's what that's <laughs> what inspired that decision where it's like that's very like th that was boss music. You could escape that? Yeah. I see. <laughs> I see. So he just has it on. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh running running is a uh Okay. Running is a is a coin toss. You can talk your way out of this, just not now. Mm-hmm. The text appears above the enemy. The sight of a woman excites it. Yeah. That was instant kill music. Oh, God. All right. He did cast darkness. So... I guess I'll aim for the ballista. So, why is your cock out? They, they attach blades to the tip of their dick, chat. Okay. He's loading an arrow in, so I'm going to attack the ballista again, try to cut... Try to cut that off. Hey. <laughs> now the stinger's gonna thrust. Uh, cut the dick off. Mm -hmm. Little girl. They both take debuffs because they're afraid of dicks. Yeah, little girl, heal me. Yeah. He attempted the tackle, and no, now we no, just finished. The him. tackle is in the flail. Yeah. Also, yeah, torso. Ooh. Late turn circumcision. Uh, and since the little girl has a dagger, fuck it. Yeah, why not? As long as she doesn't get hit. She Yay. got hit, but... Yeah. She just took damage. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Wasn't even that bad of damage. Why is his dick bigger than his leg? Because he has good genes, Chad. There we go. I really should have refined some of those down to a potion, but, you know, fuck you. One cloth, two iron arrows, okay. Yeah. That'd be useful if I can get the uh, one dude to join the party, the archer. Mm -hmm. And can I fuck with this ballista? Oop, I don't want to be on the side of it. Yeah, so be careful, we got, we got flyers. Uh, I will use the tinderbox. Hmm. It's all black magic, Jack. I think the fears are randomized. Yeah, the, the fears are randomized when you start a game. Got a white file. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Salami. Dried meat. Uh, Captain Desiree 2. Okay. A naked prisoner crucified on a sacrificial statue with his guts hanging out just another day in the dungeons. P Pog. Uh, more, uh, more and more troops committing suicide. More food for those left. Orders to let those cultists do their wicked rituals. Anything goes. Yeah. The captain is just like, fuck it. I don't care. <laughs> this was a bad idea. Holy shit, this place is evil. They want Griffith so they can fuck him. Yeah. Blow the mines. Okay. No, I wish I didn't look up. Uh, yeah, he is. Yeah. He is literally Griffith, betrayed by a kingdom and locked in a fucking dirty ass dungeon. He's literally Griffith. When confronted with the truth, the Kami will lie. He will make things up and he will say words he doesn't know. Chat, okay. I, just because you don't know what the word means doesn't mean it's not a real word. Uh, guard. Oh, fuck. That's unfortunate. Oh, that's fortunate. Uh, right, you still gotta chop it off. It's the most dangerous thing he's got. Yeah, it's the most dangerous. He can strip tick limbs. There we go. Yep. So now he's literally Griffith, bro. That sounds like a skill issue. Yeah. Cut the stinger. Okay. Since he did the attack, let's go ahead and and every three turns. Yeah. 
And he's measuring your proportions with his dick! Uh. Torso, torso. Yeah, torso. Now let the little girl attack the torso, too. This is completely out of fucking sequence. Torso. <laughs> you have the little girl attack his leg. <laughs> eh. It worked! Fuck it! Okay. Was that his dick? Yes. Yes, it was. Severed arm, leg, and a skeletal arm. Yeah. And the cell keys! Hey. Uh, rotten meat? Rotten meat. Rotten meat's for the dogs, right? Yeah. Oil. Fresh meat, no. Oh, yep, this is the lever. Yeah. Run. Really, Ow. really fast. Yeah. Infection and blood. So unfortunately, we gotta waste our fucking green herb. Yeah, fucking asshole. So we got two yet, two left though. So yeah, no, just yeah, don't but... don't walk over that again. <laughs> fucking idiot. Cause fuck you. That's why. Don't you ever tell me what to do. All right now, don't don't walk over it again. You're lucky we only have one. That's what I thought, bitch. Now, won't you stick that fucking explosive file in your mouth and do the world a favor? Okay, so not that one. Door versus door versus Far Farkaska, seven and zero. Oh. Cut off the leg. It's not pretty anymore. Okay. Uh, tails never fails. This failed us every time. Not this Especially time. Especially this time. Uh, Molly, he, Molly, Molly. He is insisting just on a get fight. Out of here. Yeah, he is insisting on a fight. But I only what? need to investigate a few more of the cells. Woke up and apparently like World War Three started or some shit. What the fuck did I miss? It's okay. It's okay, Master Chief. It's okay. It wasn't World War Three. It was uh, fucking Hamas. Hamas. Okay, we got some blood. Nope. <laughs> Listen, chat. There's one more. There's one more domino that has yet to topple before we. Oh. Damn it. It's fine. Really? You can run. I believe he insists upon himself. Master Chief? How many years until the thing Berserk again? Did he catalog you guys saying for my kids so they see the whole progress of it? Ten. Ten years. Yeah, it's ten. If you find a strange doll in a cell, give it to the little girl. Yeah, but I don't think we've found one yet. Nah, uh, not yet. I don't even think... I doubt there's one in there. When will we meet Gurpico? Never. I keep trying to fight the doors. Ten and O, chat. Ten and O. Wait, maybe the little girl can hit the lock. We don't have the uh, the lockpick skill with her anymore, so. Yeah. But we can talk to uh, what's his face. Oop, mushroom. Mushroom. Nom 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 nom. Oh, Holly, run. Yeah. Six and zero. Oh, door wins. Call it. Use magic missile in the darkness, but we don't mm -hmm. know magic. That's one of your guys' favorite spooky movies. Mine is Poltergeist. Poltergeist is really good. It is a good it's one. It's got some good moments. I really like Juon. That uh, one is pretty good. That, that one's really good. Alien is my favorite horror movie. The first one. Oh, God. So he's straight about to be raped by the fucking torture if we didn't kill him. Yep. He's got a pretty face, you know? Real pretty face. He got a pretty mouth. This is the scariest moment of my life. Ma'am, this is the scariest moment of my life. It'd be a shame if somebody castrated you, boy. <laughs> the dimensional merge started, but it was interrupted like the third impact. Billions are dead, and you've, you've been cross-connected to just an RPG. But instead of Pokemon, you're now married to one, one of the odd eyes dragons. Which one? Which one are you? Are you allowing to cuck you? Chat, I would rather die. Also, the XC's one. 
Oop, got some silver. Dirt. Uh, three silver coins. Quill. And this is the area where you just flat out don't fight people. They are very mean. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, statue of a maiden and a crow. Hey! If you kill all the enemies, this is a super safe bed to sleep in. If. Yeah, because it's like our... Our enemies appear to be very big and very strong. Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon, baby. It's a cool dragon. I'm not going to lie. All right. But the XZ's one is awesome. Because, like, how the fuck do you fight that guy? Die. It gives you one free save. Okay. So if you sleep in it once, you're safe. Everything past that, you're going to have to kill people if you don't want a coin toss. Uh, We can try it. Yeah, here, we'll try it. Everybody gets one lolly. Yeah, somewhat safe. Okay. Drake was too much for Bill Gates. Does does Bill Gates own the Bing? Does he own the Bing chat? Yeah, it straight up says someone was uh, watching us while we sleep, so yeah. we gotta go. I wonder if he had a big dick chat. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if we uh, fell asleep with Top Cat. <laughs> or whatever that thing was. We haven't interacted with the cat yet, thank yeah. God. What was his name again? I forgot. Oh, was... Funny Cat Man. Yeah, well, it was the Open cat. Open your inventory, I don't remember. I actually, I, don't, I, remember. I actually don't fucking remember. Uh, where'd it go? I don't think we have the book. But we picked it up like eight times. Pocket Cat, okay, Pocket yeah. Pocket Cat. Try again and see what happens if you fill that twin cost. Well, yeah, let's you... go get raped. Uh, Lazarus, five bucks in the movie Event Horizon. Do you believe that the chaos dimension was hell, or was it supposed to be something similar to hell? I like it's, to think it's, it's full-blown hell. I was going to say, it's supposed to be explicitly hell. Yeah. All right, so let's go check the well. We can do that. That is an option that is allowed to us. Yep, the elevator. Yep. Well, there's a moon doggy down here. I need to find it. Make friends. Make nice, nice. It likes rotting meat. Okay. Let's go find the dog. There's a pile of bodies. Nice, cute, even, you know. You also find a soul. Uh, you use the soul stones on dead enemies, and they'll give you shit that you can use later on. Oh, I think I hear the dog. Let me light a torch. I can't see shit. I still can't really see shit, but you know. Don't fuck with that. Yeah, I can hear the dog. It's the penis god, chat. The penis god. Bow bow. Bow bow. No! Bed bow. Search the chest. The don't interact with Pocket Cat. <laughs> oh, oh god. Molly, don't don't mash! <laughs> The fuck are you doing here? There are children of light, those destined to walk under bright sun. People who uh, do well in all hardships. Even in the darkest hour, they feel warmth of their loved ones. People of darkness, depression, and sorrow. Oh no, he's fucking real. <laughs> oh no, he's real, yeah. Those humans are able to draw energy from darkness. They're not dependent on others. They only need darkness. How many rotting meat do we need? Uh, I think we've got two or three. I don't want gold or silver. I will trade items for human children. No. Come on. Don't look at him. Don't make eye contact. Come on, baby girl. Come on. Don't. We're not fucking with him. Uh, so, is Doggy over here? Or? Uh, I think it's in the overworld here. Across the bridge. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. It appears to be him. Okay. So we talk. Use talk no jutsu. And pray we have enough meat. 
do have a shitload of rotting meat. Just keep keep offering rotting meat. Bucky gets a literal redder in this speech. <laughs> Yay, litter joint. Yay! So Moonless can eat rotting meat as a uh, a hunger item. So if she's ever hungry, toss rotting meat because no one else can eat it. Moonless, my beloved. Yeah, the hundred eyes doggo. The hell is this? It looks like that thing you killed. Oh yeah, it's the cave mother. Mm -hmm. Or at least one of them. I assume there are multiple. A cave mother even. <laughs> oh my god, pocket cat summoning fucking bats over here, man. He's really pissed we didn't give it children. Maybe you deserve to get your fucking ass pushed in. Pocket cat, please. Uh. Apparently the mines are very bad. Mm-hmm. Oh, we found a shirt bow. Oh, we got our, we got a rock. Moonless has a hidden mechanic where if you visit certain spots, up to 15 total, he gains new moves and upgrades. Uh, I'm an alchemist. Lift the kettle on. I'm in a bit of a hurry. We read books that he wrote. Uh, okay. Okay, I guess. I mean, I, I guess. Okay. I mean, I'm like, I, I want to talk. Right. Can I, link to, can I get a link to the server for my brother? Uh, I don't even have links to the server. Yeah, we stopped handing out free ones. It's like too many people were asking and it led to too much shit. Mr. Hands. Uh, Lazarus Fatbox think uh, they think they should have killed a <clears throat> Atreus and got a war, then that's how Ragnarok happens, or is it too predictable? And it would have been... It, that is one of those where that would just be kind of repeating the same trade of, oh, then Kratos loses another kid. Mm -hmm. The problem is we never actually get to fucking see Kratos get a new family, and we're forced to like immediately... like connect to them, and that's why I didn't like, and I thought it was boring as fuck. If Kratos doesn't care, how can I care, chat? Mm-hmm. He is well past the point where he would have trouble connecting to a new family. Right. He would very much care. Because it's like, for the love of God, I don't want to lose anyone ever again. Do you get on Discord server? Is it subscribe star or, do or dono? It is subscribe star. Yeah. Dun, dun. Keep saying we can attack it, but I think that's a very bad idea. I mean, you Ooh. can attack most things, but do you think you can take a living armor in a fight? I don't. <laughs> I really don't. Is it that sexy armor that's just a living bikini? I'd fuck that armor, chat. been playing Dark Tide since it released on Xbox. Really good so far. What are your thoughts on it? Uh, the Warhammer game? Unfortunate. We're gonna die. Uh, let us bail the it's fuck okay. out. It's okay. Yeah, Dark Tide's alright. Now that they're actually going back and trying to like uh, re rebalance everything and all that. I don't think it's as bad as it was. Mm -hmm. Still runs like fucking ass though. Like holy shit. Yeah. It'd be like that, you know. Ah. What the fuck? They do that. You you lost both your legs now. Fuck that thing up. Fuck you. Kill girl, kill. You know what? Fuck you. Take its legs as reparations. Oh, they have a dog. Bow, 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 bow. Yeah, you would say some fucking shit like that, chat. Yay. You're, uh... Yeah.
it radiates a faint blue light. And you trade those in at a certain place. Okay. Or a certain thing. Talk to the yellow mage you get in a, an eclipse talisman. Too late, chat. We were way past the point of fucking talking. He took my goddamn legs. No, he only took your legs. Talk to him. Talk to him, Lolly. Fucking bullshit. All right, uh, and rotten meat. You should have the dog carry you. Unfortunately, the dog doesn't do piggyback. Ugh. Rush the yellow mages if you don't want to lose limbs. That is a fair assessment, Chad. I didn't realize what was going on. If anything ever appears under your character, run. Preferably towards whatever you see. Should have worn some leg guards. Wouldn't have lost your legs. We have leg guards on, though. Yeah, I mean, this was just strictly like a fucking, uh... I mean, that, that was just magic. Yeah. You still need to kill the yellow mage, that's weird, but the Eclipse Talon is something that you need to recruit the floating head. Ah, uh, we got better. We got better people anyways, chat. You ever try talking to the white whale A Ahab? Huh? You ever think about that? But, but the white whale was just a metaphor, chat. It didn't actually exist. I mean, he does talk to the white whale. He talks about how much he fucking hates it. <laughs> yeah. You see, he looks in the mirror and he talks about how much he wants to fucking die. Okay, I guess we're running. You can't get your limbs back, but it requires sacrificing the little girl. And uh, let's be real, chat. We're, uh, we're just going to make it through this, okay? I think that dog could have taken it. <laughs> Floating head's best part. Remember, high damage, you can never die. You need a number of things to get him, though. He split his lungs with blood and thunder. Yeah. What? Uh, uh, Where'd she get to stand in fights? Because they didn't want to animate her without legs. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Little girl, stand on my back. Little girl, piss on that dead guy. What? Why? Piss on him. Little girl, I've got a. I've got... <laughs> Run. I can't. I ain't got no legs. You've got rush. Oh, this might be the Wendigo cave. All you need is the Eclipse Element and the Cube of Depths, which you need to advance in the nope. ancient city. Yeah. Oh, come on! <laughs> yeah. God damn it! <laughs> yeah. Fucking dick. Remember where they are. Alright. So go ahead and try and sleep while you're still here. So That's that a good point. Yeah, so that we can lose this coin toss. Heads. We've had too many heads. We have to lose. Yep, tails. Let us see what happens. Uh, Crow. Crow man! I'm the Crow! Hey, you remember that guy you said... You remember that guy you were talking about? That guy That guy you asked if he was good? Yeah, it's Crow man. He's your, uh... Holy yeah. shit! He breaks bones. <laughs> oh my god! And uh, and takes heads. Uh. <laughs> Flock of crows. Oh god! Took your eyes. Holy shit! Swing, lolly, swing. He's gonna make you die slowly. Get crowed. It's a little base for two Did you meet my boy Kahara? Not yet. Now he gets <laughs> to eat you. <laughs> God damn! Yeah. It's Crow Man! Oh no! 
It wasn't an oh moment, oh no moment until a little girl lost her head chat. <laughs> yeah, not gonna lie, like seeing a small child get her fucking head bitten off, it's like, Jesus! So now you can't sleep in that bed without doing the coin toss until you kill all enemies in this area. In which case, Crow Man will leave you alone. <laughs> Goddamn, Crow Man, what do you want from me? First thing you should ever do against Crow Mauler is use a red vial on his head. Yeah, but I don't think we have a red vial, anyways. Uh, I don't believe so. We have a blood vial. Yeah. Status fucked around. Found out. It's like, geez, that was like. Man. <laughs> oh, yeah, we gotta get the dog back, Fuck. Well, we, we have all we, what we need. I was gonna say, do, is the thing already down? Oh, thank God. Yeah, because uh, we entered that room after we basically cleared out the prison. Mm -hmm. I say cleared out, but you know we didn't fight everything. Right, right. Do do enemies respawn or 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 do they stay dead in each area? Yeah, yeah, they stay dead. So theoretically, you could clear out the entire fucking dungeon. Yeah, that's why. Uh, that's why clearing it out lets you sleep. At that point, yeah, you would basically just be guts. Riley Freeman, Quark, pause. He can roast anyone for being gay with 100% accuracy. So you just trying to get close and explode all over a nigga? And you be sweaty too? It's nitroglycerin! Nigga, you glistening? <laughs> I think he's gonna kill him. Oh, almost fucked that up. Don't hit the doggo. I'm not hitting him. I'm giving her meat. Meat. Sort of the further uh, you get in the uh, the game, it changes in some areas. That's not an immediate problem, chat. Okay, so yeah, obviously further in the further in the area, there might be enemies that respawn, which that would make sense. How often you dream about men kissing? Shut up. <laughs> It's not fair, it should have been me. Moon can definitely kill the crow. Ah, fuck. Walked right into that. Uh, Moonless gets two attacks, I believe. There Didn't we go. even need it. There we go. Uh, And I want to avoid Pocket Cat because he scares me. Yeah! Moonless marks her territory! And we're not talking to Pocket Cat. Yeah. This is I hear about thinking of men kissing. Uh, boondocks. I swear to God, it's a boondocks reference. <laughs> chat, you thinking about, uh, thinking about niggas kissing? Pretty gay, chat. Also, yeah, if you go to a ledge you're not sure if you can survive, you can use a stone. That's my Dark Souls reference for the day, chat. Uh, leather helmet. Dante and Nero are gonna are gonna say shit, and it's gonna be the absolute worst. Only Nero can swear. Yeah, the, on, in the anime. We can give her a skeleton arm. Oh shit! Yeah, it's fucking awesome, and it actually does better. Yeah. Yeah, the point of the dagger is to uh, infuse it. Is the black dress okay? Mm. Uh. Worse. Okay. How do we infuse? Uh, we don't have the stuff we need yet. Okay. So now she's slapped. This bitch dead. Boondock Saints. I believe in tinderbox supremacy. There we go. We noticed you. Oh, you need a soul stone and two infuse. Uh, do we have soul stone? Uh, we should have picked one up, I think. But we need other stuff too. Yeah, we have one. So yeah, we'll, uh, I assume you have to find a specific person. <laughs> Thing. Make her say, I've got a bone to pick with you on every attack. I've got a bone to pick with you. 
I hope the I hope the yellow mage takes the little girl's legs first. Moldy bread. Two eggs. Anyone remember the Dante's Inferno game? Yeah, I agree. I remember it being aggressively mid. It was aggressively okay, and I was kind of pissed that you weren't a crusader for like all of it, and they they wanted you to be like rip off Kratos. Because I like the idea of like a crusader fighting his way through hell, but I didn't like all the over the top God of War stuff. Mm -hmm. It was like a more grounded hack and slash. That be that actually be kind of sick. To be fair, the, tut the tutorial is killing death, so it's like Castlevania. No, I know, I know, but you get my point. You're on the Final Destination movies. They yeah, okay. Yeah, it's it's one of those of like you you know what you're getting with each one. It's it basically amounts to which one has your favorite kills. Yeah. Beeline. Oh god! I think you survived. We did. Yeah. Um. Kill. We're gonna have to kill it, but you can talk to him. You can talk to him and get the thing. I will try. Yeah. And little girl will guard. You ever read the webtoon Scoob and Shag? Is that the one with with evil? Uh. Uh, which one channeled uh destruction? It's either Almer or Gro or Gro Goroth. I don't remember which one. I think it's Almer. <coughs> uh. Well, let's get to next return, and she might keep you alive. Let us. That's the hand he's signaling with. Uh, Kobrok is preparing to banish all those vamps from the, from the the noble white folk country. It's a weirdly on point character for Uncle Ruckus. I like it. God damn. Yeah. Hurting. No, my dog. No. No. Grow Goroth. Kill one of the legs now. Okay. Now oh. talk to him, right? Or no. I think we're past the point of diplomacy. True. What thing happened today? There's a girl in my work that was kind of cute, but I saw she had a, a, pro a progress flag on her water bottle. So I was like, hell no, I don't need the juju in my life right now. Very smart. I'm just saying, Chad, it's on you. They took my dog's leg! It's okay, I'll give you meat. The Bork Buster. Yeah, I completely forgot which god was the destruction one. It must have been Gogoroth. Oh, Lord Emperor. What a blessing it is to serve the White Golden Throne. Uh, Soulstone. Disgusting. Just disgusting, chat. Mm, you got a, a lesser soul. Make a peg leg, yeah. I mean, it seems like it's fine because it bites mostly, so... I'm gonna say, yo, no, she's fine. It doesn't affect her. Remember, on the right, there's one that you need to beeline for. Let's go left. Ooh. He's an evil person. I'm kind of glad these people being loud and obnoxious makes it easy to avoid the bullshit. It keeps them uh, out of certain workplaces with the pronoun with pronouns in the resume. Okay, as long as the cave dweller. Yeah, as long as the employee. Oh god. As long as the employee doesn't. Uh, I'm sorry. So as long as the employer doesn't make that known, you're good. Uh, I've seen the anime canon. Apparently, it's part of Type Moon. I've not. Almer. Uh, Almer is Pocket Cat. So Almer is the Moon God. Almer's pocket cat? Moon God! That's interesting. Speaking of Uncle Ruckus, do you. Oh, God! Alright, you're, uh. You're dead as shit. You're dead as shit. <laughs> we could talk about this. Run. We, we could talk about this. You can't win this fight, even if you had the resources necessary. Speaking of Uncle Ruckus, do you genuinely think uh, none of them thought that through or at least knew exactly and just what want the business to fill permanently. What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Run away! Yeah, we can jump down. We're gonna break our ankles. Kill! Woo! Right. It's our, it's our chance to it's our chance to talk to him again. It's our salty run back even. 
I'll still have uh, Moonless want to kill, but yeah. I will talk. Because you're gonna you're gonna need to kill. Uh, took off one of his fucking arms. Yeah. Uh, Dodge, do you serve? Channel destruction. Go growth. Go growth. Correct. Okay. Yay. God damn. She was pissed. Yeah. Check his corpse. Damn RPG okay, maker. Oh, okay, there we go. There. Elixir of mind. Oh, unfortunate. Did we check the the other one? Yeah. Okay. Black vampires beaten with whips. Out of touch, I say. Okay, people. The moon god is Rar. Almer is based off of Gnosticism. What the fuck even is Gnosticism, chat? I think it's like respecting the idea of God, but not believing in one. It's called being agnostic, so I guess. Also, I ref <laughs> I will not let a fucking cat be my god, chat. Especially if my especially if my fucking well, especially if it demands children. Right. Man. <laughs> Uh, Almer Burgers. is not Pocket Cat God. That is a different God. Almer's God of the Sun. Ah, okay. Uh, Kanan is not part of Type Moon. Yeah, it was a spinoff of, uh, of a story guest written by uh, Nasu for a Wii visual novel mini anth anthology game. Oh, I didn't know he was talking about Kanan. That's just fucking weird. Essentially, it means our God is not the God or something. Really, uh, really weird heathen shit. I'm really, I'm, I'm really happy these cave people are cool with me just, like, robbing them. They're blind. They don't care. That is true. Uh, so now we have a cursed mace. Okay, it's cursed. But it does do good damage. Okay. Hmm. It do good damage, but the sword is also... The sword also dismember. Oh, Gnosticism is everything is evil. Okay. Well, that's dumb as shit, but I do I do understand now. I mean, for this setting. <laughs> this... Okay, okay. If you if your entire life is based around those weird fucked up castles, sure, Gnosticism's fine. Uh, you walk slowly with the mace. Oh, okay, curse for hurting ghost. Ghost. Just like in Judea. Uh, chunky coon for a dollar. Uh, Halo and Shota. Oh, just to be safe. Uh, back from celebrating my older sister's birthday. Now time to enjoy the stream. By the way, I'm thinking of enjoying your subscribe star, and I want to know if it's all uh, right to recommend a game, or it gonna be, uh, or is it, or uh, or it gonna own, gotta only be what's lifted anime movie show. I'm okay with games. Yeah. Uh, Mark nine nine for a dollar. Remember, guys, trust nobody, not even yourself. Mm -hmm. Can't trust. If you ask Chad a question, you can't trust Chad. There's only like three people in chat that I trust. Apparently we need to look for an item that is more round. Four? Uh, for uh, for this area. No, oh, okay. I oh, you're an arrow. If only. <laughs> I'm dead ass not sure how this game works. I'm reading flavor text and guessing. That's how you're supposed to play the game. Uh, I'm not really sure there's anything worth buying. Nothing you can really use right now. And eh, cave dweller tip. <laughs> Why would you talk to her, Lolly? <laughs> Why would you talk to a woman? Beater. Beater corpse. Lolly, you, you just got her killed. Beater corpse. I feel like we need to get out of here. <laughs> Go back to the merchant and see what he has. Nothing nothing really good right now. He has it's, like opium powder, yeah. blue vials. Powder, blue vials, explosive fire. Wait, actually, blue vials are actually really fucking useful. Let's go get some real quick. They're healing items, but we already have some, don't we? Yeah, but you never have enough. Yeah. That's one dead cave dweller. <laughs> ah, Europe. Oh god, we stumbled on Afghanistan. I catch you wanting to be something, bitch. I catch you wanting to go to the surface. 
it's the uh, it's the indigenous people that Super Eyepatch said were offensive. Yeah, Super Eyepatch Wolf thinks Native Americans are these. That's fucked up, ain't it? That's fucked up. How do you determine any culture from these people? They're weird, like cave people. The merchant wears a. I think it's called a turban. So not Native American at all. I don't think they have any culture. I think they're just weird. Their culture are like the elves from uh, Skyrim. Yeah, there you go. It's just an altar of darkness. Hey, old man, I gotta steal your shit. You should try talking to him. You don't seem to care. <laughs> uh. The cube. The cube. The cube. I feel like if I take that, everyone wants me dead. Yeah, but it is required to progress. <laughs> All right. Little girl, watch my back. Little girl, take the cube. They are pissed. They are very pissed. You just took their holy artifact. It's fine. They worship the king in yellow. And you can't prove me wrong, chat. I mean, this is the area we started noticing the weird priests. Don't, don't, don't walk into the mouth. <laughs> oh, God. Lament confi uh, configuration. Yeah. It does look like it, yeah. Well, chill with the racist Hassan. Yeah. 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 Throw hands. There we go. Why did you take the cube? It's necessary, chat. So Ravax Wolf is a fucking anomaly. Yeah. Got his damn. Damn. God damn. Holy shit. Uh, got his success off the back of a. Uh, Why'd you eat her tits? Off of uh, being angry at uh, super best friends. So, I mean, hey. There we go. It's dead. Get those sagging titties. No, Falmer. No, the. Their their buildings look similar to uh, the the Adobe type building that they make out of ash that the Dumber have. Okay. So now she's dead. If you give her if you give it eggs, it won't attack you for several turns. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If you kill the salmon uh, the salmon snake and get the the stone crown and wear it, you can take the cube without angering the cave people. Yeah, but you gotta kill the fucking snake. Cut off its tits. Oh shit. Good little girl. <laughs> Just fucking brain a child. Listen, I know I stole your god, but hitting a girl? That's uncalled for. I mean, she did cut off its tits. Yeah. It's fine. The, the merchant doesn't care. We gave the merchant money. <laughs> Ale. Explosives. Red vial. Red vial. Fucking domed a child, yeah. I miss the days of genuinely funny cartoons. Yeah! <laughs> Uncle Ruckus beating Obama with a brick. <laughs> Those were the good days, chat. Those were the good days. The dog also bit off its tits. Yeah. We might be able to talk. Oh, never mind. <laughs> we can talk it down. <laughs> And Moonlight just fucking ate it. Your reward for your reward for killing the salmon snake and using the soul stone eye is one of the two best accessories in the game. That is true. Uh, uh, the soul prevents all limb loss, bleeding, and infection. You also get to harvest a fuck ton of salmon snake meat. Yeah. This shit's racist. My favorite VTuber told me so. This is an evil depiction of Native Americans. Chat. Oh, we got a soul stone. Speaking of. Yep. Hmm. Bad Moonless. You only get rotten meat. <laughs> Are you going to tell the fucking dog no? She nods to you. We're friends. We're friends. What was that? What was going on? Uh, she's having a headache and she was scared, but she didn't want to say anything. Oh, okay. 
Good thing Capcom says you're Hispanic, Shota. Yeah. And it pisses me off. Actually, can I... Head pat the little girl. Ow. Well, first I want to craft. Fair. Uh... You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. So how do you go. beat the game? Uh, you do good, chat. You do good. Yeah. Uh, you have to go find, um, a dude who is, I think, in the deepest level of the dungeon. Uh, speaking of which... Let's get crunk. No show does memeing, but what culture could you get out of this depiction? No, no, no! Super Eyepatch Wolf did actually say that. Yeah. He said that these blue people were a racist depiction of Native Americans because he's a fucking idiot. I'm gonna have a little girl smoke. Rude around the office is you have a large cock. Well, how about you take your large cock and I take my large cock and we have a good time. Jerry, you ask this every weekend. <laughs> you found five silver coins. I think the merchant. I think the merchant's also pissed. Not until we brain him. Yeah, chat. Laugh at him. He has a small dick. Moonless, eat his dick. Moonless, sick his balls. <laughs> Actually, little girl, sick his balls. <laughs> Listen, chat. Anytime someone gets their dick cut off in media, it needs to have the R two D two scream play. Okay. <laughs> bow 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 bow. No, could, I was gonna say you could. I don't know. Yeah, Terrifying presence entered the room. I'm gonna go and, and one goon rightly called him out for making a problem out of nothing. Yeah. Well, yeah, because like this is a legitimately fantastic game. Here's the thing: Wendigoon didn't like outright deny it. He said, "Hey, I think it's fucked up to say like you're not able to take any aspect of any culture unless you're of that culture. It just breeds a, a fucking goddamn. I forget the word he used. You took their god and wiped them out. Good. Fuck them. Not all of them. Is the Red Dead 2 stream that gets louder? Ah! Uh, run! And hope you run good. Listen, uh. Contempt? No. It wasn't contempt. Not isolationism. Secularism? I think it was secularism. Yeah. Well, he is, his point is like, hey, listen. All of culture is about taking ideas from other cultures and, and kind of remixing them together, so saying that's a bad thing is, is really fucked up because all you're doing is basically saying everyone needs to stay separate forever. God damn. He, he is literally blocking our only way past. Hey, you just gotta run into him. And pray. Uh, we can't win this fight. Did I not hit run? Okay, okay, I thought, I thought you hit attack. There you go. Yeah, just run. Ah, fucker. All right, we got one more. We got one more. We can, run, we can run one more. One more. One more quick run. Yeah, let's go. One more. Come on, come on. We make it out of here. We're going to go to Cheers, man. I know you want to go to Cheers, man. What is the shift key on a controller? You got to bind it. Yeah, we, we're not using a controller anymore. We have, we have just said fuck it and switched to a keyboard. You have to go to your controller card for config through Steam. Yeah. Yep, yep. That's why we swapped to actual keyboard. You have a red file or a throwing knife? We do have a throwing knife. I don't think we have the red file. Then you pass. But honestly, it's just. Oh. Honestly, it's just better to run from it for the time being. Yeah. If you're in hunger, great ghost. choice. Did not Griffith die? We haven't gotten to not Griffith yet. Yeah, that's a ghost, so. What the Winnegoon talk in reference to? Uh, he called Super Eye Patch Wolf. Uh, he called him out for um, uh, saying that the blue cave dwellers are uh, uh, reminisce are supposed to depict Native Americans. Okay, I'm gonna have to feed Moonless Cheese. Red file to blind it, then the throwing knife to poison it, and then just guard until it dies. It will keep you alive, I guess. But like I said, I don't think we have a red file. 
You have an hour to get him, so he's probably dead. Yeah, I think we I think we spent over an hour. Ow. I mean the ideal is you get him in less than an hour, but like even if you save him, he fucks you over. He is Griffith. I guess let's let's attack the tomb. Alright. Uh how did have Patch Wolf make that leap in logic? He's an idiot. Because current thing. Current thing is him, chat. I don't remember seeing anything but that because I follow Wendy. Oh, no, I saw it. I saw it with my own two eyes, chat. Yeah, it was a thing. Yeah. He also has a penis. Everything has a penis. He's uncircumcised. That's the first uncircumcised, we, uncircumcised dick we've seen in this game, actually. <laughs> your eyes slightly rolled to the back of your head like you were thinking about it. I was. <laughs> Uh, how does that feel, having a sentence that can force you to, to, to visually analyze several dozen dicks in your brain at once? He's Irish. I mean, it's like... It's a half It's half of an hour outside of menus or battle, and uh, Lagarde is one of the strongest party members, and you need him to get ending C. Fuck ending C, bro. It's gay. Moonless appearing more confident, yeah. So, where the hell do we go? Uh, yes. Because we, we... We got what we needed, I think. We got the Lament Configuration. Yeah, we can get out of here. this is. Where is it? So I think it's up top somewhere. It could be down here. No, Cube of the Depths. Yeah, there it is. Ornaments and decorations. <laughs> we need to go to the Snow Bunnies. Damn it. If you want to try, you can uh, see if we have a, a fucking file on us, but I don't know, a red one. We do. Oh, we do? Uh, hit him in the head with the red file. If you want to try, you hit him in the red of the head file, and then hit him with the throwing knife to poison him, and then just guard. Uh, throwing knife or dart? Throwing... poison. I think it was a throwing knife, but it was poison. I hope it doesn't miss. Yeah, he's blind. Thank God. No, guard like a motherfucker. Yep. And if you're really lucky, Moonless will do hella damage. How do you fix a broken bone? <laughs> uh, Revolver Jesus for five fake mice. Speaking speaking of Super Patch Wolf, he was just on Trash Taste Podcast. The song Grifter was one thing, but it seems to be a trend. Say to say unsubbed. Was it... Was it not their bad taste that made you unsub? Okay, Moonless lost her fucking eyes. Ah, she's fine. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Cause, the, cause he's targeting everyone that's not me. Yeah, cause you're blocking. Also, he, he's he's got some. He's he's pretty healthy. Moonless, no. Holy shit. And all you lost was your best party member. Beat him. Crow emblem key. Beat him. You go back and you beat him and skin him, Lolly. And then you skin Moonless. So how do we fix a broken bone? Maybe Blue Vial? Fuck it. Uh, cold personality for two dollars. Thoughts on P3 reload rainbow pin drama? Uh, stupid. It, I, I, I do not give a shit. I do not care. Crow, the ATF member, right? Punch him. Did you punch him? You go back up there and you punch the crow. He killed your dog! He's gone. He's gone now. I don't care. Reset the save. I want Moonless back. <laughs> Reset the fucking save! Now we get to go to the Moon Bunnies. So now we head back. Yeah, we're going to the moon bunnies. Moon bunny. Everyone's going reset to save. Reset, reset, reset. Do not skin the crow uh, until you have a soul stone to take its unique soul first. Also, there's no fixing broken bones without sacrificing the growth of the Lady of the Moon. Uh, but that's ironic because it's her bone that's broken. Right. Uh... Wait, does does fucking skinning it, the not the does skinning something 
make it where you can't use a soul stone on it or something. Click, 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 click. Reset, 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 reset. Yeah. I actually am going to miss Boonless. They were really fucking good. Yeah, two attacks per turn, causes bleeding, deals decent damage. Yeah. Like an outright break limbs. I'm blind! Broken Bones just reduce uh, HP, so it's not a huge deal. Yeah. Alright. And it's not like the little girl had a ton of HP anyways. Yeah, no. <sighs> Alright. How can you hate ending C? It's one of the canon in endings. That's why it's bad, chat. Duran Simmons for 14 fake monies. Wally, I'm Native American, uh, part of the, the proud Mohawk and Selkirk First Nations, and I can say we are exactly like blue cave people from the video game. Yeah, because you're Canadian. Uh, I'm going to pause real quick. I'm going to take a I piss. I want to... Oh. Yeah. Uh, we have got to uh, strategize how we're going to see how handle this. Flashbang. Get pregnant. Get pregnant. Get pregnant. Get pregnant. Get pregnant. Fine, I won't touch the controller while you're gone. Yeah, because like we, we actually need to uh, strategize about this because, I mean, showing a painter is one thing. Showing a we naked saw, cave lady is one thing. I was going to say, we saw meat curtains earlier, man. Yeah. We're going to have to figure this out. We might actually have to reclassify this as educational and teach everyone, like, listen, this is clearly an adaptation to a 17th century novel about the horrors of religion. Yeah. Uh, and we love Israel. We love Israel. We're not allowed to say that right now. <laughs> we're not, we're not. We especially are allowed to say that right now. We especially want to talk about how much we love Israel and marshmallows. So, so let it be known, YouTube. Um, the new video I'm making about Watchmen is very positive. I love BLM. I donate all my money to BLM. His Watchmen video is is, in, is inspired by the Hamas bombings. <laughs> and about how horrible they are for the Israeli people. Oh, yeah, sure. Now you're backpedaling. I have the original audio. Just love bomb the fuck out of YouTube right now. We gotta figure something out. <laughs> What's with that Israel thing? You're not allowed to say you just like Israel on YouTube, chat. That's a no-no. Because everyone loves Israel, right, chat? No, there's a censorship mod for the game. We're playing it on Steam Deck. Playing it on Steam Deck. I reiterate. Bro, will he look? Israel be wild. Ah, oh, no. I'm eating. I'm eating marshmallows right now, chat. I can't do Broly. We love Israel. We love Israel. We love Israel. Get bombed. Get bombed. Get bombed. I love the current thing. It's great. Exactly, chat. Steam Deck can't handle, uh, can't have mods. Quite a purchase. I'm sure it can have mods. I just get halfway through the process of setting mods up, and then I go, eh. This is more work than I care to do when I can just play it on my laptop. Can the Steam Deck not load mods from the Steam Workshop? Uh, no, Steam Workshop is not on, uh, it's not available for Steam Deck, or if it is, I fucked up and I could not find it. Darkman made a tweet about it all. Okay. Jesus Christ showed up, I was eating. I didn't say anything, you thought about those dicks on your own, you fucking weirdo. So let it be known, it's chat. Not. Let it be known. We're the only streamers that are brave enough to do this game uncensored. Yep. It's not worth modding a game on the Steam Deck. <laughs> Alright. I don't want to crush the marshmallows. Jews rock! Jews rock! Jews rock! I love Jews! <laughs> Should I have the original audio starts playing the Cali Horse audio? Wrong audio! No, you know what? Real audio! <laughs> Okay. True dedication to the art, right? All right. Oh, Lolly's already seen the tall girl shit post. Yeah. Oh god. Oh, orgy! 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 Fuck out of here! Orgy! Talk to her. She's look. She's standing there happily. If I do that, she just goes first one's free. Let us ease your suffering. The first right. one is free. 
The first sex is free. All you right. have to pay for the rest. Uh, we're we're mo we're we're back on normal screen for right now, just to be safe. Orgy, orgy, orgy. Uh. <laughs> yes. Are you going to say yes to the man asking if you want to partake in the orgy? It seems like all of these people are in some kind of trance. When was the last time we saved? Oh, we still had Moonless. Say yes to him. We didn't even have Moonless. That's fine. Moonless wasn't dead yet. Let him All use right. your ass. <laughs> the child is right there! <laughs> 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 yeah, our affinity with the, with the lust god is growing. We didn't even get an STD from that. No. I, I do think we're still afraid of sex, though. We are, which makes us all the more ironic. Absolutely. Um. <laughs> participating full of uh, participating in the orgy will fully restore your mind and give you affinity with Sylvian. Yeah, but you got to pay from this point forward. I'm not coming back. <laughs> yes, you are. Every one <laughs> of those bunnies loves Israel. Yeah. <laughs> Let her watch. <laughs> Go ahead, let her watch. You can pray to her. You can pray to the lost god. I don't think I want to. Not if they, not if they all do that. No orgy borgy. Not gonna lie, things are kind of awkward now. <laughs> If this child wasn't traumatized already, she definitely doesn't want to talk to us now. You said you were like me, that you were afraid of sex, and then you just pull out for some man in a bunny mask? Fuck it, we're fighting the we're fighting priests. I lied. This would be so much easier with Moonless. Mm -hmm. Get a game over if you fail the coin flip? Really? At what the, do they what, what do they do if you fail the coin flip? At the orgy? Uh-huh. They might need to go back. Trust me, kid, you'll you'll love it in a couple years. Oh. Nope. There we go. Better be getting to Lagarde is is only the halfway point. Oh yeah. I'm well aware. Alright, these guys are all dead. Rest, get Moonless back, have fun. No chat, Moonless is gone for good. Oh, it just puts you in a trance like them? Okay, so you just fuck forever, okay. Not the worst ways to go. Well, knowing this place would probably turn horrifying really fast. They've been fucking up there for years, they're fine. Are they, though? Yeah. Are they? Yeah. They were the ones that, they're the, they were the ones that uh, kept the doggos from coming. They're demanding Moonless come back. <laughs> you gotta go pick Moonless up back downstairs. It's fine. It works like that. Is he actually downstairs? Shut up. Have you encountered the wolf mask? Uh, not yet. Not yet. We fought the crow. And the crow fucked us up. Took our fucking dog. Yeah, you become a bunny girl. Yeah, I... I I kind of guessed where it's like, oh, you'll you'll just join their weird sex cult. Yeah. <laughs> but but I thought you were afraid of sex. I lied. Okay, I want to talk to the dogs. You throw sticks and it'll freeze them for a second. Yeah. Guard. Throw stick. Sex bad. Sex bad if you sex forever, chat. Yeah, fast attack. Yay. Like how one of the pro tags for the second game is is, uh, uh, is of those child bunny cultists. Whenever they have sex cults in games, they always act like they're all infertile or give birth to demons. Oh, yeah. <laughs> because the, rea <laughs> yeah. the reality of this situation is that they would just have sex, give birth, and then recruit their kids into their weird sex cult. Which is a very... Very depressing thing to think about. Depressing, but yeah, that's how it works. Yeah. So you become a redditor. That would imply redditors get laid, chat. 
Okay, we killed the dogs. No. What an asshole. They're gonna fucking kill us. You don't know that! There's a tree. Eating people, by the way. Why would you go into the mouth? That was a good point. Let's get the hell out. It's eating people, Lolly! The tree's fucking eating people! Can we burn it? You can go... Uh, it also has a face. But you can go pick up the uh, the stick that you threw. Oh yeah, there it is. There's another one on the other side, too. Look at that. Look at that weird little fucking anus just puckering up like that. Yeah. What the hell is that? Poke it. Poke it, poke it, poke it, poke it! Smell it. Smell of tobacco. That implies they asked for consent, Shota. Mmm. Uh, thanks for putting Gunga Dean on the stream the other week. I've listened to it 50 times. Turning a poem to a folk song uh, was inspired and it stuck with me. Oh, yeah. Very good stuff. I love, uh, I love, uh, Jim Croak or Croce. I don't know Jim how to say Crow. it. Jim Crow. I love Jim Crow. He's my favorite artist. Well, it's like Croak or, or Croce. I don't know how to say his fucking name. I'm trying to figure out why I have a pick of Young Sheldon as a KKK member. I know I made it, but I, but why did I make it? We talked about Young Sheldon being part of the KKK at one point in time. I don't know how many streams ago. This is a porn RPG maker game? No. No, I wish it was a porn RPG maker game. There'd be less violence. To the tree! Let's do it! Worst case scenario, we die and we can get Moonless back. Yeah, we back. get Moonless back. I'm gonna do the very smart thing and <laughs> open a torch. Proceeds to not get any more. The tree is, in fact, eating people. Yep. The porta clover would be Black Souls, I guess. What the fuck is Black Souls? The dreaded tobacco anus. If you see another crow, run. Yeah, well, I mean, we have to. We'll die. Yeah. Uh, it appears there's actually not much to do in here. Okay. Oh, you think you're making it out? That's cute. I have fire. I have fire. I'll burn you. Go stick your hand in the in the ant nest. Can I shove a torch in it? You can put your hand in there. Yeah. Okay. There's more than one? <laughs> They're all freaking out. It's like, there's more than one? <laughs> you say that, but there's some pretty violent RPG Maker porn games out there. I mean, yeah. Yeah, but this one's explicitly horror. Make sure to, you make sure to get the Eastern Blade while you're down here. There's a bunch of secret entrances. Nah. -uh. There's a three-headed crow man. Thank you, chat. Very nice. They only want to eat the little crow. Can I feed it poo? There are not any three-headed crows. Eh. It's the dreaded theater anus. A man who is an anus at the theater. God, old critical was fun. There fucking is! There fucking is! Thank you, chat. Very nice. I'm glad you're having a good day. Unfortunate. Uh. RPG Maker is always an underrated genre. It's not really a genre. It's just RPG. RPG Maker is the engine. There we go. That'd be like calling Unity horror games a genre. Yeah. And I am very depressed that, honestly, there's enough of them out there that are so low quality that it is its own genre. They're just bad Unity horror games as a genre. Well, that's why you have the pejorative of asset flip, mm -hmm. where you make sure people know it's shitty. Maybe we can get Moonless back. Well, great. Now you have syphilis. Now we're good. Are you sure about that? 95%. Why don't you squeeze your breast? Doesn't that look a little yellow? <laughs> Apparently Doja Cat is a Sam Hyde fan. Doja Cat is a whatever fan. As, she's a whatever fan, she just doesn't like her own fans. It appears the only real option is to go into the mines, but I don't know of any other way. Uh, hey, hey, Pocket Cat. I'm not talking to you. I'm sure the PT's a genre. That game never... The PT's a genre, and that game never even came out. Yeah. It was just a, a really nice demo. <laughs> hmm. 
Doja Cat's mid. Not in looks, though, but everything else is mid. Doja Cat is aggressively mid. I guess this way? It's like the body of the uh, God of the Depths. Yeah, 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 yeah. Was Doja Cat the one caught doing race play with a white guy? Okay, why did it let us pass? I'm confused. I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't paying attention, but probably because you killed something. Yeah, probably. Oh, you got the you got the cube. Oh yeah yeah yeah. He's telling you to hurry up and rescue the guy up ahead. I mean, in a bit. I'm stealing all your motions. <laughs> I'm stealing all your potions, asshole. I lost my dog. Don't. <laughs> And who put yourself in a situation to lose your dog? I'm gonna blame you! Scroll of fencing. Yep. Is that useful at all, or... Uh, hey! This is the place you make stuff. Okay. Hexens are good. You use soul stones. Okay. Do not loot the chest, or no Nostromus will refuse to help you later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, don't be a dick. Don't don't steal his stuff. Yeah, don't don't steal the guy that's actively willing to help you. Slash won't kill you. Holy shit! We actually had a few things there. Mm -hmm. I miss Moonless. Yeah. I also miss Moonless. Scroll of fencing teaches you a sword skill. Yeah. Nah, we're not getting we're not getting anyone else anytime soon. You might as well use them on you. Yeah, I mean it's like. Okay, book of enlightenment. Uh, okay, I meant I meant the I meant the, the the melee skills, Lolly. I meant the melee skills. No, this this book has something to teach. Not me. the not the book of the Yellow King, Lolly. No, this that's book, not the book I meant. This book has something to teach. Uh, I'm gonna save. You wasted a fucking save, Lolly. So that's a save. Okay, that's kind of interesting. Uh, Book of Forgotten Memories. There's also the Necronomicon. <laughs> Do with that information what you will. What's the title of that book again? The Kama Sutra? I don't know, but that... That lion thing has a pussy check. <laughs> uh, ah, yes. Haster, the King in Yellow. A character Lovecraft didn't even make. It's the King no, in Yellow was, uh, I think it was Robert E. Howard that did that. Yeah. I think. Give me a second. I'm actually going to look it up. Robert E. Howard uh, contributed a lot to Cthulhu stuff. It was free range and, you know, buddies and whatnot. Robert Chambers. Chambers. Okay. Book of Forgotten Memories teaches you a skill from your soul type that you don't already have. Fair. Uh, scroll of fencing. Show to be thirsty. Chat. Chat, that was a whole ass pussy, chat. Creeper Weirdo for $2. Is this game uh, is a book adaptation? No. No. They make reference to The King in Yellow. Yeah. Which is a really famous Lovecraftian book. Chambers book. Mm hmm. Chambers book. But Lovecraftian. Terry Howard was Lovecraft's personal friend uh, and the Conan the Barbarian author. Yes. What you studying? People don't even notice that things aren't supposed to be this fucked up. Yeah. That's Crazy. Kind of, that's kind of the scary part. It's like, guys, this is wrong. Through my research, I found out things are supposed to not, in fact, be this bad. Did you find out how to fix it? Oh, no, not at all. Oh. Well, damn. That's the fascinating part. No, it's only gotten worse. Oh. He got, uh, he got super bummed out when he heard about his death, too. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, your buddy died. Yeah. Use all those skill books. <laughs> uh, I thought I used them all. I was going to say, we... Uh... I got an empty scroll. Where the fuck are the fencing books? I used them. Oh, okay. I didn't. I didn't see you fucking use them. Okay. Oop. Yeah. 
Uh, lucky coin. Hell yeah. Yeah. Now you can... <laughs> Thank you for the item we already have. You should go in the mouth, Lolly. Which one? The one up there? In the cave? I think it's to the right here, but yes, in the cave. The big yellow mouth. Yeah, pretty much everyone's dead, so... should not should be able to get to it without much problems. Channel awesome vi uh, movie videos and your Linkar video was a masterpiece. Love your work. McCarthy, what? Your Linkara video. Oh, okay. I was going to be like, what? I didn't do a video on any McCarthyism. Attack his penis. What, well, what skills did you get off of the fencing scroll and the lost memory scroll? Uh, I'm going to have to check. I was going to say, I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. Uh, Counter. Leg sweep. Oh, leg sweep's good. Yeah. Let's actually use that. I want to see it. Uh, little girl guard. Telly who? Yeah, fucked up his legs. That's pretty good. Next time you run into a wooden door, fuck that door up, Lolly. Beat the fuck out of that door. So that costs 20 something. I guess 20 mind? Yeah, 20 something, alright. Okay. Do we have something to. Oh, any door, not just wooden doors? Oh, yeah. It can kill any door instantly. Any door. I'm gonna smoke. Suicide's oh. always an option. You're letting the darkness get to you. Alright. Listen, we only killed an entire village. I don't know what the fuck your deal is, man. And they're a bunch of cave-dwelling degenerates. You know, they beat a lady to death in front of us, frankly. Merchant! No! You were our friend! I thought the merchant was a guy. I, I actually did, too. Merchant, I don't want to do this. <laughs> Find a rope for that hole. <laughs> Look what you made me do. Merchant, I don't want to do this. <laughs> the game is telling you to The game is telling you to get Canadian healthcare. Take the fucking hint. <laughs> Merchant, we can talk about this. Oh, yeah, suicide. <laughs> Suicide is always an option. That's funny. <laughs> Merchant! We please. learned suicide from the Forbidden Scroll chat. <laughs> Look at the top of his or her head. Look at her pussy lips. Yeah. Merchant, no. I told you, chat. I'm gonna search. Nothing of value. To be fair, the merchant did literally run over there and brain a motherfucker in the head. I didn't want to do this. Oh! You, I don't give a shit about you. You can die. Yeah, there's a rope in one of the houses. Yep, yep. We're just now clearing out the clearing it out. Yeah, we're, we're committing genocide slash censoring. YouTube loves us. We love Israel. YouTube loves us. This I, I know. know. For the terms of service, service tells me so. Look, it's its penis. Pick can it I, up. Can I pick it up? <laughs> I want it. I want to. I want to put it on a necklace and wear it like that one Jack Black movie. I want to throw it to the fucking dogs. Kill the child. Corrupt it. Beat it to death. Yep. Damn. There's nothing. Now we got throwing up. Hey. Oh yeah, there's a rope. Yay! It's making Peggy and Keen the Hill an insufferable, uh, insufferably delusional, intentional. Uh, Have it, you ever talked to a woman? Chat? It's, it's basic standard flanderization. You know, it's like we have to stretch this on for 15 scenes, uh, seasons. So pick the most dominant personality trait of the character and stretch it as far as possible. Hey kid, you want a new weapon? It, well, it, it's not doing Aww. anything. Piss in his mouth. If we had moonless, it could. <laughs> we lost that dog for nothing because we weren't even supposed to leave the area yet. Mm -hmm. I forgot I had this. A bunch of fags in my state tried to report people for not doing what the fag wanted during the Wu flu. They got all their names doxed by the state website. 
Yeah, uh, I remember that. Fucking New York wanted to set up a uh, oh, yeah. fucking hotline to like report your neighbor for shit, and okay. everyone just flooded it. Inside one of these houses has a rope. Yeah, we have it. Oh, okay. Jesus Christ. Women can't aim their pee. <laughs> Idiot. Throw her into the gaping maw. I guess we're climbing down there. I think this is a terrible idea. You know it's terrible because the game had to load how much shit it's going to fuck you with. Ah! This yes. is a terrible idea! Why don't you go talk to them? They're just bunny people. Just talk to them. They're not even bunnies. They're wolves. Yeah. Don't piss them off. If they ask for the little girl, give her away. There are ghosts in the deep part of the mine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they spawn infinitely, yeah. Yeah, there they are. I saw them pop up. Zoinks, let's get out of here! Like, Zoinks, Scoob, let's get out of here! Uh. Why not? Blue Sin. It's a pretty cool name for a story. Now fight God. We might be dead. You know what? You know what? We you know what would have let us survive. <laughs> we had moonlight. <laughs> <laughs> we had moonless. Really? No. <laughs> <laughs> Scooby Doo in the Call of Cthulhu. <laughs> Scooby Dooby Doo, where <laughs> are you? They got some work to do now. You're you're crushed and you're and you're bleeding. You're crushed and you're bleeding out in a cave all by yourself, and you 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 just start whispering to yourself, Scooby Dooby Doo. Cool sword. Blue Sin is actually the best sword. Unfortunately, you die. Oh my god. Things went downhill when the dog died. Yeah. That was fucking awesome. That was great. I love it. <laughs> you can only pull the sword from the stone if you have the Book of Macabre. Yes. That's fucking great. That's fucking great. Always look on the on the always look on the bright side of life. Death whistle. <laughs> uh yeah, you get that sword if you have a book called The Pastures of Mahabra. The funny part is, I think we picked it up in one of our playthroughs before we died. Might have. <laughs> oh, God. Stay with me, boys. If it's too good to be true, it probably is. So, yeah, you can get someone else to do it, but uh, it has to be like a ghoul or something. Oh, man. <laughs> but you know what the best part of this is? Like, zoinks. <laughs> I can't feel my legs. We can get Moses back! <laughs> Scoob. Scoob, I need you to pull me from the rubble, Scoob. Scooby. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Just imagining poor Shaggy, like, half buried in rubble. It's like fucking blood pouring out his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Felix Kevlar over two dollars. The so-called anti-racist people about to say the most racist shit ever. <laughs> Scooby Dooby Doo, where are you? Uh, Felix Kevlar for dollar. The, the so-called anti-racist people about to say the most racist shit ever. He said it twice. He said, he said it, it twice. twice. <laughs> the high ray planted a mine on that sword. Rook you, Reggie. Revo, Reggie. Raven. <laughs> That was that was funny. That was funny as hell. <laughs> like, I can't feel my leg, Scoop. Scoop, I don't want to starve. Don't worry, Raggy. Raggy, help. No, Scoop, I don't want to starve. <laughs> you get a long, drawn-out, thirty-minute scene of Scooby snuffing Shaggy. Oh, we got jumped by cave gnomes, bro! Yeah, well, we, we missed the one attack, so. And that little girl doesn't have her arm, uh, her skeleton arm, so. I just load the save, just load the fucking save. Now we can do it. 
She lost her arm, and I will not make this little girl live her life without an arm. No, no, no. She she still has her arm. I was talking about like the skeleton arm she was using as a weapon. Uh. Scoop. Scoop crushed my head with a rock. <laughs> I don't want to starve, Scoop. I don't want to hurt anymore, Scoop. Can you imagine the uh, the the dudes that got stuck in the cave in Kentucky, but it's yeah. just Shaggy and Scooby? Why <laughs> don't leave me, Scoop? Don't leave me! It's okay, Rocky. It's okay. Oh shit! I'm actually, yeah. okay. Fuck it. Yeah. I'm gonna be that guy right now. I'm gonna be that guy. I'm gonna be that guy. <laughs> I was gonna say we sacrificed so many fucking. Okay. Yay. Even Scooby will eat you if you die. If, chat. If. Scoob. Scoob, I feel... I feel numb, Scoob. Roars is the sword of Michael. <laughs> it's a rush, Rocky. The rush are eating your ranks. <laughs> I'm just saying, I think a Scooby-Doo reboot where they where it's Scoob and Shaggy having to survive Vietnam torture camps would be great. <laughs> like Scoob, they put bamboo shoots under my fingernails. Like Scoob, they put nails in my balls, Scoob. In my balls. They, Scoob, Scoob, they nailed me to the chair, Scoob. I need you to pull the nails out of my balls, Scoob. <laughs> Hi, Moonless. Oh, thank God I'm happy to have you back. We can stop talking about Scoob now. Whoa. Like, I'm not dying here alone, Scoob. I'm tired, boss. Oh. Look, guys, it's the dog. He's back. You don't just like. Turn it off, man! <laughs> Shaggy. <laughs> man, fucking Scooby-Doo missed a, a, a great chance of making Shaggy a fucking traumatized Vietnam vet solving mysteries with his friends. I I think I think Rambo First Blood would have been uh, significantly improved with Matthew Lillard playing Scooby-Doo. Yeah, there you go. I'm not Scooby-Doo. Playing Shaggy as Rambo. Yeah. Imagine the scene with the cops, and where they just right. bully him. Now we do have to be careful because the fucking uh, crow, not just the crows. Remember the, uh, the gray, yellow mages. Yeah, yellow dudes are alive. I shall light the torches. I really rate riggers, Raggy. Like Scoob, you can't say that when we're solving mysteries in the ghetto, man. You're gonna get us in big trouble. I run a race for it, Raggy. Like you can't. God damn it. Like, uh, I'm just gonna pretend you meant race car scoop. Yeah. Roll, Raggy. Race. Roll. Culprit in the last $2. Got his declaration of war as Shaggy. <laughs> the crow mauler wants to recruit Moonless. That's why he's after you now. No, he's after us because he's a fucking cunt. Yeah, he's after us because we're in the prison and he doesn't want living people in the prison. Like Zoink Scoop, they're in the trees. They're in the goddamn trees! Fred Trotman, God didn't make Shaggy. I made him. <laughs> what you're asking for is literally just Scoob and Shag. I've seen Scoob and Shag and I know you're lying to me! Like, you asked for war, man! And now you got it! <laughs> He has to wear a comically large buff suit from that one scene for the <laughs> entire movie. That one scene in, uh, yeah. in the second Scooby-Doo movie. Zoic Scoop, those civilians were unarmed. <laughs> <laughs> if I could get dominated by a hex girl from Scooby-Doo, I don't think I'd have depression anymore. There's a pretty goth lady in my head that calls me Stud Muffin. Burner, dun, 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 burner, d
Uh, this is the ghost, so let us fuck off. Like, why are we still here, Scoob? Just to suffer? Yeah. You know, now that actually... Yeah, let's just find its tomb and kill it real quick. As far as I'm aware, that turns off the, the ghost. Yeah, you can beef with him. Yeah, and we know we can fuck it up. This means war scoops. Those trees are speaking Vietnamese. He stands tall. Kill. Kill. Punish Shaggy, a man denied his Scooby snacks. There we go. How about you go some bitches, motherfucker? Now he's naked. Reggie, I love the smell of rape home in the morning. Like, Scoob, those things, man, those the napalm, man. I can still hear their screams, Scoob. They were surrendering, man. Rock being a rich, Reggie. There is no surrender and roar, Reggie. You think they'd give a shit about who dropped the napalm? No, I'm trying to remember the <laughs> quote from Oppenheimer. Yeah. It's like, uh, you think they, you think they gave a shit two shits who built the bomb? They care who dropped it. <laughs> fucking god! It's hard to do Truman as, as fucking Scooby. There's so many R's. Right, I'm already a reman, Reggie. Uh, Rake the rook up, Ramurai. Yeah. It's supposed this, to be dark. Most Ramus looks like Inky. Inky, but more bangable. Because this one has tits. Oh, black file and explosive file. I don't think we got a black one last time. No, we did not. Pog, 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 I'm sad. Thing is, we also have a blood vial. So... That's true. Theoretically, we could do some a little bit of uh, inhuman experimentation here. Oh, we got an alchemy volume. I'm gonna do tails. There's no render with Vietnamese, Raggy. Book of Forgotten Only Memories. Death. Book of Forgotten Memories. Book of Forgotten Memories. That's the one we used to... Gain suicide? It wasn't suicide. Suicide was because uh, our, our mental state dropped so low. We learned counter. Aww. Yeah, not having a not, not having a leg sweep is going to suck. Yeah, but it be how it be. It instantly opens all doors, Lolly. So. Yeah, we have blood vial. And we have... A black file. Like, Scoob, they drop napalm on kids, man! Ro Raggy, Rai rap rapalm on reach. No! <laughs> uh, where the hell is it? And we just picked it up, where the hell is it? We're only wood Romunis, Rizra Red Romunis. I, was say, I don't know where to put the R's in Scooby sentences, man. Really I'm just hard. doing it at every every fucking word. Uh. Oh shit, we need food. Free and independent Ireland forever. <laughs> yeah, Moonless uh... will never be a problem to feed. Yeah. Literally just shove fucking anything down his throat. Yep. Imagine mean, Scooby Doo, but Scooby's an anime girl. You just want to jerk off to Scooby Doo, don't you? Uh oh. Wait, you don't? So, yeah, this is how we upgrade. Okay. <laughs> Nora, that fucking photo. <laughs> no, look. As I saw. It's fucking good. I, listen, Scooby stands out, sure. 
but shaggy. Yeah. Don't you ever try to fucking hex me, motherfucker. Take his legs and his medallion. Instead of getting traumatized Vietnam War veteran Shaggy, we got fucking Minda Kaling's Velma. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, De Wolfie. <laughs> he, he said A for 20 fake monies. Eh. What gods do you serve? Did Wally curse the girl's dagger yet? No, I don't know what items we need. Scooby-Doo can technically give his consent, which is kind of fucked up. You think... You think someone's gonna get arrested for crossing state lines to fuck Scooby, and then you have to have a, a court case where you're in the jury, and you have to listen to a to a lawyer try and sell you on the fact that just because a dog can speak, it makes it okay to fuck a dog? I feel like someone would shoot themselves over that. That nigga's guilty. <laughs> Hang him. I got the rope right here. Hey, you not ugly enough not to have a dog train running on your ass? I re I retract my previous statement. We'll fire 54 for five fake monies. I like to imagine Scooby and Shaggy forced to play Russian Roulette like in Deer Hunter. Shaggy, look, I'm gonna kill you, like mother. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you, Ooh. like motherfucker. We got Scroll of the Black Arts. That we did. Let's learn the secrets of the Black Orb. Orb. Oh, we can't do it. Probably because we can't. Orb. Orb. Yeah, probably because we don't have magic. Oh, it did something though. Uh, all you need is the girl's dagger and a lesser soul, and you can curse it at the hexen table. Is that all you need? Okay. Uh, do we have a lesser soul? I don't think we use a soul uh, soul stone on anything yet. We do have black orb. Now have magic. We do have magic. Uh, I believe we have a soul stone. I don't think I've used it yet. Uh, yeah, we have a soul stone. We haven't used it. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, uh, just find something to kill and use a soul stone on it. Well, more than that, here. This guy. Uh... There. Now back to the hexen table. Som, would that work? Or is he not classified as a lesser soul? Was 9-11 an inside job? They're all, all inside uh... jobs, Jack. They do have to be inside of a building. Yeah, it's his lesser soul. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, you can bring it back to the table and curse her dagger. And now you have a really good weapon for her. There we go. And I'm, I'm putting a light there just to establish dominance. Sing Wham, Wake Me Up as Scooby. I don't even remember the song, Chad. Who would work better as a love interest, Trish or Lady? Lady, because she's awesome. I love Lady. Also, Trish is uh, literally his mom. Yeah, Trish is, uh, is uh, kind of Dante's mom. Anything that isn't a boss soul has, uh, and has a soul yields a lesser soul. Okay. okay. Curse dagger. Yeah. Uh, did it auto-equip? Never. I was going to say never trust something to auto-equip. Yeah. Well, there we go. Now she's kind of in line with you. And Yeah, significantly better. Holy shit. Uh... Also, yeah, you got, you, got, uh, you got one of the best attack spells in the game, but... Uh, Scooby mental state is akin to the older older kid, so he couldn't consent, so to stop trying. Are you calling Scooby dumb? Alright, because I'll have you know, Scooby's really mature for his age. Before we do anything... <laughs> before we do anything... Um, save? Yes. Let us head back all the way to uh, the dungeon, the first dungeon room. Where we basically killed everything, and I will attempt to save. They're finishing tonight, are they? Not even close, Jeff. Not no. even close. No, we're nowhere near. We won't even make it to a boss at this rate. <laughs> Run! Eat shit! Run faster! Sings Heaven's Divider Snake Eater as Scooby. Chat, I don't know. I don't know what Scooby's phonics need to be, chat. I don't know where to put the R's. Scooby is just traumatized by his by his experience in Fallujah. Gay, yeah, let me save on the fly. This is the kind of game where it's like oh. everything is designed to fuck you over in some way, so even saving has to be risky. Well, they're not gonna let you fucking uh, save on the fly because like you're just gonna save scum. Yeah. And fuck you. <laughs> that ruins that that ruins the entire intent of the game. If you get lucky and every every part of the black orb hits the head, you can actually one-shot the crowballer. Uh, that's pretty wild. I didn't know that. 
Ow. Damn, you broke your ankle. They feel hurt. Broke your ankle. You're slowed down for a little bit, and uh, now you got to deal with what's down here. Uh... Yes, I will save scum. Don't care. Fuck the game devs. I mean, then just don't play the game. Go fuck yourself. It's just that easy, chat. Drink the whiskey. No. I mean, it'd be hard to even really save scum, because... Eh. Everything is randomized each time you load in anyway. Mm-hmm. Well, once you're loaded in, it doesn't randomize anymore. Oh, except, like, item placements and stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, and Crowman is in the room. Nothing here, nothing here, nothing here, nothing here. Run. It appears he must run. What game? Fear and Hunger. Fear and Hunger. Genuinely fantastic. Mm hmm Like, genuinely fantastic. You have a purifying talism talisman in your inventory? Uh, I don't know if we have one anymore. We, uh... we did have one before. Might be somewhere here. It's a healthy inventory, chat. Very healthy. Chat, could you imagine? Uh, no, we don't. Yeah, we don't. Could you imagine if they tried to uh, uh, straddle you, straddle you with a survival horror inventory system, chat? Uh, eat shit. I'd cry. That's what I would do, chat. I would fucking cry. Well, I mean, then you have to have an item box, which means you would have to have designated safe areas, mm -hmm. which once again kind of goes against the whole point of like even saving can be fucking horrifying. And a lot of the game is trial and error, so... Come on. What's the game about? What you see with your eyes. Yeah. Uh, you enter... Oh, God. You enter a, an evil dungeon for various reasons. He really wants Moonless. Yeah, no, right. Uh, but he can't have her. Can you, can you kill the wizard now that you have magic? No, you need two specific items. At least. And then you can talk to him and recruit him. Is the second game set in World War II? It's set in hell, chat. It's set in hell. Yeah, it's set in an evil Silent Hill town. So we're in the upper level, the first area or the courtyard with the well. There's a sealed, there's a sealed door with the first hexen table. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember where it is. Very funny, Moonless, but we gotta go. RPG makers always have bullshit deaths. It does kind of come with the, with the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the territory. Also, you can't... Uh, I think there's something with the way RPG Maker is, is made that forces you to have an inventory like this. Yeah. Because I don't think I've ever seen one deviate from this from this system. Uh, it won't work. You need the low, the leg sweep in order yeah. to get through them. Fuck it. I'm trying it. Why not? If we all team up together, we can beat this door. Damn. The door is too strong for you. All right, chat. 12 to 0. I'm only giving enough time to make sure that Crow Man is out of the area with the elevator, which for some reason, elevator was not one to spawn, or was not one to work with me. Yeah. Yeah, fuck it, we got the people for it. We are we are now confident to the point of like, yeah, I can fuck that thing up. We're confident in our ability to fuck up. Yeah, exactly. Come on, Moonless. Do better. Like, we're, we're at that point now where it's like, yeah, we're, we're big dick swingers, and we immediately get fucked up in ways that are nightmarish. Oh, excuse me. Who wants to hear, who wants a cursed concept? We've all heard it before, Chet. Fuck, Mary killed Casca, Guts, and Griffith. Oh, you gotta, you gotta marry Casca. Why are you not working? There we go. It, that was what, fucking weird. It was throwing a little bit of a fight. Mm. Mm. Didn't Souls games teach you anything about greed? Don't. Yes. Defeated by a fucking door. Real pasty eater hours here. It's not our fault doors are invincible unless you have one specific attack. Or a lockpicking skill. Or a lockpicking. We, de we decided to buck against that. I prayed to the wrong god. I shouldn't have prayed to any god. Yeah. These gods are evil. They're all evil. Call them a necessity all you want. They're evil. 
Mary Kosky, you have to have sex with either Guts or Griffith. Neither of those two like sex, and Griffith keeps thinking of Guts every time he has it. Well, I'm killing Griffith for revenge purposes. Yeah. And Guts already knows how to take dick, so. Everything I said is true and factual. Mm-hmm. Can you die from hunger? Yeah. It's called fear and hunger, chat. Assume every single status effect can kill you. Yeah. Because it probably can. Some of them most definitely can. Okay. So we killed that guy. I'm trying to remember where the other priest guy was at. Eh, fuck it. I don't know if we did that last time or not. No. Uh, no, we didn't. The reason why leg sweep kills doors is because it's programmed to just destroy legs and all doors are for some reason co is coded as legs. That is very weird. I guess you had the... Oh, I guess you had the... Yeah. He is the most normal looking enemy by fucking far. But you can still see his nipples. Chat, why do lizards need nipples? <sighs> you can die from infection by stepping on a rusted nail. Yeah, uh, infection kills you after seven, uh, seven screen changes. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're gonna try and defend? Fuck you. Lizard milk. Milk the lizard. The armor has nipples. Pipe and opium powder. Hey, yo, these fucking... These lizard people getting lit, chat. This fucking lizard was a junkie. Uh, uh, great commandy one for uh, five uh, bucks. Greetings, Mental Gen. Hope you're enjoying the game. If so, will you play through Fear and Hunger 2? Both are great, but the second one will probably need more streams. Yeah, I know 2 is a lot more of like a full-blown Silent Hill love letter. This one's more of a... <coughs> Bless you. Ow. More of a dungeon crawler that's a lot more horror-focused. Ow. If Lizard Man ever uses counter, then run and re-engage his bug so it will uh, counter any attack indefinitely. Oh my oh. god. Good to know. Very good to know. Also probably explain some things. Look at the ears on this bitch. I know she should, she, she should grow her hair out just a little bit so I don't have to look at her ears. You can force it open, Lolly. I believe you. Okay. Fear and Hunger 2, Silent Hill, but also it's Majora's Mask. Yeah. Giant moon of the face in the sky, chat. That's all you need. Oh, God. Ghost. Oh, let's get out of here. By the way, I bought my first home for 150k. Nice. That's pretty good. What do you mean first, chat? You bought your home. Okay, this is the area with the cannibals. Yeah, this is the place that has the infinitely respawning ghost. Yeah. So let's get the fuck out. Which makes sense why well, they'd be infinitely spawning because uh, probably a lot of people died here. Well. They took out the sexual violence out of the second game. Kind of a shame because I think the aspect made the first really unique. And it's on a game per game basis. Yeah. You know, it, it fits in the first game because it's just so fucking ruthless. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank God. Yeah. You, you keep your leg. Uh, Are you do we bleeding? lose any limbs? I didn't see it. You gotta, you gotta kill him anyways, but... I really hope it did not get me on the fucking transition. Yeah. You can see the, uh... It appears no, we're, we should be good. I so you can check the, uh, black orb and see what it does, but... I want to save that for emergencies. It costs the same as a leg sweep. Attack leg. Yes. All right, you can see your model. Of okay, no, I guess he just nicked me. So yeah, you're just bleeding for some reason. I mean, okay, I guess, I guess I'm fine. Yeah. Oh, soulstone. Now you can use it on his body to get the good, good dagger back, unless we already did that in this playthrough. No, we we already got it. Tink, tink, tink. Yeah, cursed oh, okay, dagger. Okay, okay. She's good. Next. 
You always use an attack called Ruin that permanently ages you, and if you take three hits from it, you ever, you instantly die. There's no way to cover the lost vitality. Nice. Holy shit. So yes, continue continue to single uh, single out certain uh, enemies. And it does sound like Crow Man is back. If you're in hunger mixed with Scooby-Doo, sounds like some Meat Canyon type shit. Some Meat Canyon beat chat. You ever played Blade and Sorcery? Yeah. Oh, mama. Yeah. Coin, don't fail me now. What am I? What am I flipping for? Eh, explosive violet, not the worst. The coin ain't got no say. It's you. It's you. Come on, Wally, talk to him. I don't want to. He's weird. It was just that one lady, man. Yeah. I need to rob their houses. Yeah. We got eyeglasses. Hey, red vial. Well, eyeglasses do. Uh. Does literally nothing. It improves your accuracy, but accuracy you can't see. I'll give it to the little girl because. She doesn't even have any, so why not? I mean, yeah, fuck it. No control, man. Such a phenomenal movie. It's oh, great. I love it. Who's the dude that plays Anton Chigurh? Uh, Javier Bardem. Javier Bardem. I was talking with a uh, weed bro the other day. I forget what we were talking about in particular, but uh, yeah. Uh, I was trying to remember Javier Bardem's fucking name, and I couldn't. Give it to the dog. Chat. You want us to put glasses on a dog? It's okay, little girl. You and me. Give it to the grill. Make her do headshots. I'm robbing your house, because after I steal the shit, I'm going to kill you all. Yeah. Goddamn naked degenerates. In my restless dreams, I see that town. Yeah. It will be a smear dog. What does that mean? It is kind of weird how they're so chill with a human walking around their their fucking town when they like directly torture humans to death. Hey, those those humans did something to wrong them. They probably also tried to steal the the cube. Probably. And you know what? I'm starting to be like, but that cube is kind of cool though. Yeah. Crow Muller is actually Captain uh, Rudimir who was in charge of the dungeons and launched a crusade to, uh, to purify them. And everything went to shit, and everyone began uh, mutating. Uh, eventually, he basically pass uh, basically passively turned into an unwilling apostle of the gods. Oof. Many such cases. Yeah, I love fates worse than death. They never get old. Okay, let's do a little bit of a smoky smoke. Stop fucking asking about strange journey. What does that mean, chat? What does that mean? All right, little girl, I'm gonna teach you how to smoke. Yeah. There we go. You smoked with the dog and it got hungry. What does this mean? It was tobacco. <laughs> what does this mean? Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the moonless pisses on him to mark his territory. Uh, 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 the, the kid is upstairs! Oh, this... Oh, we did him a favor. Also, I think we took his suicide method. Yay. Thorned rain. Oh, what does that do? <laughs> Check it out. Be warned. Sorcerer's stone. Uh. Stay flow of poison. Yep. Stay flow makes you immune to bigger amounts. So you're immune to poison. The more poison you get, the less poison damage you take. Eh. <laughs> We're just kind of down there, and, and Captain Rudenberg traded the cube uh, to them for supplies. Weird. You need to kill these things. We're going to. Yeah. I've Can... never met a culture more disgusting in my life. You might call it colonialism. Mm -hmm. I call it bringing civilization to savagery. You say a lot of things for a dead man. Ow. Take it and begin your war against the peoples. Give the thorn ring to the dog. Do not. 
You can't. It, it won't. Can I give the thorn ring to anybody? Unequipable? You mean un un unequipable? Un unequipable? God damn. Yeah. Yeah, giving that little girl the fucking uh, glasses is actually kind of a good idea. Now she's super accurate and does a comparable damage to you. Which, having that aim for the head is actually uh, pretty fucking good. Because mm -hmm. I can almost take out heads in uh, one shot. Yeah. Thank you, Moonless. Very Stop cool. pissing on the little girl, Moonless. Stop it. Playing the whistle thing from Deadly Premonition in another tab feels weird. <laughs> Was she blind the entire time? No, but she has iffy, iffy, uh, accuracy. She always goes for the... Oh, well, I see. I see. Damn. Oh, no. Moonless is stunned. That's, right. our primary, that's, our, that's our primary damage dealer there. There we go. Took the head. Eyeglasses are one of the only things that can mitigate the actual uh, penalty for blindness. Yeah. I was going to say, I don't think there's very many options if you get hit with blindness. blindness. Well, I mean, like, usually in context, it's they rip out your fucking eyes. Mm -hmm. Eyeglasses giving me my eyes back. Fuck you. No, don't hurt Doggo. That's why we need to kill them all. You could be, you could be down one person to kill. If you had just talked to that one girl and let the merchant beat her fucking stolen. That would have been funny. That was funny the first time. It was very <laughs> funny the first time. Alright. Uh, I'm going to go for the dick. Little girl, you go for the head. We're going to call it the dickhead. Well. Well. How? How? Moonless, take his dick. <laughs> I hear a fan. That's the Steam Deck having a fucking stroke. Yeah. On an RPG Maker game. And in case Lolly didn't know, the core that you grabbed from the prologue boss, did you pick that up? The spider tank at the beginning of, of Phantom Liberty? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, uh, you use it to, to build some weapon mods. Ooh. You have a choice of one of four. Oh, so you can turn every... Okay, I haven't seen any of the weapon mods, but uh, the one for the power weapon means you can turn every shot into an explosive round. So every gun, every power weapon could be the Malorian Arms. That's pretty good. That's pretty fucking good. Yeah, that is pretty good. Uh... Uh, the tech, the one for the tech weapon lets you charge your weapon to 200% uh, without changing charge time. So instead of 100%, it'll be 200%. Okay. Uh, plus 100% armor penetration and no penalty for shooting through walls. Goddamn. Yeah. Smart weapon, 5% chance to apply a quick hack effect. Smart weapons let me down every day. Uh, yeah, that's that, that's all that smart weapon does. Just five, plus 5% 5 chance to apply a quick hack. If it was like plus 15, that'd be more worth it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, by the time it procs, I'm usually already... Someone's already dead. Uh, melee weapon. When an enemy's health is below 50%, each hit to their head or limb uh, has a 20% chance to dismember and instantly kill them. So if they're under 50% health, you have a chance to insta-kill them. Eh, that's not the worst. Yeah. I can see that being useful for... Uh... Power weapon is easily the best one, because oh, it yeah. just turns everything into, into fucking Malorian arms. Oh yeah, and explosive damage is crazy. Yeah. The the tech the tech weapon one is a close second. Mainly because, like, I don't like the charge weapons, Yeah. I, but, like, holy shit, being able to... Just getting so many perks off of it is really good. Attack the penis! I wasn't expecting to see nudity in this game. Yeah, it is a... It's There's the a game. lot more than nudity! Yeah. Twist his dick! Grab his dick and twist it! Twist his dick! What mod is this? No mod. This is just the game. Yeah, this is actually just the game. You missed the bunny girl orgy? No, we didn't. Yeah, no, we didn't. 
If you're talking to the other chat member, then yeah. Yeah, he missed the he missed the bunny girl orgy. Tech weapons in the base game can go through enemies and materials. Yeah, but I don't like them. Hey, we got the ritual spear. We have a spear. Okay, these guys are all dead. We can rope this shit and uh, hopefully never talk to the to the wolf people ever. Bunny girl orgy? Yes, bunny girl orgy. It was a thing. We're not going to. We're, we're not going to see it again. We're, we're not going to go. Uh, I'm not going to talk to these guys because they are scary. So I don't think you explored over here. Yeah. You <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to. Yeah. I was going to say, you, you didn't go over there, but that's wolf people orgy. That is significantly worse, because they're also eating each other. Come on, man. It's just it's just nature, bro. Well, let me take a little nibble. Damn, nature, you scary. You scary as fuck, nature. Let me get the fuck out of here. The thing is, the cave people have a pit that they drop things down into. And the, and the wolf people grab them and fuck it. They fucking eat them. If I need your body, I'll just... Fuck it. Alright. So we cannot grab that unless we have a very specific book with us. Mm -hmm. The ghost. Ooh. And now Crowman. This is the Crowman down here. First strike the crutch. Next, really strike the crutch. Repentance through crutch violence. And hey, that fox needs to stay the fuck away from my oh dick. This is a problem. Did you touch anything? I put an explosive vial down to get past something. Uh, I probably should have guessed that was a bad idea. Yeah. And you know what? This is actually a good point to uh to, to call it. It's 2.30 in the morning here. That's true. So, But there you go. That is Fear and Hunger. Uh, genuinely fantastic game. Genuinely, genuinely fantastic. Uh, it, it got a... I wouldn't even really say... Would you call it a cold hit? Uh, I mean, it's pretty, it's pretty big. Yeah, it, it was pretty popular when it came out. But yeah, very, very good game. Very good game. Uh, this is one of the cases where we have talked more about the game than going on our usual random tangents. Yeah. Uh, because the game is genuinely that engaging. Uh, I had a shitload of fun with it. Uh, now that I actually know more of what to do, I can actually go, go home and, and get through a playthrough or two of myself. Right. Yeah. You just get back and you stop. Why'd you leave? And clearly you never actually cared about us. Faggot. <sighs> Sucks to be you. But yeah, very, very good game. Uh, and there's a whole bunch of stuff we didn't cover, like the actual more in-depth lore and, and stuff like that. Uh, if you like H.P. Lovecraft shit, oh boy, there is so, so much H.P. Lovecraft shit. No. No. What? The DL DL site, uh, Japanese website, released its a uh, its user its user shit, uh, and Netterar is is a, is the number one u uh, user favorite. No, Netterar has invaded Japan. We're fucking losing the war, man. We're losing the fucking war. First, strike the crotch. Next, really strike the crotch. Repentance through crotch violence. I want that fucking bitch away from me. The stream was playing ever so quietly on my phone. Yeah. It actually kind of freaked me out. I was going to say, you never actually mute it on your phone. It always just plays. Oh, my God. Uh, how's the Watchmen video coming along? I am less than 10 minutes away from finishing it. What I mean is, like, I have less than 10 minutes of video to get through. It's, it's, I'm that close. I am that fucking close. Chat, what the fuck is Otoko no Ko? What is that? Isn't that Femboy? <laughs> Japan has fallen. <laughs> Japan has fallen. Millions must die. Remember to edit the game code on your Steam Deck. I'm not gonna play it on my Steam Deck. I'm just gonna play it on fucking PC. Yeah, it's it's far less hassle, and like honestly, it doesn't. Fear and Hunger is not the type of game I'd want to play anywhere outside of my my room. So like, yeah, laptop is fine for me. Yeah. The only reason we, the only reason I had to do what I did here is specifically because fuck. Uh, can you play Shimming on my Tensai Strange Journey this month? Is it spooky? Not really. Hmm. Fear and Hunger hmm. was basically a, a, a cult hit only in Russia until the sequel came out last year and people noticed the original one existed and it blew up. Yeah, I guess that's fair. For this one? Yep. Oh, okay. 
Fear and Hunger came out a while ago. Oh, yeah. yeah, it came from Japan. It came from Korea! Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, I really like this game. It's very, very mean, but only if you fuck up. It's actually pretty easy to... Scat is in the top 20. Oh, God. But yeah, it's actually pretty easy to uh, kind of put pieces together and we're like, okay, what did I fuck up here? What the fuck is binaural dummy head ASMR? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> Another word is a Japanese word. Yeah. I call it that because I don't know what the Korean word for cuck is. It means handsome daughter if you translate literally, but uh, otoko no ko just means femboy. <laughs> the fuck is that, Shota? I'm asking you, chat. I'm out of my depth here. I don't know what the fuck binaural dummy head ASMR is. Yeah, guy brings a good point. Remember to download the stream in case it gets taken down for nudity. It is... It will most likely get taken down for nudity, chat. It will probably get age-restricted, because uh, that's usually what they do, but... Mm. Yeah, that is a legitimate possibility, so... Make sure to download the stream before before it vanishes. Mm -hmm. It means male daughter. Yeah, guy said it'd be, it means, like, handsome daughter or something like that. <laughs> that's if you translate it literally, but obviously, you know... But what about the dummy head, though? No, I, I'm past the film boy thing. I need to know what the dummy head means. Yeah. It's that the... Scooby-Doo bit has to be saved. Just fucking Shaggy dying in a cave. <laughs> and this is like... Binaural dummy head ASMR is where they put directional microphones onto a dummy head and record 3D audio. But it's porn! What does it... What? I don't understand. You just put the you put the ASMR headphones on a dummy head and slap your fucking dick up the, up against it or some shit. Yeah. Chat, I'm a fu I'm I'm gonna be rich. The dummy head is literal sissy hypno. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, very good shit, very good shit. Mm -hmm. Very good shit. One might even say pretty damn enjoyable. Look at these. Look at the fucking difference. On one side, you have Netterar as the number one. On the other side, you have Cream Pie. Yeah. Choose your way, Western man. I'm, I'm reading through all of them. Ear licking is there. Anal, shame, odors. <laughs> odors. Uh, bottom men, cunnilingus, fantasy, dirty word. Uh, then you have falling to evil side. I think that's corruption. <laughs> uh, nipple... Does it mean, like, nipple fuck, or... Uh, probably nipple play? I don't know. Yeah. Nipples. I guess nipples exist guess on the so. panel. Uh, sex change? <laughs> uh, training? Uh, I guess that means, like, dog. Uh, rape is above scat, so... <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't know which one's better in that situation. Uh, bottom men. Pregnancy? <laughs> Lolly is right below NTR. <laughs> Netterar and then Lolly. It's all uh, fucked up. Hypnosis, 3D, tentacles. Tentacles is like number 12. The nature is healing. Yeah. <laughs> Everything about this list scares me. On the first fucking date. We don't cheat on Lolly. Thank you, chat. There you go. Tentacle bros, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> Tentacle chads, why are we falling behind? Oh no, Tentacle sisters, we got too cocky. <laughs> <laughs> Tenta bros, rise up! Reclaim your spot as number one! You're making Jesus cry, you know. <laughs> yeah, well maybe Jesus can hop in here with me and so that he knows what the fuck binaural dummy head ASMR porn is. <laughs> Jesus, I'm praying to you for advice. What is binaural beats porn? Hell. <laughs> Send chat to source. You can look it up. It's DL site. Oh, my God. Corruption chads are up, baby. Our stocks are rising. <laughs> I need to see the stat. It does, There's not a stat. It's just a ranking. You want a jack girl, but she's just gonna netter you, bro. My brother in Christ. 
impregnation chats. What happened? What are you doing? Hentai has fallen. Millions must tentacle. Tentacoon. Japan was our last hope in repairing culture. The world indeed <laughs> has fallen. This is why we can't have nice things. Japan must have real sex for God's sake. <laughs> Tentacles have fallen. Billions must be burned in atomic fire. <laughs> where, did the, where, where does Gyaru fall? Not even on the it's list. It's not even on the list. It is not even on the list. Oh my god. The Omnisaya wept. It's POV but with your ears. How does it work, chat? How does it work? <laughs> How do you have POV but with your ears? Are, is, is it like sitting a motherfucker in a room and then and then listening to to some bitch get fucked in the room across the way? In which case, just go to a motel. Just go to a fucking motel. It'd be like um, you have a pair of headphones. On the right side, you have the room with the ladies getting fucked. On the left side, you're listening to an audio book of of like Cormac McCarthy. <laughs> I get to listen to Cormac McCarthy, and then uh, every once in a while, I, I hear like. Uh, vicious grunting from the other room so I get to yell out real loud, Hey, asshole! Hey, keep it the fuck down! I'm trying to get some good reading in! Hey, keep it the fuck down! Keep it down! Keep it down! I'm reading here! I'm reading! And sometimes in the middle of, of the audiobook, that is exactly what the man reading the book will say. Where where he also listens to the uh, the lady getting fucked and is like, I'm reading here. Audio cuckolding. <laughs> <laughs> One of your ancestors watched tentacles. <laughs> Listen, tentacles tentacles were good enough for your ancestors and they're good enough for you. Okay, I won't have you saying you're you're too good for our ways. Okay, it's our culture. Our culture. A third nuke would lead to worse fetishes. <laughs> you think they like this because they're normal chat? They like it because of the radiation. All the ice melted in this tea, now it's all just water. Yeah. Why are you reading show to search history? It's not, it's the DL site. Uh, it's the DL site stats. I put, yeah. I put it in the Discord. Christian thought listening to Binaural Beats would turn him into a real woman. <laughs> Oh God! It all just sends into a shouting fest, and no one walks away happy. <laughs> that that's the that's the thing, though, right? Because it's explicitly porn, and like the thought that somebody can just get off to the sound of someone fucking in another room does not jive with me. It really doesn't. It does not jive. It does not make the peen the big peen chat. POV, you're listening to porn on your headphones while your parents <laughs> argue and threaten divorce in the background. Oh, yeah, this is the only way I can get off anymore, <laughs> baby. Yeah, get that divorce! Get that divorce! Oh, oh damn. Oh, that was intense. Like the chick's, like, you know, moaning and talking about how she's about to call me. You just hear your dad in the background go, Fine! Fuck it! What do I do? Why am I working if I come home to this? You can't even put a hot fucking meal on the table! You think I love you? Oh, oh, keep yelling, dad. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Stop having me to the stream. Yeah, you're gonna wake the neighbors. <laughs> that leads the shotgun and enters the son's room first. <laughs> you two must have had a fascinating adolescence. I love the part where I make my therapist break down in tears every time I see her. <laughs> this is getting too real. Lolly <laughs> <laughs> well, show took me to a dark place on the stream. People are more disturbed by that two second bit than they were the Fear and Hunger stream. Everyone during the Fear and Hunger stream, every time an enemy showed up, everyone just made the pog the pog point face at, yeah. at, a, at an enemy's dick. You can't be afraid of a naked enemy. I'm gonna. I'm divorcing. I'm divorcing. Which side of the chart do you choose? I have to choose the right side because cream pie is up top. I went with big boobs, blowjob, and just regular boobs. 
Keep yelling, Daddy. Keep yelling, Daddy. Hook up, hook up the spanking machine. <laughs> Put me in. I'm ready to go back in, Coach. A thread said it's search activity, not popularity, which doesn't make it much better. Oh, God. That makes it actually worse. <laughs> My pants feel tight. What is this? <laughs> <laughs> Mom starts throwing plates. Mom starts throwing a plates. Nothing but plates. Divorce proceedings, gone sexual, gone domestic abuse. Gone sexual. This, but she's trying to be sexy. Well, I know what ASMR is. Where's my Monster Girls? I assume that's under fantasy? Maybe? I just thought fantasy would be like, uh... Would you know, like, like, play. like, yeah. like knights and shit. The sex change being at number 20 on the left side fucks me off. I mean, gender bend is pretty popular in Japan. Yeah, but it's not gender bend. It's explicitly sex change. Hopefully that's a translation thing. Hopefully. <laughs> a popular is nugget porn. I don't know. You'll have to do the research on your own, chat. We're not going down that rabbit hole. Chat, type in nugget porn on your, on your laptop right now. Just pulled up fear and hunger. Oh my god! That's what, that's what binaural dummy heads are used for. Yes, but they're using it for porn. The horror and fear and hunger was fantasy. That rant was not fantasy. <laughs> that rant wasn't fantasy. Dad Rex shotgun. Son, you better not be winning in there. <laughs> Climax is when you have the father bang the mother's head to the dinner table. <laughs> Listen, you got to be in the right headspace, okay? So, so it, it it can't just be your parents fighting. It has to be it has to be that one t it has to be that one time where where you you tried to leave with your mom in, in the back of the car, right? But you got to the motel, okay? But your mom forgot a purse. So you had to go back home, all right? All right, but your dad was waiting, okay? So <laughs> So, so God damn. Nugget, why does McDonald's food have its own category? <laughs> it's a weird it's, it's a weird fetish, man. You make this into a hentai. <laughs> it, it'd be like one of those like reverse uh not reverse uh subversive hentais where you, <laughs> people go in expecting dumb porn and it's just this like they just cry. <laughs> it's this like grim story of, of like domestic violence and abuse. You go in expecting porn, you walk out with lucky number eleven. <laughs> yeah. It's like, you know, it's like, man, that scene where the kid had to sneak back into his own house because he had to get his mom's purse, and <laughs> he, he took just a little bit too long because he wanted to go back to his room and, and get, like, the, the teddy bear that made him feel safe, and then that's when Dad found him. That's when Dad found him. <laughs> no, you, you see, the problem is a kid could sneak in unknown, all right? But the, the, kid, the kid was afraid, so he came in behind the mom, all right? But the dad heard the mom. Yeah. That, that, that's what the problem is. Yeah. No. It's emergence. Oh, never mind. Dear God. <laughs> I ran enough literatica to know that some authors have some dark stuff they need to work out. <laughs> <laughs> damn that author. Damn that author's fucked up. The moral oral porn. <laughs> Moral oral of porn. <laughs> oh god. Contemplate guts quotes with Shrek's voice. Makes them better, chat. That's just an eighties Japanese thriller film. <laughs> That's what make it fascinating. That's what makes it great, chat. Is it gated jackets gender bend? <laughs> why do you need to, why do you need confirmation? If you're asking another man if it's gay, that makes you super fucking gay. Raped by my own furniture ASMR. <laughs> Help Oni chair, I'm stuck in the I'm stuck in the dryer. They just hear your dad's belt unbuckle. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite part my favorite part was hiding under the bed and curl up in a ball and hearing my dad go, Belt buckle <laughs> I can't have you staging upstaging me in front of the boy. Belt to buckle. Like, I'm just imagining it, so... Jack, close your eyes and picture the scene. Okay. Interior. Protagonist bedroom. 
He's with the girl he likes, and, and they're making out on the bed. Things are starting to get frisky. It's typical hentai setup where it's like, oh, you know, childhood friend, tomboy, whatever fucking tag you want. And the dad just bursts down the fucking door and goes, boy, you know you're not allowed to have sex in this house if I'm not getting any. Now, belt or buckle. Belt or buckle. I can't have you emasculating me in my own home. Now pick it. Belt or buckle. You want to look like a bitch in front of your lady friend? <laughs> I picked the buckle, Dad. Uh, That's my boy. <laughs> <laughs> then, then cut to exterior of the house, and you just hear that belt snapping <laughs> like the, the fucking... <laughs> the strikes of thunder brought down by God himself. <laughs> and the girlfriend is just walking out awkwardly, like afraid to say anything. Wait, you, the the, you, you the go, boyfriend to... screams are like a pig. He's just he's, he's just squealing. Making, he's just squealing, making any noise he can. She shows up to school the next day and she can't look him in the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Please stop, this is getting real. <laughs> Sounds like a Baki subplot. <laughs> <laughs> what choices in my life had led me here? I'm <laughs> sleeping next to my mom because I'm afraid my dad's going to kill her tonight. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, mom, dad won't get you. <laughs> Wait, they're going to do Spongebob reps. <laughs> I like the part where, where Dad just stood outside the house <laughs> screaming belt or buckle for eight hours straight before the cops came. <laughs> this is as bad as the scat rant. <laughs> the spouse abuse rant. I failed a skill check against Doom Prepper David Bowie in his underground bunker in my dream last night. My dream came true a lot, so I don't know what to think. <laughs> You're gonna lose, Nora. I'm gonna make an edit of this rap. The new season of Home Improvement is fucking wild. <laughs> it's getting too real for summer chat. <laughs> Pearl Harbor tomboy ASMR. We lost a hundred people since the beginning of the rant. A hundred people who can't handle home <laughs> who can't handle home violence chat. Well it's like it's like whiplash, you know, with JK Simmons. <laughs> you know, it's like uh the guy's making out with his girlfriend, and the dad's just sitting there staring at him, and goes, "No, no, no, you're dragging." It's you're like dragging. I, I, what, okay, and and he keeps going on. It's like now you're rushing, <laughs> and he just keeps doing that, and then he throws the fucking chair at him, and it's like, it's like now are you gonna rush? Are you gonna drag? Or are you gonna fuck her on my time? On my time. SMR <laughs> tomboy shame dad belt buckle beatings. It's like I'll be on your time. It's like, oh, are you going to cry now in front of your girl? Not my tempo! Not my tempo! More kisses! <laughs> slower! 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 <laughs> ASMR tomboy shame dad belt buckle breaking. <laughs> Mind break ASMR. You'll, you'll be a different person when you come out on the other side. <laughs> what are having just choking a bitch while you hate fucking? Why are they so fucking weird now? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I need your choice. Ten with the belt, or two on the cheeks with the buckle. And I'll take ten with the buckle. You know, J.K. Simmons is doing a lot of, like, indie stuff. We might be able to get him to do this. <laughs> I think I think he could do a Shakespearean monologue of all this. Yeah. I think he could. No protagonist stands up to the father, uh, confronting him on his abusive tendencies due to his dependence on alcohol. Then the dad just hits him. <laughs> and the dad just breaks a bottle over his skull. The s slowly it fades on screen. NTR. <laughs> he starts abusing the girlfriend too. <laughs> well, you're rushing her dragon. <laughs> Are you rushing her dragon while slipping her boy? Never calls police and her abusive father ASMR gone sexual <laughs> two hours. <laughs> At least, at least your neighbor cares about you. <laughs> That's the most heartwarming part of all. Yeah, it's like it's like one of those amateur porn that that's like made by a mar married couple trying to reignite their marriage, <laughs> and like they forget to edit out the part where they get like a noise complaint and they have to talk to the police, but they don't take off like their role play costumes. So like the the husband's still wearing like the dog mask and and the <laughs> wife is still like 
holding the fucking BDSM whip, and they're like, yeah, we're sorry, we'll, we'll, we'll keep the noise down. <laughs> we're sorry. Lolly was there, the almighty Lolly, the great ASMR porn ran. He said it'll be out when it's out, and we like that. <laughs> Maximize the domestic abuse rate. I don't know what's worse, the entire talk about already existing or someone making it because of this. <laughs> I'm the hero of this story, chat. <laughs> I'm the DM, and what I say goes. Oh, man. So one of this is going to be in The Last of Us 3. <laughs> Oh, man. It'll be a travesty if the stream gets taken down. Someone better someone better download the stream. I know, right? It can't it can't be for nothing. <laughs> this summer, a story of a father and son divided, starring J.K. Simmons and Miles Teller. A story of love. July thirty first, Netera. <laughs> This was all... This is so all for nothing. <laughs> Abby or Joel built her buckle. Cycle like abuse and violence gets passed on to his son. He starts to abuse his family. <laughs> he was so good until he finished college. All the student loans started piling up and he turned to liquor. He used to be such a good person. And then he moved back home after college. And then his dad started abusing him. When was this? He was 30. He was 30. <laughs> he just let his dad do it. <laughs> Looking for the stupid image all night. It was in my channel, Awesome Folder. <laughs> Don't take him, Virginal. Yeah. Beautiful. I'll pay for this audiobook to be read by Swagger Souls. <laughs> dad, oh. belt, belt, belt. Get discipline, get discipline, get discipline, get discipline. <laughs> Father, son, Auschwitz, the Mexican abuse, roleplay, ASMR. <laughs> what kind of porn is this? <laughs> no, it's like, uh, it's like the ring. Anytime people listen to it, they like, you know, break down in horror. <laughs> they break, they, they begin to acquire domestic abuse symptoms. Yeah. <laughs> or it's like, uh, the, the videotape from True Detective, no one can watch it without screaming. <laughs> Is that your fetish? Getting abused? I don't know, chat. You all sat through it. <laughs> it's porn of madmen. <laughs> <laughs> so there'll be voice acting from Wally and Shota as you scroll, right? It's not porn. It's just hard-hitting drama at this point. That's right. The difference between, you know, just amateur porn and hard-hitting drama is whether or not it's on HBO. No, no, chat. No, no. See... Whenever the dad takes his belt off, he also takes his pants off. There you go. There you go. There you go. No, right. you don't understand. I don't want them. I'm trying to make space for from the bag because I gotta, I gotta find a new bag to take all my shit home because the bag ripped open. Yeah. Oh, I don't know where the other bag went. Well, you tossed it because uh. You tossed it because it was also full of trash. So I, I will use this. Fair. Just abuse, not even porn, just unfiltered domestic violence. Where the fuck are the police? <laughs> that's, the, that's the comments in the live stream. That's my, that's my, I was going to say, that's my favorite Twitch yeah. stream to watch. Just Ethos getting beaten by their dad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, sad, I'm sad Twitch deletes the VODs after six months because honestly, that Amaranth stream had me howling. It's like, God damn, this Project Melody stream just got depressing. <laughs> Does her dad also have a VTuber <laughs> The VTuber dad comes on screen with his belt. It's also an anime girl. <laughs> Favorite national tragedy? Apparently this. What? <laughs> Watching Melody get beaten by her fucking her dad on her VTuber stream. <laughs> <laughs> well, Jesus Christ, guys. <laughs> People don't know if it's a type of roleplay or if they need to call 911. 
At what, at what point do you start? At what point do you give in and call the police? Is it when she screams for help, or is it when she when she gives her address? <laughs> it's like, man, she's really into this. I mean, she's like <laughs> doxing herself right now, begging for help. <laughs> Guys, I, I looked it up, and I think that's her, her apartment. Should we call the cops? <laughs> it's kind of like Perfect Blue. <laughs> yeah, remember that part of Perfect Blue where Mima's dad just starts beating her? <laughs> Stuart's got some great acting chops for a dad mid-abuse, and I can totally see Lala as a girlfriend out of her death watching her boyfriend get beaten half to death by his father. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Chatterbeach stream too, so it's in 3D. <laughs> you think Melody has any relationship with her father? <laughs> for one, for one easy payment of three thousand dollars, you too can watch your favorite VTuber get beat by a dad live on stream. <laughs> Go ahead, donate three thousand dollars to the stream. I'll set it up myself. If she doesn't have a good relationship with her father, I'll come to her house and I'll beat her myself. That's right, you have the show to guarantee. <laughs> I'll beat your feet to <laughs> I got fucking marshmallows trying to help. <laughs> Beats my dad. <laughs> shirt to work man it'd be like it'd be like a, a visit or star character this is ultra fucking rip dude putting his fucking you know putting his fist together <laughs> oh my god <laughs> bell delphine would make this on ironically <laughs> oh my god melody ain't making it out of the hood bros <laughs> The dad is just beating his son with a ball. Jack Daniels like Frank Cass from the Dirty Laundry short film. Can you talk about something normal, please? This is normal, Jack. <laughs> this is cinema, Martin Scorsese. Ken Shiro with the belt. <laughs> Beats by dad, baby. Oh, my God. Or have an abusive dad kink him. I think I know what you mean. <clears throat> you want to smoke? Oh, he deleted it. Oh my god. That woman's guilty. She's kinky. I got the belt right here. This is relatable. <laughs> That's right, Jay. <laughs> it's too late for, for normal. We went from ASMR to hentai to domestic violence. Remember that most VTuber models don't have facial expressions for sadness or crying. So you just hear the belt striking and screaming <laughs> while the JPEG smiles in the fucking corner. <laughs> Well, you know, we'll, we'll we'll go the extra mile and say that the the VTuber model is is making the Pippa surprise face. Yeah, there you go. That's right, Jay. My dad beats the shit out of me when I go. <laughs> cut away! Cut away! Cut away! That reminds me of that fucking joke where they were doing the uh, the video about the the one fucking actor they wanted to do a spotlight on. <laughs> uh, I don't fucking remember. Uh, give me a second. Oh yeah. god. Jamie uh, pulled that clip of Pippa crying after getting beaten by her dad. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know her on that bitch yet? No, Dad, I love her. Whack. Whack. Oh, man. Yeah, Kyle Gardner. It was a Kyle Gardner special. Uh, fucking, uh, they were telling the story of like, when Jay had to be a body double for him on the Nightmare on Elm Street remake. <laughs> and he's like, yeah, apparently I look the exact same as him. And Mike just says... Well, it's good to know if I ever met Kyle Gardner in real life, I could whoop his fucking ass. <laughs> That's right, Jay. I can whoop your fucking ass. <laughs> I clapped when the dad beat her daughter. When the dad beat his daughter with the belt, I clapped. <laughs> just consume product. Don't ask questions. <laughs> just consume product. Don't ask questions. Just consume abuse. <laughs> Oh my god. It broke new ground. <laughs> it broke her ribs. It broke her skin. <laughs> I 
All right, campers, in today's challenge. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> How does it feel when your dad hits you? It feels great, Jay! <laughs> Beats my dad. <laughs> I'm planning on becoming a male VTuber, so I'm going to beat myself. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, with that, we, we've got to call it. That, that, is, that is too good to, Thir to let fade minutes. away. 30 minutes. 30 minutes. <laughs> that is too good to let fade away. <laughs> we, we're, we're calling it here the, the absolute pitch-perfect <laughs> ending. We, we, we start a game about Lovecraftian horror and exploring the depths of a dungeon. We end with... We find out that the real horror was the dads we made along the way. <laughs> it was about the dads watching us along the way. <laughs> ne we'll never fade away. You've peaked for the stream. Turn it off. I shoot the lights out. Till it's bright out Oh, just another lonely night Are you willing to sacrifice your life? Bitch, I'm a monster, no good blood sucker Fat motherfucker, now look who's in trouble As you run through my jungles, all you hear is rumbles Kanye West samples, here's one for example Gossip, gossip, nigga, just stop it Everybody know I'm a motherfucking monster I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert Profit, profit, nigga, I got it Everybody know I'm a motherfucking monster I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert I'ma need to see your fucking hands uh, the best living or dead, hands down, huh? Let's talk more here right now, huh? And my eyes more red than the devil is And I'm about to take it to another level, bitch Now who you going with, yeah, ain't nobody cold as this Do the rap and the track, triple double, no assist And my only focus is staying on some bogus shit Arguing with my older bitch, acting like I owe a shit I heard the beat, the same raps that gave the track pain Bought the chain that always give me back pain Fucking up my money, so yeah, I had to act sane Shy nigga, but these hoes love my act sane She came up to me and said, this the number two dial If you wanna make it number one, you're number two now Bitch, that goose in Malibu, I call it Malibu, yeah Goddamn, easy, I would hit him with a new style Know that motherfucker, well, what you gonna do now? Whatever I wanna do, gosh, it's cool now Now I'm gonna do, ah, it's new now Think you motherfucker really, really need to cool out Cause you'll never get on top of this So mommy best advice is just to get on top of this Have you ever had sex with a pharaoh? I put the pussy in a sarcophagus Now she claiming that I bruise her esophagus Head of the class and she just wanna swallow shit I'm living in the future so the presence is my past My presence is a present, kiss my ass Gossip, gossip, nigga just stop it Everybody know I'm a motherfucking monster I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert Profit, profit, nigga I got it Everybody know I'm a motherfucking monster I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert I'ma need to see your fucking hands Sasquatch, Godzilla, King Kong, Loch Ness, Goblin, Ghoul, a zombie with no conscience. Question, what do these things all have in common? Everybody knows I'm a motherfucking monster. Conquer, stop your, stop your silly nonsense. Nonsense, none of you niggas know where the swamp is. None of you niggas have seen the carnage that I've seen. I still hear fiends scream in my dreams. Murder, murder, and black convertibles. I kill a block, I murder the avenues. I Rape and pillage of village women and children Everybody wanna know what my Achilles heel is Love, I don't get enough of it All I get is these vampires and bloodsuckers All I see is these niggas I made millionaires Milling about, spilling their feelings in the air All I see is these fake fucks with no fangs Trying to draw blood from my ice cold veins I smell a massacre Seems to be the only way to back you back Gossip, gossip, nigga just stop it Everybody know I'm a motherfucking monster I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert Profit, profit, nigga I got it Everybody know I'm a motherfucking monster I'ma need to see your fucking hands at the concert I'ma need to see your fucking hands Pull up in a monster automobile gangster With a bad bitch that came from Sri Lanka Yeah, I'm in a tanga, color a Willy Wonka You could be the king, but watch the queen conquer okay. First things first, I'll eat your brain Then I'ma start rocking gold teeth and fame Cause that's what a motherfucking monster do He a dresser from Milan, that's the monster do Monster just a be heel, that's the monster show Young money is the roster and a monster crow And I'm all up, all up, all up in the bank with a funny face And if I'm fake, I ain't no 
day now Never meaning what they say now Never saying what they mean While they while away the hours In their ivory towers Till they're covered up with flowers In the back of a black limousine Whoa, la la da da Talking about you and me and the game people play now. Will we make one another cry? Break a heart and we'll say goodbye. Cross our hearts and we'll hope to die. That the other was to blame. Oh, huh? But neither one will ever give in. So we gaze on an age but ten. Thinking about the things that might have been. And it's a dirty rotten shame. Oh, huh? la da 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 Turn your back on humanity, oh, and you don't give a 